In the last decade, there's very few games that have made an impact the way Breath of the Wild has. The funny thing is, it hasn't even really done anything groundbreaking. I mean, I think people often forget that the very first Legend of Zelda game was also open world. But what Breath of the Wild did right was reward exploration and creativity in the largest Hyrule sandbox to date. Now, take that game and add a whole nother layer to it by bringing in sky islands, vehicle crafting, weapon fusing, and more. It's actually a little surreal how Tears of the Kingdom is finally here because we were completely shrouded in mystery for so long that we spent 95% of the last four years just calling it Breath of the Wild 2. But I've beaten Age of Calamity, I've beaten Breath of the Wild, so it's finally time to close out what I assume is a trilogy, and if you want to follow along in the adventure, be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any new videos, because there's a chance that you're watching this unsubbed, and we can't have that, can we? Oh, we're just starting this off by going deep in the cave. This strange gloom keeps getting thicker. Something tells me we have no right to be here. We've been descending for a while now. These tunnels are deeper than I thought. Did you bring any snacks? What could be down here? Uh, I'm getting kind of hungry. Oh, that's Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. I would have never guessed. Bro, they threw me right into the game. There was no title screen. It was just Nintendo Presents and like, here you are. 0.5 seconds later, gameplay. Fortunately, I just, I'm fresh off Breath of the Wild, so I feel like I'm just continuing my journey. People have been falling ill after coming into contact with the gloom drifting through these caverns. Though here it seems almost misty and not concentrated enough to harm us. This is just going to be a, a Last of Us parallel. We'll keep going. Let's go solve this mystery. Hmm. Master Sword. Uh, what about it? Hmm. Must be sensing something. The Master Sword's like. <laughs> I knew we had a reason for concern. Ever since the end of the calamity, Castle has fallen into neglect. But hmm. I could have never imagined anything like these tunnels were hiding here. We <laughs> must be careful as we move deeper. Girl, I got full hearts, full stamina. A few moments later. Ooh. It's funny that like the original teaser we got is like the first three minutes of the game. Oh, it's hands and and a tear of the kingdom. Uh oh, you had to go and touch the hand. And, oh my God, that's creepy. Ah, oh, what the? Uh, okay. Boss fight right now. Oh no! Oh, ah, my arm! My, get it off! Get it off me! Get it off me! Okay, so that's how we lose the master sword and uh and our right arm. Really solid opening though. What did what happened? We broke the sword. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? Uh, oh carries that fragile sword. A link. Bro, you're literally made of bones. Loro placed his faith in you. And that was all you could do. Here, watch this. Blood demon art. Uh, dude's gonna he's gonna ruin the place. We just saved it. Oh, you're gonna you lift it off the ground. Just gonna take the castle. Okay. Real original. You know Bowser's done that, right? He's like, oh my arm. Not gonna be able to use this. You gonna catch her. Save her. Save her. No, use the good arm. Oh crap. Wait, what is this weird arm? Who is who is saving me? Everyone else was like, huh, our Amazon Echoes didn't say anything about this in the weather today. Okay, so somebody put all their energy into my arm. Link is the bionic commando now. You think his arm kind of feels like when your leg falls asleep, pins and needles? I got the Zonai arm now. That's the only explanation here. That some Zonai was looking after us. Link, finally you wake. Oh, who's this? I'm hearing voices. I've heard a great deal about you from Zelda. I got like a freaky necrotic appendage now, and I'm naked. Why am I naked? Your wounds were severe. I am relieved to see you escape death. Uh, thank you? Your arm, however, was beyond saving. I had to replace it, lest the injury endanger you further. By the way, you're part cyborg now. You're welcome. And just like in Breath of the Wild, we are naked with nothing in a cave. And here's our master stub. Don't worry, this one won't, uh, it won't drain your hearts when you pick it up. <laughs> 
the jingle was just hesitant. It was like, uh, like here, you could, I guess you could swing that thing. I don't really know what it's going to do. In fact, that burnt part is probably going to like fall off soon. What's this? I don't know how to operate this kiosk. Ooh, going on here. I activated something. I got no stamina. I got no hearts. I got a stumpy ass sword. It's left me out here in my boxer briefs. I got no shoes on. And Link goes for the high dive. And ooh, that splash. It's gonna cost them a few points. Zero, 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 zero. All right, let's kick this open. Or, huh? Archaic legwear. Looking good, my man. Okay, so wait, before we do this, before we do this, I know this is going to be the shot. I just, I want to soak this in for a second because I have a feeling this is going to be very similar. Or maybe it's not. Maybe it's just like, hey, jump. <laughs> hey, where are we going? Where are we dropping, boys? Or maybe it is the shot. What are you thinking, Link? Twisty Towers? Or, or whatever the hell we have in uh, the Fortnite map now? Ah, the title, there it is! I'm so hyped right now, you guys have no idea. Buckle up for what is likely going to be one of the best series I've ever done. All right, we accelerate by holding R and we could dive dive. All right, we're on the Great Sky Island. And also, um, I just wanna let you guys know that I am not going to be playing this the same way that I played Breath of the Wild. I was trying to get through Breath of the Wild fast in time for this game, so I wasn't really, oh, here we go, a tree branch. I wasn't exploring, I skipped a lot of stuff. That's not going to be the case here. I'll likely be doing a lot of off-screen grinding with shrines and stuff, because I'm not gonna be able to only play this game when I'm recording, but the main story will be videos. Oh, hello, Zona, are you, are you bad? You're gonna hurt me, aren't you? You got a tree branch, you idiot. How is the tree branch stronger than the nub of the master sword? There's no way. Die! Give me that branch. Beat your zone I ass. And then, um, the zone I charge. A material used as a power source for constructs and other devices. Its strange light seems to reveal potent energy inside. Unleash the power of the sun! Contains 5% juice. I just tried to use my glider and I realized I don't have one. All I have is a tree branch and a dream. Was this over here? Um. Ooh, you're. You are creepy. I don't like the way you move. Oh, God. Please be friendly. Excuse me, what the actual f*** are you doing in my house? Link, I have waited for you. Princess Zelda left something for you in my care. He's British. Ah, uh, there we go. We got the Nintendo Switch. This is the Poraped. By the way, cool tattoos. Okay, Link, we don't have time to play games right now. My records indicate that Princess Zelda is waiting at the location marked on its map. My message has been delivered. Where am I? We are in the Garden of Time. The Temple of Time is visible for- Oh yeah, everything's up in the sky now. Temple of Time. More like the Temple of Sky... Mm. Oh brother, this guy stinks! Find Princess Zelda. You gotta tell me twice, that's literally all I do. Let's go find Zelda. She's apparently waiting for me up here in the Temple of Time. That's the Temple of Time. It looks like a concert venue. Oh, God. All right. You got a shield. You know, I'm taking that shield, right? I'm tired. I do not have reflexes right now. It is 1.30. I have done six hours of yard work today, and then I cleaned out my garage. A rusty broadsword. An old wooden shield. And I'm using the broadsword. I ain't afraid of weapons breaking. All right, where is this lady? Oh, Zelda. Please place your gross hand here. Oh, you did it wrong. That door will open only to those with sufficient power. Who are you? I'm sorry. I did not intend to startle you. It was I that spoke to you earlier. That arm originally belonged to me. I am Raru. Raru, source of the right arm. Forgive me for appearing to you in this manner. Unfortunately, I no longer have a I'm dead, form. by the way. Um, so, I'm a ghost. No one else can see me, so they're gonna think you're crazy. In any case, that arm should allow you to open this door. It seems to have lost the power to do so. Why not visit the shrines on this island? Oh, going back to the shrines now. They look a little different. They look like eggs. Actually, that looks like an almond. I'm so happy that this game is out now because, like, now 
we can be in that honeymoon phase again where um where like everyone is watching people discover stuff for the first time and there's gonna be like a whole bunch of like just cool discoveries happening and I, i'm just i'm really excited for this god there is so much new stuff to explore let's actually go do the shrine the uko shrine back in my day shrines had an elevator like, oh, okay step on in this is weird Ah, good, you made it. This is a shrine of light. Long ago, I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe this light will restore an ability your right arm has lost. Hmm. Now, extend your hands. <laughs> Link's still not used to it. He's like, damn, I still this gross-ass arm. Oh, hang on. Getting something. Getting feeling back in my, my ring finger. You got Ultra Hand! What a badass name for it. <laughs> like, wh what do we call this uh, ability that allows you to freely move objects and, and just attach them. I don't know, how about Ultra Hand? That's good, that's good. Bob was suggesting Mega Hand, but Ultra Hand is better. Ultra Hand now, so I can pick this up, plop that down here, and now I'm gonna watch this. I'm gonna make a real long one. Put that there. Played a lot of games with crafting in my... No, wait, not like that. Unstick, come on, come on, get unstick. Oh, you gotta wiggle it. That's weird. I wanna rotate it that way. There we go. All right. This is gonna take a little getting used to. Now I just made one really long bridge. Look at that. A little bit of gorilla glue. That's all you need. What do you What do you want me to make? Oh. Okay. It It's It's weird. Un unstick it. How do I? I want it upright. There we go. I don't even know how I got it to the angle that I did. Now we're gonna take this thing, this beautiful contraption that I absolutely invented, put it on here. That Link is like a modern day Leonardo da Vinci, just inventing stuff on the fly. Not like the Futurama Leonardo da Vinci either. You've done well to reach this place. Oh, it's like, it's him and, uh, and his Hylian wife, and not like a decrepit old Sheikah. These are more upscale shrines. Here, take this light orb. By the power of Grayskull! The light of blessing, a crystal that glows with a light that purges ancient evil and purifies with its radiance. May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. Thank you, and you too. Oh, got dark out while I was inside. Oh, hey, there you are. Did very well getting through that last shrine. You've restored an ability. This is wonderful. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you should be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. There's one. Mark that one. That might be the only one that I can see right now. So you know what? We'll head over there. I got Ultra Hand now. I can do anything except for maybe um jump off something and glide. Oh, hang on, hang on. Here's some spicy peppers. Maybe I can, and it's right next to the fire. So I think what it's telling me here, the clever video game design is telling me to cook something spicy. So I get, the, wow, seven minutes cold resistance. And then we go get the next shrine. You know, you just eat a little curry and then you can withstand the cold. Now I don't have a ton of time to explore here. I only have seven minutes. So I, oh, hang on, here's more peppers. Then again, I like, I don't know if up there is also going to be cold because it kind of seems like there's different biomes depending on, ooh, hang on a second. I'm gonna be able to use the boat here. Hello, confirming raft and Zonai device operational status. Ah, pardon my rudeness. Do you require a raft? The ones by the riverbank are ready for use. The Zonai device has also been inspected. That's the fan. I didn't know Zonai invented fans, but hang on, you need an energy cell to use this thing. My devices are essential on this island. I will give you my spare energy cell because I'm a great person. So I have another meter that I have to worry about now. Assuming, you know, this cell doesn't run out. Or, oh, sorry. All right, let's go. Oh, it should probably be in the water. Like, don't use that one. You Use the one that's in the water, you idiot. Let's go. So I assume I can turn it off, refill, turn it back on. Look at that ingenuity at its finest. Oh, there it is. The magic almond. In fact, I'm going to tweet that. And uh, just a friendly reminder that you guys should go follow me on social media platforms if you want. I'm on Twitter and Instagram and TikTok. The guacamole shrine. 
Guan- Guantanamo Bay. You guys remember the second Harold and Kumar movie they made? I remember when the first movie came out and people thought White Castle was this huge novelty when it's something that I've had next to me my entire life. I haven't had White Castle in a very, very long time. But I can tell you when I do, I feel awful. But it is great. So we've oh. made it here. Now then, extend your right hand. This one? Yeah, that's your right, Link. All right, we're going to get a new ability here. Oh, it sends. Now we can go through the roof. Okay, uh, this is definitely one of the abilities that I'm most hyped about. Because instead of having to, like, climb all this stuff, I can just go over here. <laughs> Woo! Right here. Come on, just getting stuck. Imagine getting stuck halfway through. That's got to be a nightmare. Ah, there's a chest here. Finally, a decent weapon. Let's get rid of... I also like that instead of closing the chest, it's asking me if I want to drop something. So I'm going to drop this piece of crap. Oh, bring it. But this music kind of sounds like the underground music, like the cave music from Super Mario World. I'll we'll probably cut those and then ascend. That's why they gave me the axe, so I can... Cut one, two, then we ascend right through. Come on. How high can you ascend? Is there, like, a limit? Or can I just go, like, as high as something is? I like this a lot. This is dope. Hello, I have made it by turning myself into a jelly-like substance. Here, take this blessing. All right. Shrine number two done. So we're going to send over here now. Uh, I like how this is a wheel now. Make it much easier than having to scroll through. Oh, that's what happens. Go for a little dip. I can ascend through here. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, there was a... Go back. Go back. There was a chest. Oh, finally, some clothes. All right, we don't have a shirt, though. I feel like there might have been a shirt somewhere that I missed. So, um, I just, I gotta do this whole thing shirtless now. There had to be, right? Because, like, I got the pants. Unless, you know, Link just wants to show off his cool new tattoo. I'm gonna put this rock here because I feel like completing the circle will probably give me something. Oh, I was right. And it's our first Korok. I need about 350. Hey, hey, you're not Hestu. But you see me? I didn't know someone like you could see the children of the forest. Better the children of the forest than the children of the corn. Oh, if you see him, return him. Oh, God, not again. They're going to troll us, and we're going to have to do it all over again just to get the same piece of Korok shit. Whatever these things are, we're going to commandeer one. All right, how does this work? What, what are we doing with this? Oh, this reminds me. I have to go pick up my amiibo. I pre-ordered it, and I could have swore that I had it set for a delivery, but I got to go pick it up. Yep, that looks right and safe. I can grab this. What can I do with it? I don't really know. Oh, I know what this is. This is a power supply unit. Oh, hello. Oh, wait a second. I know what this is. This is the giant gachapon machine that Nintendo was talking about. My maintenance duties are complete for today. It's been another cycle with no visitor. What? This is a rarity. It is unusual for me to receive visitors here. Would you like to use the device dispenser? You have a one in 10 chance of pulling what you need. Oh, this is where I exchange the horns and the charges. Okay. All right. Well, I've been slaying Zonai, so let's, uh, let's try this out. I don't know how much I need to hold. Is more, like, better? Uh, let's see. I put three in. Put a charge and, and two horns. Let's see what comes out. Oh, you get one for each. Okay, so got a wing, got a wing, and a fan. My guess is I probably need more than one fan, right? There's no way one fan is going to get the job done. All right, let's see. Fan, fan. I'm going to go for four fans. I don't know if I need that many, but I feel like in the trailer, probably had four. So this is a flame emitter. It shoots fire. It's used for protection against monsters. That's cool. What else is in here? Link, I think you might have a problem, man. Huh? Did I just get something rare? Did I get a hollow? A portable pot. Used for cooking food almost anytime, anywhere. All right, I think I got everything. Let's try this again. Put this thing together myself. Doesn't even come with instructions. Okay, that, that's that gotta be how to do it. Is there like a rail system? Drop it in here. Oh, there is, okay, hit it. There we go. All right, I'm set. Oh wait, that one's upside down. Oh no, no, don't fall. All right, we can get out of this snowy area now. I have ultra hands. I can probably go make my own boat now with blackjack and hookers. Ah, you know what? Forget the boat. All right, now with the ability to ascend, I want to check out this island up here, which seems inaccessible until you get this. I'm going to zip right through. Reach that, right? 
It doesn't say like how high you can go. Maybe I can't? Oh, well, let me up. Let me up. Huh, guess not. What about the top of the Temple of Time? I can't go in the door. They never said anything about the roof. Maybe I could just... Oh, hang on. No, oh, that's a thing we can do. I also need to get some high ground because I don't know where the next shrines are. You know, we could probably get higher ground. Am I right, Red Hot Chili Peppers? I don't know if this is the way I have to go, but why not try the top of the Temple of Time? That seems fun. Whoa, what is up here? This looks like a Colosseum. I don't know if there's anything I could do up here yet. All right, if I was the next shrine, where would I be? There's one. Sneaky little eggs. Location confirmed. Um, I just realized, how the hell am I getting down? <laughs> just gotta be really careful climbing down, that's all. Just, oh God, no! No! I hit the dive button. <laughs> you could ascend, but there is no descend. The descend, it turned out to just be death. Now this is traveling in style. Also, this is extremely unsafe. I just want to see how long I can make something and just kill enemies from far away. All right, bridge has been crossed. We don't have any more fans. I feel like we're probably going to need one soon. Uh-oh. We stumbled upon a zone I can't... Ow. Idiot. Die. Oh, cut the tree down. Didn't mean to do that. You see that, pal? See what happened to your homies? You gotta tell me about crits. I know how crits work. Oh, this is our first camp box. Back to getting precious metals. All right, we are getting close to the next shrine. Oh, that might hurt. Yeah, that hurt. Probably shouldn't have jumped there. I really need the sailcloth. A glider, whatever. I, I need something to descend. How are we going to cross this? There has to be something nearby that will allow me to make a raft. There's an enemy nearby. I hear it. Where are you? Where are you? Oh! Gooey boys! Let's make a raft. Get on the raft, and we're sailing. All right, I see the next shrine over there, so go take care of that. I'm hoping that's Fuse. Because I really want to start making goofy-ass weapons. All right, get out of my way. I got powers to get. Be me if uh, someone told me I could attain real-life superhero powers. Just be pushing children out of the way. The Inisa Shrine. Please be Fuse. Please be Fuse. Please be Fuse. It is Fuse. All right, let's see how this thing works. It is a boulder. I can fuse it to my stone axe. Oh, that's already fused. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to take a stick or branch. And then, bah! <laughs> we got a hammer now. I'm gonna break this thing. Boom! Mm, open up! Open the door! If you think I'm done breaking stuff, you're silly. Some good durability on this, too. It's a real sturdy hammer. You could really smash a lot of stuff. This thing is not breaking. I mean, that took quite a beating before. Uh, oh my god. Look at all the fire fruit. Use attack power. Fruit that generates heat when struck. Do I fuse it to like... I get it. This is how I make fire arrows. I, I see what you're putting down, Anuma. I, I see. So what I'm going to do here is... That's not what I meant to do. Uh, I can attach... There we go. I was wondering how I did that. You have to have it in your inventory, and then from there, you can just attach it to the arrow. And I can just fire whatever I want. Pun not intended. Okay, small key. I was not going to be able to get through without that, so... Good thing I figured that out with my giant brain. So it looks like we have three more abilities. I don't know if they're going to be older abilities. Now we're going to fight, huh? All right. He's like, you ain't getting near me. But yeah, well, I'm going to light you on fire. Come over here. Stupid. <laughs> Burn alive. Die! Kick your ass. What do you think you're doing? Don't you know you're not supposed to throw stones if you live in a shrine? The captain construct. That was fun. Let's get out of here. I see you've restored some power to that new arm of yours again. Okay, I could go open the door now. He's like, just get over there fast. She's waiting for you. A board guster. That's it. I'll huff and I'll puff. And wait, 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 wait. Go in the water. I'll short circuit you. They're like, ah, we can't swim. We're robots! Alright, hold up, though. The board guster might be the funniest weapon that we've gotten yet. It's like the bellows in Super Smash Brothers. You can just gust enemies off the ledge. Um... <laughs> go! Go! 
I feel like I'm in the Flying Dutchman ship. You're good. You're good. You're good. It's all right. Whatever gets the job done. This thing's just a rental. Just when I thought I was going to have a nice, calm trek over to where Zelda is, they threw a damn minecart stage at me. Mining cave. Well, do I want to go in this way? That's very dark, but I just picked up something I feel like could probably illuminate. Let's take this guy. Let's put a pan on it. This is a Donkey Kong game now. There we go. I'm going to go into the dark cave. I don't know what's in there, but we're going to find out. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, that was... Okay. That was much shorter than I thought it was going to be. Oh, can I not... Was it far in here? Hello? I'm going to be like, hey, don't go in there. This cave is especially dark. What are you doing? You need a light. Do you have any bright bloom seeds? Use them to light your way. Do I just throw them on the ground? Happy birthday to the ground! I got light arrows now. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. And that, that is how you light up uh, dark caves. Hey, what's in here? I feel like probably coming up on something dangerous, like uh, like lava. Huh? Oh, apologies. I was focused on processing zonite, the unique mineral that can be mined for. I don't know if I can mine yet. Oh, if I make a hammer. Let me try that. Ah, there we go. What do I do now? Do I bring it over to the lava and melt it? How many do you require? Oh, you gotta trade for them. This is a store. There we go. Okay, we could drop it in there. Oh, okay, that didn't work. I dropped my zonite all over the place. Just kidding. I, I guess I just do it this way. Crystallized charge. How many do I require? I guess three. I wanted to do it myself. All right. Off we go. Ah, this is cool. Yeah, I'm taking that with me. The employees are like, sir, you can't take the ride. What I can do is I can go up the other way by making like a makeshift sky rail. Oh, I don't need the thing in the middle, but I'm assuming I'm going to. Might as well just take it with me, right? Oh, wait, 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 no, 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 get out, get out. I didn't see it was broken. Oh, I guess uh, not using the rail system. Just the hook seems to have disappeared. I think it's kind of crazy they have this ancient technology. It's like, how does it work? One thing I'm going to say is in Breath of the Wild, you had to find creative ways to like scale walls and stuff. Here it's different because everything is its own floating island. So I think it requires definitely more critical thinking. Is this a Zonai Tower? Just try and destroy it, right? Lux Contra. Whoa, shit. Oh, I pissed off Optimus Prime. Oh my god. Bro, what the hell is this thing? I. Oh god. I see what I have to hit. I'm gonna try. Its eyeball is on its foot. Alright, where is it? This. I, I see. It goes somewhere new. Dude, what are we fighting? Yeah. There we go. I'm fighting like a Evangelion angel. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here aside from like this. It seems to be working though. Not gonna lie, I thought this would be a lot harder of a fight. But I seem to be doing okay. Let me try something here. Oh, I broke him apart. Okay, let's get over there. Rubik's Cube. I, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. All right, one more. Come on. Die! Dude, what are we getting for this? Probably a lot of parts. Yep. And then whatever the hell this thing is. What is that? Hang on, I wanna see something. Oh, what? Link's doing his best Negan cosplay right now. Hot digging a dog. You know, I gotta say, I cannot wait to have a paraglider and fast travel. This man traversing some of this stuff is exhausting. Not a complaint. I like the game. Please don't take that as a complaint. Let the hate flow through you. All right, let's just zip through here. I'm gonna go kick the door open to the Temple of Time that I can. Oh, by the way, I found a shirt. Just stumbled into a cave and opened a chest, and there it was. So Link is a little more dressed now. All right, let's... What's in here? More importantly, who's in here? And is that a tear of the kingdom? Yeah, touch it. Ding! Oh, ah, oh, that's blinding. Link, shake my hand. I'm like, oh, you're not, you're not grossed out by it? So, fun fact, the last shrine that I did, uh, where we got rewind, my mic just wasn't working. My audio was just like, nah, I'm gonna nope out of this one. For some reason, my mixer decided to go to sleep. I gotta go push the door open that I wasn't strong enough to push open. I mean, I only had three hearts. I don't know why they think if I get one more that I'll be good. All right, let's go pray to the statue. Do you want a fourth heart? Well, it's all you get. Here you go. Oh, hey, that didn't feel right. 
Nothing about that felt right. I don't feel so good. Go and bring peace to the world, but first, match up your hands and push this door open. Okay, is four hearts enough? Come on, Link, it's just a door, man. Actually, four hearts might be just enough. Come on, push! Push! Ooh, got a tingly feeling in my hands. Does he got like spider senses? Where he's like necrotic hand senses tingling. Or, or maybe they're not because he probably has no feeling in that arm. So I have a question to ask about the arm, but I, I can't because I need this video to stay monetized. So <laughs> if the comment section wants to ask it for me or ask what they think that I'm thinking. Our time together has been brief. I am so happy that we finally met. You are exactly as Zelda said. I've done everything I can for her. It's all up to you now. Now it is up to you. Get, I hooked you up with that last one, even before the shrine. Now I must go. Takes him a couple extra seconds. He's just standing there awkwardly. He's like, I'm, I'm going. Just, I promise, I'm leaving now. You and your buddy say goodbye, and then you walk the same way to your cars. All right, there's, a, there's another one waiting for me. Is that a blessing? What is this? What is this light? Yeah, touch it. Oh, my... King Kai martial arts school uh, hand is glowing now. Oh, wait. Master sword. Master nub. Master stub? Maybe this will restore, like, a little bit of it. Probably what I gotta do here. I just gotta restore the master sword. Just a little bit, maybe. What is happening? Where are you? Oh, here you go. I just emailed that over here real quick. It's ringing. Um, hello? Right, I'll tell you what. Did I just warp the sword out of there? Is it gone? I don't know where this is going, but please fix it. Huh? What is that? Is that Rayquaza? I know it's Rayquaza. It just... I've always said Rayquaza, and I'm not going to change now. Just accept it. Smoke is clearing. And... Link, you must find me. I will. You want me to jump, don't you? The Kingdom of Hyrule. Right, I'm gonna get a running start. <laughs> yeah! Please land in the water. It's a pretty big body of water. There's no way we're gonna miss that. I hope it's deep though, because otherwise, ouch. If I would have hit the lily pad, would that have killed me? Probably, right? Wow, we're on the ground now. Hyrule Kingdom, we made it. We're back on the ground. Never been so happy to be back. And there's the damn castle. We just fixed it. Wow, it's kind of crazy seeing all of Hyrule blacked out right now. And also, I can swap back and forth between sky and surface. Right now, I got to rediscover all of this. And I'm wondering how it's going to have changed, if at all. Hey, remember me? Oh, yeah, you do. Like this guy. You're like, yeah, I remember this guy. I kind of want to use the Flux Core Smasher because it seems cool, but I'm not going to waste it just yet. Instead, I'm going to paddle your ass. How do you got a makeshift weapon? How are you fusing stuff? Ah, good old Moblin Fangs. I missed those. Ow! Bastard. Don't think that I forgot that I could still shield board. So what are we doing? Divine Beasts again? Like, how's this going to go? It's kind of crazy how many hours I'm going to pour into this game. Like, I already know it. I feel like I'm going to have to do everything. I didn't feel like that Breath of the Wild. But I also feel like because I didn't do it, I missed out on it. And now I have to do it for this game. Link? Mr. Link? Is that really you? I didn't even talk to Mondi at all in my playthrough. No one's seen you or Princess Zelda since you went under the castle to investigate the gloom. And that's when the castle rose into the air. Everyone, you, you should have started with that. Aura's barely slept. She's been trying to figure out where you two went. Get in there and talk to her. Look out landing. Ah, it's nice to be in civilization amongst people and not ancient robots trying to destroy me. Those footsteps. I recognize those footsteps. Ah, good old Robbie. Hey, you, where have you been? Your head get bigger. D don't answer that. Tell me later. For now, you should hurry and go talk to Pora. I'm going, I'm going. Everyone calm down. I'm back. Did you think I was just going to die just like that? Now, where have you been? You got a minute? You're going to want to sit down for this. Linky, you're not a ghost, are you? Don't poke me. That looks pointy. That looks interesting. Like, oh, what's with the arm? I could upgrade that. One step at a time. What exactly happened? You saying you came from up there? Not only did I come from up there, I jumped. This Rauru you met. 
think that's what the first king of Hyrule was named. Are they one and the same? So much of this doesn't make sense yet, but I'm certain the mummy you found under the castle must be related to the upheaval. Castle rising up, ruins falling down from the sky, and then there's the most important detail of all. You sure that you heard the princess speak to you? That she gave you a clear message to find her? Here's the thing, are we just not gonna find her? Whether Zelda asked me to find her or not, I'm gonna try to find her. But I need you to meet up with the search party up by Hyrule Castle. The captain in charge of the search is named Haas. Man, what a mess. Oh, look, there's another shrine over there. This one is uh, combat training. Okay. This is going to be a minor test of strength. Yeah, I'm gonna beat that ass. What do you got? You got a bow and a sword? They're just teaching me how to flurry rush. I don't need no more tutorials. This poor guy, he's just the training dummy. Duh! He was just put there to die. Poor, unfortunate construct. I like the look of the new shrines, but I think I like the look of the old shrines better. Like, whoever's the interior decorator, they did a great job. I think I just prefer the aesthetic of Breath of the Wild shrines on the inside a little bit more. Please don't hurt me. Oh, I don't like the look of that. I was waiting for it to just turn into, like, one of those cartoon smoke fingers and just lure me towards, like, a delicious pie. Open up. All right, we'll just sneak our way in. Wow, amazing line of defense you have here. Huh? Who's there? Just me. You know, the guy who everyone thought was dead. All right, we gotta go talk to... What was his name again? Oz? Oz about that. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm tired. I've been playing all day. It's leading me somewhere, this gloom. Is this the gloom or is this something else? Oh, I wonder if there's any intact weapons left anywhere in the world. What about the weapons? During the upheaval, all the weapons, swords, spears, claymores, you name it, suddenly decayed. Are there really just no weapons anymore? They're also a real pain to repair, so the best thing to do is strengthen them. Anyway, thanks for finding the spear that I'm I'm going to just take now. It's like I've searched everywhere for these weapons. They don't exist anymore. Here, watch this. What do you think about that? Where's my man Haas? He got me climbing the brick walls. Sorry, but I'm in the middle of something. Oh, Link, is that you? You're alive. And all in one piece, it looks like. Hang on, you're alone? But you heard the princess calling out to you, and you're here to help with the search? Captain, it's Princess Zelda. How can you see that? What kind of eyesight do you have, sir? Oh, where are you going? Princess Zelda's like, sorry, my planet needs me. Poof. Back up to the Sky Islands. You saw that too. None of us are crazy, right? Like, please get back to Pora. The good thing about Pora is I can fast travel there. Or close enough. What is this? Pose? Pose. Pose? And we got hose. Yeah, I, I found this when I was walking around, and I can't wait to beat somebody with a hoe. Anyway, let's go talk to Pora. Be like, uh, yeah, we saw Zelda, and she turned into, like, a cornflake and, like, floated away. Did you find anything? You're telling me she started... <laughs> yes, that's exactly what I'm telling you. Well, I guess we should dig into the upheaval. I've got a few regions in mind to start exploring. I bet we'll pick up clues about where she flew off to as we look around. Oh, yeah, you still got that Pora pad, right? Can I see it for a second? Aha! I forgot that before we can look at your overall map of Hyrule. We need to add map data from right around Lookout Landing. And for that, we need our Skyview Tower. Outwardly structure looks to be complete. I gotta climb that thing? Oh, but the travel point is still undergoing final adjustments. Sorry about this, Linky. I'll fix it up quick. Just hang tight. And if you need clothes for your travels, because you look like shit, go to Mub's shop and get some new drip. You know what? Let's do that. Let's see uh, what kind of clothes we could switch out to. All right, let's see. So... We have the tunic, which is 130. I'll buy the hood for now. It's all I can afford, so I don't want to just like empty everything that I picked up. So that'll do for now. All right, let's go to this tower and turn this bad boy on. Hey! All right, we're ready to pull the switch. That looks dangerous. This is so makeshift. All right, we they're firing flares for some reason. I guess that's like gonna show me where the other ones are and I have to go activate all the towers now. All the Skyview Towers have now been activated. Yeah. Okay, it's your turn. Ah, just like old times. Hold the parapet over the terminal. Outdated technology. Only thing is, you need a paraglider when you're scanning. It takes a lot of skill, and nobody here has had what it takes. Please give me a paraglider. Please. For the love of God. Thank you. All right, let's start with a test scan. Yeah, go stand in that circle. It's not going to hurt, I promise. Oh, God. Like when Doc Ock lost control of his arms. Oh, hey, I got this thing. I got this thing. Leave me alone. Oh, God. Wait, they're going to launch me? This is so cool. 
Why am I tethered? Oh, I get it. They launch me up. I get a good look. Take some pictures. All right, all the necessary information has been downloaded. After spending four seconds in the air, I could map out this entire region. Do I get to dive back down or is it just... Oh, okay, here we go. What's that over there? Oh, that's the castle. What is that over there? All right. Oh, God, collide. Oh. <laughs> that button is kind of dangerous. Being able to fast fall. Okay, so uh, that was kind of fun and I would like to do it again, please. There are Skyview Towers in every region in the world. You'll want to make a point of visiting all of them. All right, so we're going to have to hit every region like we did last time. The first report comes in from Hebert to the northwest, and then Elden in the northeast, and then Gerudo in the southwest. And let me guess. Oh, Linera, not the Zora? Hey, Doc, I don't know if this is important, but it was said someone who might have seen Princess Zelda at Rito Village over in Hebert recently. Nope, that would not be important at all. We'll find Princess Zelda one way or another. Okay, yeah, that's cool, but I want to shoot myself out of the tower again. Okay, do it again. Okay, where are we going first? All right, so I think I want to start out in the northeast, so... A few moments later... Okay, okay, what the actual f*** is that? What is this? What? what I gotta fight the gloom? Okay, uh, I'm, I'm, I gotta panic eat something. I don't have that many hearts. But gloom damage will not be recovered. So... What? Yo, what the hell was that thing? I don't think I've been that freaked out about a Zelda enemy since Redeads. What is that thing? Is that a fairy? Oh, it's just a Korok running in circles. This one looks like he might have had a stroke. Oh, here's another shrine. Let's go do that. The Ishodog Shrine. A windy device. All right, let's see what this one's all about. I mean, I probably have to use the power glider here. Oh, hang on. I get it. I get it. Hang on. Having a power glider and just having fans in my pocket is going to be so useful. It's like having a built-in Rivali's Gale. Okay, maybe it's not Rivali's Gale. Maybe it's like a, a mini Rivali's Gale. More like Rivali's Exhale. <laughs> Probably attach it to that. Let's do this. And we just give it a little love tap. And boom, makeshift elevator. I really feel like Nintendo was watching what people were doing with Breath of the Wild, and Tears of the Kingdom just became a response to all of that. Like, oh, you want to ride boulders, huh? Well, now you can, and you can make rocket ships. Oh, a Hinox. Wake up. Come over here and take all your stuff. He's like, hey, get out of my garbage pile. Okay, so what I can do here is... <laughs> oh, that didn't do much damage at all. This might be a good opportunity to use my Flux Core Smasher. Oh, yeah, we can do this. It stinks down here. Whoop, gotcha. Don't you dare. Ah, um, he hit me with a ground pound. Oh, let me take some of those items right off your necklace. Hit you right in the dick. It's probably not the item you want to get hit in the junk with either. All right, let's do this. Hit him with the old spinny attack. Twist his dick. And we should probably get out of there. Oh, we got Ah! Doing pretty good. All that Breath of the Wild conditioned me. Oh, I broke it. Wait, I want to spank him with the board guster. Come here, you've been a naughty boy. For that, you get a spanking. Wow, look at this. Got palm fruits, pumpkins, toenails, a real feast. All right, let's do a little bit of cooking. Let's, uh, let's cook up some of this fire fruit and see what we get. Imagine just exp I like how when Link is cooking and there's likely hot oil, he leans in really close, puts his face next to the fire. Every time I lift a rock, I'm like, there's gotta be a Korok under this one, I can feel it. And then there never is. Low key, I keep forgetting I have the Ascend ability. I feel like I have to break out of that Breath of the Wild mindset after grinding it for the last couple weeks. This, this is completely different. I can do new things. Like you best believe I'm gonna Ascend up there. Oh my god, that makes traversing so much easier. I'm actually looking forward to speedrunners, like, discovering new glitches and seeing what a speedrun this game actually looks like. I think there was an article that came out on IGN uh, where a speedrunner already completed this game in, like, 90 minutes or something, which is insane. How'd you figure that out? Are you a witch? Oh, there's pieces falling now. Hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that out. I'm gonna rewind that. Let's see. Let's see where this is going to take us. This is the first one that I'm seeing, so. So is it just, is it going to take us to the top or is it just going to, okay, I guess it just stops. Um, uh, okay, it's just, now we're just free falling. Um, okay, I'm going to jump. 
It's actually a pretty good way to get some extra ground. I was so sure that there was gonna be some kind of an island that I had to go up to. The Thundra Plateau. It's also kind of weird roaming around and knowing there's probably not gonna be any guardians. I have to worry about that laser. Actually, you know what? It's worse. The gloom is definitely worse than the guardians. So what the hell am I saying? There is another tower over there though. So maybe I should try and unlock that tower. All right, I found a horse and I'm gonna do this runicate shrine built to carry. What are we doing here? Is this a rewind? No. See, here's the thing. Now I have to start figuring out like what ability does what? Oh, hold up. There are some ladders here. Oh, there's a ball. Man, where's my stasis when I need it? I think I just have to move it and oh, I can roll it. Roll it down, or it's gonna slide down. That was smooth and satisfying. Will that sit there or will that fall? That's not gonna make that. So I think I gotta use these. Do something like, like this? I feel like that would probably fall off, but let's see, let's try it out. Actually, no, I am so big brained. My brain is so fat. Okay, I gotta get over there now. Let's see, What I gotta do something cool here. Bro, I don't even know what I'm trying to build here. I don't know if this is gonna work. I'm trying to make some stupid ass cable car. Do I just try like some dumb shit? No, no, no! Get back here. I have an insane idea, but I don't even know if it's right. But I'm gonna try it. I don't know what I built. Looks like something that they carry the Sultan in Aladdin in. Here we go. No, no! So I could tell you what I'm not, and that's an engineer. All the engineers in the comment section are gonna be roasting me. Oh, just, please, just, just make it. Just, just make it. Just, all right! Oh, there is nothing right about that, but we, we definitely take those. All right, get in there. Wow, um, <laughs> those lights. Let's go check it out. Oh, hello. That is incredibly useful and convenient. Because up we go. Oh, the pioneers used to ride these babies for miles. Yeah, this is the first time I'm actually going to be able to jump into a sky island. The South Hebra Sky Archipelago. Um, I don't have anything I could make to get across. Wait, just kidding. We're cruising tonight. Here we go. We're going to travel in style. Oh, God, please don't fall. If Link had a fear of heights, this would... Hell, come on, go. 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 Why are you not going? Wait, it's working. Maybe I was just standing in the wrong spot and the, uh, the weight distribution wasn't allowing it to work. I'm just, I'm not gonna move. Everything is going swimmingly. One simple window fan is defying physics. All right, I made it. What's over here? Sage's will, a small stone believed to have belonged to a sage. Holding it in your hand, you can feel the remnants of a strong, what can I use this for? This is in my key items, but I don't even know what I could do with it yet. Oh, I guess we'll figure it out. Oh, hang on, there's a, there's a shrine down there. That. And I really want, what is happening over there? Oh, is that one of the towers? We'll go to the shrine, then we'll head over there, and then we'll head over to the first phenomena. Phenomena. You know, like the song from Electric Mayhem? Aid from above. We probably need to use Ascend here or something. Hey, uh, probably can't touch those. Is this the entire thing? It's gonna have to be the next James Bond? Go this way. Probably need these blocks. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, so note to self, walk first, then take the blocks. Ah, I see, I see. I could have just stayed on that side, I guess. What's with all the cold elixirs and foods? You think I would come here ill-prepared? Yes. All right, where's the next one? What, what, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, I get it. Send, so I don't get cubed up like cheese on a charcuterie board. All right, to the city of blinding lights. Oh, another one of these. How am I going to get in there? Can I build something to go over it? Hang on, can I just, like, do this? Uh, yeah, it turns out I can. All right, let's activate this next tower. All right, link to base. Uh, are we prepared for takeoff? Looks like we have clearance in five, four, three, two, one. We have these robot tentacles that attach everything for us and the primitive launch technology that is a lot of air. Bro, I gotta know, what is the camera like on that thing? Damn, all of that? But I just saw, I wanna mark that one. Uh, any other shrines while I'm up here? Oh, what am I doing? Why am I not checking out some of these floating islands over here? God, this game is so damn cool. I mean, it's definitely not recency bias because this game is fantastic. Just, it takes everything you thought you knew about Breath of the Wild and just like doubles it. 
Okay, you're dead. I don't know why you thought you could. What is this? We're gonna make a hot air balloon? Is that what this is? It is. No, wait, come back! So I made an oopsie. So I don't think that thing's coming back down. But there's another one over here. And I should probably know better not to jump off of it. The ijo o Shrine. More than defense. Oh, you have a flamethrower. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, okay, that was pretty easy. Flame emitter shield, I will take that. Oh, got like the Min Min arm now. Okay, go ahead and melt that. Oh, I see. I need that to fan the flames. Listen, I know there's other games coming out this year. I'm excited for Final Fantasy 16. I'm excited for Spider-Man 2. But my God, if this game isn't up for game of the year, then I don't know. I like the shrines because if you're not creative, which I'm kind of not, you can just learn creativity. And where's my flurry rush there? Breaking all my stuff. All right, so let's, let's fuse some rockets and we will make a rocket shield. So cool. Wait, hang on. I got to go back to like the Room of Awakening because just like in Breath of the Wild, if you go back to the room that you awakened in, there's a Korok just waiting for you. But the real reason I wanted to come back here was because I didn't know that you can ultra hand these Koroks. So I feel obligated to help him. I mean, it sucks. I wish I had known this earlier. I mean, honestly, I'm just doing what I should have did a long time ago. Okay, so here's another thing I wanted to try because I saw it online and I was like, there's absolutely no way that's real. But once you have the fuse ability, you know, you could really fuse anything to anything else. So you, you pick up the minecart, and if you have a shield, you can actually fuse it to your shield. So you can carry this little minecart around on your back, but hang on, that's not the cool part. You could actually jump on and Link can tear it up like Tony Hawk. I'm gonna head to this first marker over here. My guess is these are gonna end up being the dungeons, uh, which I'm actually really excited for dungeons to return. Nintendo confirmed it a while ago, but the Divine Beasts just, they didn't do it. They were just glorified puzzles. Actually, it's, it's right here. We're gonna go, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, 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 crap. All right, back to Rito Village. Man, Rito Village during Christmas is beautiful. Oh, hello. <laughs> What? What? Where did you come from? All right, might as well do the shrine here so we can fast travel. Save me from another falling death. Ride the winds, a paraglider shrine. Oh, I'm gonna have to dodge. Okay, easy. Whoa, oh God. Kill this stupid construct. Wow, now you're weak. Oof. I wanna say we one shot him, but uh, I think we just probably broke our weapon and he fell off. I'm trying to unlock more of the map. And uh, I saw this tower just hanging out over here. So I was like, oh, why not? Question is, can I get up there? Is, I don't know if I have the stamina to climb all that. Wait a second, hang on, hang on. They've given us creativity. And everything can be solved with a really long bridge. I also just wanna know, is there a limit to how much I can actually lift? Or like how long something could be before it breaks? Or am I just blessed with the ability to use infinite items? <laughs> yeah, that's how you solve most problems. Your logic, that's why. I love this game. Let's go back to the sky for a little bit. I keep getting sidetracked. I don't know how I'm expected to finish this series when I just keep wanting to do other things. All right, I'm gonna head over here because I see this big spiral island and I wanna check out what that is. All right, made it in one piece. Wait, what is this? The shrine about to come out of the ground? I don't know what I just did. Did I open a portal? Courage Island. Well, I got courage, I got plenty of it. I'm guessing I gotta jump through here. Okay, hang on. Just like uh, Sonic Frontiers. Is it Courage Island because you don't want to go splat? All right, pretty easy. Then I'm just gonna just dive into the water. Bam! Surface tension would absolutely not allow that. What is this? Oh, it's a shrine. It opens a shrine. That's cool. The Tani Tanhi Shrine. To need just open the damn thing. Combat training archery. I feel like these enemies here are not as tough as like the guardians were. And watch me say that only to get bodied, but watch this. I'm gonna destroy this thing. Other attacks are ineffective here. I have to use only my bow. All right, I just I'll go up in the air and then watch this. Boop, right in the eye. And again, and again, and again. That's it. 
Do I get something cool here? All that for a strong construct bow that I had and broke? I dove through rings! I went skydiving without a parachute. All right, I think that red stuff down there is gloom, and I kinda wanna get a little bit of revenge after that thing bodied me and just dipped. Is that what that is? What? Maybe it's not. Well, I'll tell you one thing, don't touch it, because that looks like it'll hurt very much. Discovery, Hyrule Ridge Chasm. Chasm or chasm? What do we say? Oh my God, this is, this is a big hole. All right, uh, gotta be on my guard here. Oh, hello. Out of bright bloom seeds. I have some of those. There is a hot air balloon to get out of here, I guess. Yeah, like, it's kind of dark, but I can, I can see a little bit. This seems huge down here. What the hell is this? The Taconor Light Root? What is going on? Is this going to be a giant monster that's going to attack me? Or is it just like a big lamp? Oh, wait, I think it's a lamp. I think it just, like, turned the lights on. No way that, oh my God. So we have the surface, we have the sky, and now we have the depths. Is there anything else? Meow. This is like the upside down in Stranger Things. You have all the asbestos particles floating around. I don't know if I want to know what that is. Kind of scary looking. Oh, why, why is your health bar yellow? Why is it yellow? Oh, whoa. Oh my God. Gloom monsters. All right, hang on. I'm actually prepared now. I wasn't, but now I am. Yeah, try it again. Oh, shit. Welcome to the salty spittoon. How? Okay. I'm out of here. How do I hurt you guys? Help! Help, I have no stamina! I'm gonna try this thing that uh, Aonuma did in the breakdown video. Let him hit me. I have the puff shroom. Then maybe I could just, like, you know, sneak around back and sneak strike. Okay, that did nothing. You know, I'm just gonna go ahead and say I probably don't belong here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go back to Rito Village. Screw I'm going home. I'm gonna do a quick prayer to the statue because I think I have enough for, do I want stamina? I'm gonna go with more hearts this time around. I would love more stamina, but I feel like with all the tools I have to traverse the land, I don't need it as much as I did in Breath of the Wild. All right, well, let's let's see what's finally going on in Rito Village. What's this phenomena? That's not fair at all. You know I can handle it. Checking out that huge cloud wouldn't be hard. I could even do it alone. Why does this bird sound like an anime character? If we don't do anything, huh? Is that you? It is you. Yeah, it's me. Link! Where my hug at? Hey, what happened? It got really cold here. Link, they told me you were missing. It's good to see you doing well. The new Rito Elder. We can all keep wasting time treating the Song of the Stormwind Ark like it's real, but not me. Song of the Stormwing Ark? What's going on up there? Even if the Song of the Stormwind Ark is just a children's rhyme, I suspect that there's something lurking high in the sky. But the air is so turbulent now that no Rito can fly close enough to look into it. Yeah, so I guess this is gonna be my problem now, right? Ah, maybe I'm not the one you want. You should try asking Hearth. I hope they got hot chocolate here. It seems like a place that would have good hot chocolate. Link, you're all right. I was worried after I heard that you had gone missing. What happened? <laughs> Ah, so you're looking for Princess Zelda. Sorry to tell you that I haven't heard anything about her. Our feathers are full dealing with a more immediate problem. Everyone from the village has left to scavenge for food or to investigate the cause of the terrible blizzard. But little Tulin has developed a way with wings that puts adults to shame. His Whoa. wind gust technique is something to see. None of the rest of us can pull it off. Am I going to get the Rivali's Gale back? Anyway, I think they're on their way to the Hebra South Summit Cave. That's the northeast of here. I will admit I'm a little lost in this cave. I got to find this kid. I have no idea where he is. How the hell am I supposed to get over this? Wait, I can ascend to whatever's above this. I have no clue. Oh, that's how you leave. All right, where is this kid? Because looking for a lone cedar tree. This cedar tree looks very alone. Oh, there you are. Looking all over for you, kid. Stupid monster. Oh, wait, Link? Oh, where'd you come from? Uh, you see, uh, that rotten monster took my good bow. See, that's the bow napper. He's just flying in circles. He's like, I got your bow. What are you gonna do about it? All right, let's shoot this thing down out of the sky. Got him. Wow, really? You lost your bow to, like, a pterodactyl that dies in one hit? That you, my bow might have been lost for good. Uh-oh. There's, oh, they're just gonna drop in some bacoblins. Well, I have a rock hammer, and I also have a rock shield. 
So I don't know what you think you're going to do about it. Also, I can freeze you, which is rad as hell. Ow, who shot me? Who shot me when I wasn't looking? When I'm fighting the blue guy? Oh, you. Did I just get crit? I want to know, do Bacoblins, do they hit harder in this game? I can't believe I died there. Bacoblins been hitting the weight room in the last few years. Look, I think this might have been a hideout for those monsters. Oh, what gave it away? The skull on fire? Yeah, go blow out the candles, kid. Make a wish. Hey, Tullin, Link! Who's that? Now you show up. I didn't listen when Gassane tried to stop me. I thought I could handle it. Then you lost your bow. I bet you see now why we're treating you like a small chick. You see, the real dungeon was the lessons we learned. No! We're like, we're getting so high up now that it's starting to blend, like, sky and surface. Because here's all these constructs we're going to have to fight. Surprise, bitches! I broke my bow. Oh, you got flamethrowers on shields? This dude's just going to smack me with a bat. That was a flurry rush if I've ever seen one. Damn it, you're breaking all my weapons. What's this? Rusty halberd? It'll do. At least until I can just fuse it with some. Okay, that's broken too. Cool. Hey, thanks, kid. Nice shooting. Well, here's a hot air balloon. Maybe we'll take that. I don't know if I have... Or I, do I just attach it to like a flame emitter? All right, so if I take the flame emitter and I attach it to like the bottom, maybe? And then we do like this. Bop. Go. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm flying. Just like that movie up, but without the depression. So it kind of looks like we're heading in that direction. So I will knock that shrine out. So we have uh, a little bit of fast travel. Oh, there's just a ship floating in the air. Come to me. Uh, okay. Whose voice was that? Coming from somewhere up there? Okay. There's something in the storm. It looks like, is it a bigger boat? Oh yeah. There's tons of little boats flying too. You know what it reminds me of? A line of ships soaring built as a passage skyward. The god ascend to heaven, leaving behind an ark. Just like the song. All right, let's get up there. So maybe the first dungeon is like a big boat. Um. Whoa! What the hell was that? I didn't expect there to be a trampoline. The Mount Mayo Myomicus Shrine. Is Myomicus an instrument? No, Patrick. Myomicus is not an instrument. Downward force. What do I have to do here? I am confused. Usually in a shrine, they give you everything that you need to start. But how do I start? Oh, okay. Well, that's that. Let's use a cool weapon. The feathered edge, wind burst. <laughs> All right, little trampoline terror. The Sega Genesis, a fantastic puzzle game that I used to rent all the time. I got to open something up. Oh, there it is. And it's a can of whoop ass. Man, people don't really say that anymore. But like opening a can of whoop ass, it was such a cool thing to say. Can we bring that back? And is the whoop ass carbonated? Or is it like opening a liquid death? And it's just water in a can. Which is a great way to drink water. A nice cold liquid death. Just something crisp out of the, the aluminum can. The viewers are like, Chuck, what the hell are you talking about? All right, now that that's taken care of, into the eye of the storm. Oh, there's a... A big dude down there. You know what? Let's do it. I got the time, and I got these guys figured out. Okay, try it. Watch this. I don't even need arrows anymore. I got a fire club. Atta boy! Good job, kid. Oh, he's uh, the enemy from Mario 64 now. You know the one in uh, Dry Dry Desert? I see the, the spinny thing right in the middle. I'm gonna take that. Wait, no way! I can just rip him apart? Can I just take the, the piece on his back that I need? I can. That is so dumb. All right, let's finish him off. All right, damn, come on, die! All right, die! All right, I think I'm probably gonna attach it to this rusty claymore, make it worth something. I don't know if this is the dungeon or if we're getting to the dungeon, but I rather like this a lot. Because I'm not entirely sure if this is the dungeon or not. If it is, fine. If it's not, then damn. Let me just take care of this dude real fast. It just launched his corpse. The air has become very cold. I think I should be fine, right? My first time flying this high. The air is pretty cold up here, huh? I'll be fine. What about you, Link? Make sure you don't freeze, okay? Wow, it is. Yeah, it is insanely cold. But I got some elixirs, which I was making fun of earlier. I was like, I don't need elixirs. I need them. Turns out I need elixirs. 
But there's another shrine here, which is a godsend. Let's go inside and warm up for a little while. Raru's blessing. Is this one just a freebie? It's a free shrine. They're like, you've done enough puzzles. We'll throw you a bone, or in this case, a ball. I will say though, this right here, this ascent through like these sky islands is better than anything Breath of the Wilds has done. Sorry, I don't know if that's gonna upset anyone, but it is true. Oh, this is four trampolines together, so you know we're getting like a super bounce here. There it is, there's the eye of the storm. All right, here we go. This, this has to be the dungeon. The Wind Temple, they're back, baby. Oh, the whole temple is outdoors. I missed you guys. Wow, so this is what was waiting for us up in that huge cloud. The Flying Dutchman ship. <laughs> this is the Storm Wind arc from the kids song. What are they singing to you kids? Huh? Oh, yeah, that's not creepy. There's Zelda. Is she not cold? This proves it, Link. The blizzard that's been pounding Rito Village is coming from there. Oh, yeah. Didn't I see someone here a minute ago? Oh, yeah, you mean Princess Zelda? Hey, let's do this. This will hopefully set our fast travel point. Ooh, what's happening? Okay, I think I have to try and open the door by fixing these gears. It's like it's shut tight, but the source of the blizzard has got to be right under that hatch. There it is, that sound again. The voice is in my head. Brave Fletchling, use your power to release all five locks and the hatch should open. It's just like the Divine Beast. They're like, oh, there's still uh, five terminals remaining. And there they are. All right, first dungeon of the game, feeling good. I need to stop doing that. Melt that bad boy. Nice and toasty. Is this really what I have to do? Oh, I'm stupid. I am very stupid. When in doubt, abilities. All right, this seems like the first one, so, uh, hey kid. Do me a favor, blow some wind into this, into this PC fan, just right there. Maybe I can enter from like down here somewhere? The hell is that? Oh, what the f Okay, I figured it out. Those are bombs! On the bright side, I see where I have to go now. I probably, I should have had him gust me to get in there faster. You got fire arrows, my guy. Oh my god, the comedic timing in this game is fantastic. Kind of sad, like, I'm not getting, like, a boss key or, like, an item in a temple, but, like, what item would I need? This game already allows you to do anything you want. Hey, uh, kid, can you get me across this, please? Thank you. Oh, don't mind me. I'll be taking that ruby. All right, let me kill you before you whip me with that thing, because I'm afraid I'm going to enjoy it. I think I know what I have to do. Let's see if I'm right. I... Might be a genius. All right, that's gonna open that. Let's climb in there. I have uh, some spicy peppers, so I could actually use that. I'm about to be real cold. Three more to go. What can we do here? What do I have? Oh, I have a, wait, I have a portable pot. I can cook. I haven't tried that yet. Take that out. Can I just hit it and like it? Oh, it's already on fire. It's gonna make it so easy. I don't even gotta leave. Link's got propane and propane accessories. You like a butterfly flapping his wings deep down in the forest, man. It's gonna cause a tree fall like 5,000 miles away, man. Ain't nobody see it, nobody don't, don't even happen. All right, ate a spicy meal. I'm ready. Here's the next one. Oh, hold up. Eh, that's new. Climb up here. Oh, here's one. Piss off. Okay, that's three. All right, only two locks to go. I gotta go in from like the top over here, I think. Yeah, just ultra hand this. Probably close the doors. Uh, this is gonna be annoying. I should probably close the doors because I wasn't raised in a barn. All right, easy. Yeah, you know what to do. Right, where's that last one? There's gotta be like an entrance somewhere. Okay, Link, watch your step. I know, I know, I'm not welcome here. Oh, hey, hang on, maybe I have to go in there. This should be where the last one is. Use our recall. I haven't been using recall that much. I saw some people use recall to, like, move a, a large object around an enemy and just, like, rewind it, and then it just hits them over and over again, so I, I gotta try that. I gotta connect these gears somehow. Let's try one of these big icicles. Pop it right in the middle there. <laughs> uh, engineering! All right, last one. And then, uh, I assume there's gonna be some kind of boss fight coming. All right, the last lock has been activated. Or the last lock has been unlocked. Let's see, who's the big boss of the Wind Temple? It's a long way down. Whoa! Guess we're going up! Okay, let's go! Is this gonna be an aerial fight? 
Yeah, you have wings. Uh, I don't. I mean, I have my paraglider. What the f That is a Pokemon. Colgara? Music is real good here. All right, let's take this thing down. I don't know how we're gonna fight a giant ice dragon bug. Like, where? Face? Always aim for the eyes. We need to find a way to hurt it. We need to find a way to hurt it, he says. Like, oh, perfect. I know what I have to do. Yeah, thanks. Ow! Where'd it go? Oh, it can create wormholes. Cool. Get me out of there! Can I just dive into it, or do I need to, like, be gentle? Get out of there. Ow. Okay. Just right through its body. Arrows do work, so that's another hole. Ooh! Got one more. All right, here they come. I'm, I'm trying. You think I want to hit them? You think I'm like, hmm, look at all these rocks. Let me face check them. Of course, my bow breaks now. All right, we got him. We're not done yet, but he's hurting. Oh, he ran away. Coward. Uh, I, I didn't say anything. That wasn't me. That was actually, um, that was Tullin. Yeah, I'm working on it. Oh, oh they're closing in on me. Ow! Oh, I can go over them. That, that's probably a better idea than trying to go around them. Break them open. Oh, you suck. Get him this time. Woo! Sharpshooter. All right, this should be it, right? Unless there's like one finishing hit I gotta get him with. I think we did it. Skip it, looking ass dragon. You look like a dumbass keychain. Wow, just like that. They're like, all right, we're not even gonna waste any time. Here's a heart. Then all the ice melted and revealed the first tier of the kingdom. Wow, look at it. It looks like a jumbo shrimp. Oh, it shrunk. Yeah, take it. Boop. So, what are these tears? Are they just Father memories? I know that voice. Father, is that you? It's you. You're the one who's been guiding us? Yes. I am your ancestor from a time long ago. Who? I proudly served Hyrule's first king. I was a Rito warrior and a sage with control of the wind. Wow, that this dude is old. The source of that intense blizzard. It was summoned by the demon king. He thought he could stop you from obtaining the stone you just found, my secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? A tale of the imprisoning war, and the mission our people must accomplish. I like how they're kind of setting up like the champion protege, like maybe Years these will be ago, the new champions. When the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, a great evil. The Demon King. Say his name. Put some land. respect on Ganondorf's he name. Oh my god, look at him. Anyone who opposed him. But Raru, the first king of Hyrule, requested my aid, as well as that of five other warriors, to help in the fight. Raru entrusted us. I like their armor a lot. Artifacts, secret stones, objects that amplified our formidable abilities. I carried They're basically philosopher the stones from Full Metal Alchemist. Thrilling to fight alongside my the good one, saves. Brotherhood. Yet we were still no match for the Demon King's overwhelming power. What a his handsome lad. Staggering, and I was unable to slip past his defenses, no matter how hard I tried. In the end, King Raru realized that we would not be able to defeat the Demon King. To save our world. King Raru sacrificed himself and sealed the Demon King away. Alpha move. No. So that Sigma was move. War. The rest of us survived that climactic battle. And I would soon receive a visitor with a request that would define the future of the Rito. It was another of the six sages. The Sage of Time. The Demon King will return. The magic binding him will be undone. When that time comes, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. And he'll kick his ass. Oh, and he's handsome, too. But Link will only succeed with the Rito's help. Summon the winds and support this hero. It was clear what part the Rito would play. It will be an honor to defeat the Demon King. I swear to you that when the Demon King returns, the Rito Sage of Wind will awaken once more, and you can count on the full support of the Rito. 
And now you know about the imprisoning war, and a mission I accepted on our behalf. You've saved Rito Village, but there's more to do. The Demon King will soon recover his full strength. Tulin, my brave fledgling, you must take up my secret stone and honor the Sage of Time's request. Fight the Demon King with the Swordsman Blink. Ooh, I just got goosebumps. So it's my mission to fight the Demon King with you? Yeah, I know you didn't sign up for this. It wasn't really part of the job description, but you got that wind ability, kid. Blink! I feel this like we're gonna so, need it. so amazing! I'm so excited to risk my life! Sister gave me such an important mission, and it involves fighting alongside you to save the world! This voice actor seems very familiar. If we don't do anything, then the world is gonna be in big trouble. I can't let that happen. I'll do this. I'll happily take this secret stone. Put it somewhere safe. I don't know why that other dude was wearing it like on his ankle. If it was so important. Okay, I guess that's where it's going to. On like a hemp bracelet from the year 2005. Whoa, you got a shadow clone? I, Tulin, the Sage of Wind, swear to fight by your side until the end. Hey, what'd you do to my arm? Oh, that, that feels weird. I got a pinky ring. You can use that ring to call on my power anytime. All right, so I have some amiibo here, and I don't even know what they do or what they give you. So uh, let's try it out for the first time right now. I have the Tears of the Kingdom Link Amiibo that I picked up, and it looks like that's going to give me a bunch of food. And then I have the Ocarina of Time Link that my friend Tom got me. That is a lot of meat. That's what she said. <laughs> Damn, Ocarina of Time Link came packing. I want to go back into the depths because I had a brief look at what was under there, but I mostly got my ass kicked, and I'm just kind of looking for a little bit of redemption. Ooh, what is going on? Tullin's vow has granted you the power to summon his avatar. And you best believe he's coming with me. I'm going to need all the help I can get. I don't even want to do anything crazy. I want to just, like, kill some of these gloom monsters. But this place is terrifying. Miss, get out of here. What are you doing? Yeah, I'll give you some of these bright bloom seeds. What? What? Oh, my God. You got to be kidding me. I was being nice. Oh, you're weak, though. Weak ass. Give me those bananas. Yes, 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 yes. Here's what I'm afraid of, but I think we could we could probably take them down. Oh! Back off! I just want to kill one of you guys. I can't even heal myself. Oh, I got one! Yeah, drop the stick. Die! We got we killed two of them. There's one more, and he's like, hey, where'd my comrades go? A little fire never hurt any but actually, you know what? That's an incorrect statement. There's like nothing down here. This is Erio. Hang on. Th that is a big monster. I'm going to try to avoid them, mostly because I don't have health and I can't recover it. I just want to find like one more shrine so I can fast travel and I don't have to go to the same spot every time. Oh, shit. I'm leaving. Okay, I don't know what I just found, but I found something and there's light here. You know what? It's probably best for me to leave the depths right now. So I'm going to ascend and see where this takes me. Oh, wow, where am I? Well, I did want to head towards the Gerudo next, so that's probably the next dungeon I'll do. My guess is I probably got to go around these mountains, so you know what? He'll be coming around the mountain when he comes. Or, oh, wait, there's a shrine. There's a shrine next. Oh, God. Well, that just means there's a root down there, right? The Ratsamamu Shrine. You know, the value of these shrines, it's all about location. It's all about real estate. And being located right next to a gloom chasm, it's not going to help the property value. A balanced plan. I wonder if we have to balance things. Here, we just attached it like, boom, right there. Oh, wait, oh, I should probably got on it first. I can just go up this way. Listen, I didn't come here to do physics. Go, come on, go. Oh, wait a second. I'll just hold it here for a second. It's going to go back down. I'll go on it and I'll use recall. Oh, here, watch this. That's not how that was supposed to be done. That's the great thing about this game, is you can break the rules. All right, and we go straight from the Blessing of Light to the Hole of Darkness. The Yiga Clan Hideout Chasm? Why do they get one? Here's the thing I gotta light up. Isn't that creepy that it's like right 
under the shrine. And I gotta do some like weapon fusing. I'm not fusing enough of my weapons. Ice Keys Eyeball has a four fuse attack power. I wanna see if I can make like some ice weapon. You know what? Let's go with the Bacoblin arm. It'll be funny. It's <laughs> It just looks like the never soft eye. Got water in here. Hang on. I'm I'm fighting whatever this is. God, I wish I had some arrows though. I'm using the ice keys club. Oh my god, it like sprays ice. I'm destroying these dudes. Oh damn. All right. Well, that was short lived. Okay, this is uh this is gonna be a bit of a challenge. <laughs> who who did that? I just I want to know about the time. Is this gonna hurt me? Oh, that's gonna explode. You get it? I don't know. I gotta leave, man. I'm not cut out for this right now. I gotta get stronger. We're gonna head to Gerudo Town right now. You know what? Let's hit that tower first. I know it's like not on the way, but it's not out of the way. And I'm trying to unlock some more map. Oh, hello. You need help? Don't worry, I got you. <laughs> He's like, huh? Who did that? Wow, that was real embarrassing. Better make sure that doesn't happen again. Yeah! Oh, look at these. So oh, they're electric. Uh... Ow! That yellow choo-choo jelly. You got that lemon lime choo-choo jelly. Come on, we all know that was the best Gatorade flavor. It wasn't blue. Blue is nasty. Why are you boring me? I'm right. Except for the ice blue one. I don't know if they still make that flavor, but I used to get that one a lot when I was a kid. Did you come out to see the Skyview Tower? Hate to break it to you, but the tower is out of order. I'm here to fix it, but unfortunately the elevator's broken too. All right, you guys are not having any luck, are you? See that metal bit up there? Used to be a platform attached to it. If you added enough weight, it would go up and down. I guess maybe this thing? Is that enough weight? No. Is that enough weight? There we go. They all fixed. You're the one who got the elevator working? You're amazing. Go ahead and scan in. This is what I gotta do when I go to the gym. Like, please scan your QR code. This doesn't happen though. The Dr. Octopus tentacles don't come out and examine me. That's gotta feel nice on like a, a really hot day. It's getting shot 30,000 feet up into the air and you reverse bungee. Wow, that's a big section of the map. Okay, we got the whole Gerudo Desert now. I, I guess we're heading in the right direction. So let's head more towards uh, whatever's gonna be happening at Gerudo Town now. Hello, what are, the hell are you? Oh my God. What the f is that? Dude, you got big re-dead energy and I don't like it. A Gibdo bone? What are you? Wait, what's this? That's some kind of updraft I can use? Might be able to see if I do that. Please, please don't harm me. Please be something that's gonna help me. There we go. Oh, hang on. I can see. Mark that. That's actually where I gotta go. All right, I'm just gonna keep going straight. Oh, there's another one. Okay, Th this is helpful. All right, I made it out, kind of. Well, here's the door to Gerudo Town. They can't kick me out if they can't see me. Actually, there's nobody here, so. Wow, this place really changed uh, after the upheaval. What's down here? Is that Plaka? Are you going to kick me out? I, I could be here, right? Nothing to report. Uh, a vo! Well, you've reached the entrance to the Gerudo shelter. I can't allow any vo to pass. Sorry, Bo? No, vo with a V. Bite your lower lip when you say it. Vo! Okay, so I'm not welcome here. All right, you know what? You can just watch me leave through the ceiling. I mean, the place I need to go to is up, right? It's on the roof, I think. All right, so I'm just gonna keep doing what I've been doing and like, you know, go through the ceiling till I get to the top. Wait, let me go through. Wait, I saw that, yeah. Really satisfying to get a green dot because then you're like, oh, I'm swimming. All right, I'm up here. This is the shrine, right? So sorry, Yatoang shrine. Buried light. Hey, where'd you bury it? My guess is like, probably turn it on and it'll blow the sand away. Like if I do this, just do it like a pop. Nope, wrong way. Oh yeah, that's actually, that's how you do it. This is a bad idea though. You're gonna be like gonna be coughing up sand for a week. That's probably where the key is. And oh, hello. Haven't had combat one of these guys in a while. But you've gotten really weak. You guys have been slacking. Oh, hold up, let me just enjoy the music for a second. Uh, excuse me? Oh, wow. That is bright. Oh my god, I totally get it. I'm not supposed to use the fan. I gotta use this thing. I don't know. I, I was like, oh yeah, the fan has to be part of the equation. It is not. It is just to blow away the sand. And that's it. A little light refraction is all. I was like, that thing looks familiar up there. All right. Let's see. That way, shine it right there. That's how that's done. Okay, so I'm, uh, I'm not sure if... That solved my problem, but I can fast travel here now. 
Oh, it's hot again. And wait, look at that thing. That reminds me of like when Sword and Shield was coming out and they were looking at like the crop circles. They're like, huh, what is this? That's something about the throne. Oh wait, hang on a second. Hang on a second. Move that out of the way. Okay, this is just, oh, here's a tunnel. I was like, we just, did we just fall into like a toilet? No. Wow, what? There's a bow, stop him. Oh, I gotta get the, the thing again. Bo are not permitted to be here. You must leave. Don't you guys remember me? It's only been a couple of years. Hold on. Boliara has been some time, swordsman. It's all right. This one has the chief's permission to enter. He's welcome to visit any of the shops and businesses. You to come all this way, enduring the strange storm that plagues us. You must have some important news to share. So you see, I fixed the Rito, so I'm here to fix you guys now. Sand Shroud settled on us some time ago. We sent out patrols to try to determine what was causing it, but a swarm of monsters, creatures called Gibdos, suddenly appeared, attacked our troops, and forced us to retreat. Anyway, now's not a good time. Lady Riju's in training. She's trying to become strong enough to save us from this. It's okay, I'm here now. I did it last time. I'll do it again. You want to speak to her? Visit the ruins to the north. Gotcha. Hey, what's, what's this over here? I sell arrows and I sell choo-choo jelly. That's what I do. How many you want? I will take the 20. I got some orbs to spend. Uh, I'm going to go with the heart. I know like more stamina could be pretty good, but in this case, I've seen what's underground. What I got's not cutting it. So where do I have to go now? Over here? That's not that far. Uh, so actually, I'll just go to the shrine and I'll just glide over there because we like working smarter and not harder. I can't even like see where I am, where I got to go. Oh, this is the North Guru. This is it. This is where we got to be. Where's she training? Read you. Where'd you go? Oh, there's lightning storms here. Cool. I'm just waiting to get struck by lightning and die. Oh, hey, here's a cave. Discovery. The Valley of Silent Statues. Oh, come on. I, I don't want to be in here. Not if this guy's in here. He gives me the creeps. Oh my God, there's so many of them here, but there's a lot of, uh... Okay, we, we broke that. You guys don't like the cold, huh? Well, that makes two of us. I don't even know if this is where I have to go, but it seems just cool to be down here. So I've been hearing in this game, and no spoilers, please. I'll do my best not to spoil anything for anyone else. I heard the way you get the Master Sword in this game is by far, like, the coolest way to get it. Where do I have to go? I mean, if only I had a Mandalorian to tell me which direction I had to go in. This is the way. What the hell is that over there? I feel like I need a bomb, which I don't have. Do I have a bomb? Do I have anything explosive I could attach? I have so much stuff, but not a single bomb. Oh, okay, whatever I did just worked. I, what did I do? Did I attach a rocket by accident? I, I did. All right, that works. All right, so where's this light going? I probably need to redirect it somehow. I could probably use this to, like, open some doors. Whatever that's going to do. Oh, that's cool. I'm just going deeper and deeper into whatever the hell this place is. Open that one. I feel like there's some potential here for this to be really cool. They have some really cool stuff here. Oh, or like a weird monster? Where'd you go? What did I do? All right, find door number two. Need this thing. This fan. What are we hiding? Oh, another one. Okay. Means I gotta further redirect the light. To get to this third one. Like if I do this, put this here. Here we go. Engineering, baby. I get this one. There we go. Just don't fall off. Almost. There we go. Where's the good old mirror shield when you need it? I missed that thing. Getting the mirror shield was so cool in Ocarina of Time. I remember playing that game and doing that for the first time. I'm like, wow, this is incredible. Oh, crap. It's one of these things. Uh, hang on. I know what I have to do. And I got some bombs to do it. Hey. Here. Eat. Whoa. Okay. I wasn't aware you'd be shooting electricity at me. Please die. Please die. Uh, you know what? Eat. Eat something. I don't want to come all the way down here only to die to this thing. Turn around. I can't, I can't see your little, uh, I can't see your tonsils. Okay, what's this? Please tell me like we did all that for a Gerudo shield. Shock-like stone, shock fruit. Oh wait, is there another one here? Opaz, did I come down here just for that? I mean, that was pretty cool. I was kind of expecting something a little better for all that work. All right, I'm going back to the ruins. I think she's she got to be right here. Maybe it's where the lightning is striking because she's, yeah. Right, here it is. We found her. 
She's just beating the entire shit out of this dummy. It's you. That's right, it is me. This changes things. I didn't expect to see you here. And I'm here to help. Again. So Hyrule Castle flew up into the sky, huh? That's weird. You came here looking for clues. Blues clues. I've been practicing striking that dummy over there with lightning. If I can aim the lightning well, I think it may be an effective weapon against the Gibdos. I don't know, I I was able to just like cut their heads off. But lightning is probably easier. I think I can use your arrows to help me aim my lightning strikes. Fire one at that dummy over there. Okay, got you. We're back to Link's crossbow training. Oh, hang on, that was sick. Let's try something a little trickier. That was too easy. All right, what do you need me to do? You need me to hit the middle one? There we go. Hey, watch where you're swinging that thing. Gibdos don't stand a chance against this power. I can't thank you enough for your help, Link. <gasps> What's this? Getting all tingly. What was that? Didn't sound like any noise Sand Shroud has made, that's for sure. You heard that too, right? It was... <gasps> Chief! It was Chief Keef? We, we received word that a swarm of Gibdos are attacking the Karakara Bazaar. Boliara is already on her way there. I don't want to walk through this. And we're kind of in a hurry, so... Just gonna, gonna teleport my way over there. All right, we're back at the bazaar. Oh my God, I hate them. Why did we need these in the game? All right, time to play a little Gears of War horde mode. Oh, torch them. All right, I'm here now. We're gonna wipe all the Gibdos out at once. Link, don't let me down. Yeah, no pressure or anything. All right, just like when I had to surf on the sand. Get away. I, I kind of, I'm enjoying this. This is fun. My bow is about to break. I certainly have another bow, right? Oh, good. I was gonna say, it'd be funny if I had none. Like, what do I do in that situation? Swarm Gibdos seem to be coming from there. The very, ew, ew. Oh, I hate this. Okay. If I stand too close, I, I have a feeling I might get electrocuted. So uh, let me not, but let me find a way to, there we go, come on, destroy the thing. There we go. Someone's telling me that the next temple is going to be very, very creepy. Uyara, well done holding the line until we were able to get here. Now that we know the Gibdos are susceptible to lightning, this gives us a major advantage. I feel like if I had lightning powers, that would be the first thing that I would try. Is oh, wait. That Zelda? Is that Zelda? No, that's probably the, uh, it's probably one of the sages. It just happens to look like Zelda. What is happening? It's like that here it comes meme with the guy just like pointing at the twister. Zelda, wait! Don't worry, it's not Zelda. She's done this before. Liara, we need to get back now. Link, we're going on ahead. I'll meet you in town. You got it. Let's roll. All right, now we have to go to Gerudo Town, but fortunate for me, I got the shrine already. We can just zip right over. You think anyone gets weirded out if they catch Link just turning into like glowy spaghetti and disappearing? All right, let's go in here. Oh, hey, Vo, you can't just walk around like that. No, it's fine. They said it was okay. Now the desert is hot, but it's not that hot. Oh, I gotta put on clothes. All right, I'll put some pants on. There, happy? Okay, let's try that again. I'm here. Look, Link, there's a Gibdo hive, just like the one that appeared near Karakara Bazaar. Both the hive and those tornadoes are reported to have shown up at the same time, but it's not only one hive. There are three to deal with, each outside of the town gates. Right now, those hives are durable and nearly impervious to attack. When they open and begin releasing Gibdos, they're vulnerable. All right, so we just gotta wait for the, the birthing to happen. Can I borrow your lightning attacks? Oh, oh, there's that sound again. Come. Come. To where I am. Again, you heard it, didn't you? Oh, you're going crazy. Speak with Bulliara and the soldiers and help organize our defenses. Is it gonna turn into like a Zelda RTS? This, that would be fun. All right, I guess I'm ready for battle. The contractions have begun. Ew. Even the way they spawn is disgusting, and we have a blood moon coming up. All right, so how am I supposed to be in three places at once? Everyone's gonna get eaten, aren't we? I feel like they're going to be best off, so maybe I'll I'll go east and west. Yeah, okay, one's down. Okay, no, we're, we're doing okay. They're really slow. They're not those 28 days later zombies. We'll wipe them out, no problem. Look, easy peasy. Come on, they're birthing, they're birth- Oh, Reju's under attack? Come on. I left you alone for 15 seconds. Ew, they can fly? Can I get some electricity? Thank you. Right, we only have one more left. And that's the east wing. All right, we did it. We did it. 
Rudo Town is saved. I suspect that the Gibdo threat will calm down a bit now that we've wiped out the hives. I noticed that the hives crumbled into the sand when we destroyed them. I wonder if the Gibdos have some kind of connection to the sand. Maybe they're connected to the sand shroud. Link, there's something you should see. Come down to the mural in the underground shelter. Did she just dips? Is she talking about this? Like this one? Like here, you should move this and just like come down. All right, I'm down here. Oh, Link, you came. It's been four seconds. Look at the mural on this wall. It's thought to have been painted by the ancestors of the Gerudo. It appears that when they created it, they were also using this shelter to hide. Perhaps the Gerudo of the distant past were also beset by some great disaster. Stand back to back with the throne, witness red pillars across a vast sea. Unite the pillars in light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. Stand back to back with the throne. This thing's in the way. I'll tell you that much. Shit out of here. Three stone pill. There's three stone pillars. Are there anything else? All right, I'm just gonna walk straight because I'm pretty sure I just have to go to whatever that tower is over there. Stay the course, Link. Straight ahead. God, they're here. Ugh. They just gross me out. It's a good thing they're slow. All right, here's uh, here's this temple or whatever it is. Pick up. I probably have to smash the like button, which is what you guys are gonna do, right? On this on this video, right? Why didn't that do anything? I mean, I have bombs. I didn't want to go that route, but I'll do it. All right, now I got to redirect this who knows where. Are there just three of these that I have to, like, turn on? Because I don't even think I could move this. Maybe I'll just follow the light, I guess. You see, normally you don't want to follow the light, but in this case, we'll make an exception. Okay, wait, there's, I see another tower over there. All right, let's go on the roof, see what's going on up here. Nothing here. All right, you know what? I probably got to do something over here. Hello, what do we have here? What are we turning? Oh, it's raising it. Okay, bingo. That's where we got to go next. I'm telling you right now, whatever we do over here, something's coming out of the ground in the middle of this triangle. The temple's going to rise. There's something about Zelda games and making temples rise out of the sand. The trope that never gets old. What do we have down here? We got to build something. Oh, wait, I think I know. I think I have to make like a makeshift rudder here or a crank. I feel like that's all we need. See, that'll that'll work. Come on, close the triangle. Congratulations, you now have Wi-Fi. Whoa, what is that light? Watch, it's, it's gonna come out of the ground. I called it. Now, whatever the heck that is, go find out. Oh, there's uh, one of the sages. Link, did you see that? It's Zelda. No, it's not Zelda. It looks like Zelda. We made that mistake earlier. Trust me. Oh, she's gone. Saw the lights of the red pillars and hurried here as quickly as I could. It cannot be a coincidence that we've seen someone who looked like Zelda twice. But a mystery for another time. Did you solve the mural's riddle and cause this to appear? I'm impressed. No, I just, it did it on its own. I just happened to be here too. Maybe my lightning strike is the key? All right, let's do it. I don't like all this red glowy business, but oh, we did it. Try to give it a little jump start. Oh, no, here comes the actual temple. The sand temple. Or the Gibdo temple. Now that'd be gross. Oh my god, there's gonna be so many of them. Riju's power of lightning. When Riju's aura is charged, you can call... It, I'm gonna need her for this. Oh, the lightning temple. I guess that makes more sense. Do I need to, like, shoot this thing open with lightning? Or is... It's like the door's closed, right? Hang on. Maybe just shoot the front? Yeah, that works. Ew! I got some on me! Wait a second, are they gonna throw a boss at me right now? Uh, hi there. Um, would you- a Queen Gibdo? So you're responsible for this. It must be responsible for all this. Alright, I wasn't expecting to have a boss fight, like, right off the bat. What are you gonna do? What are you, what are you shooting? Ooh, ow, oh my god, that hurt. I'm gonna have to heal now. I'm just gonna double fist some hydro melons. So I really wish I stopped to cook some meals first. Would have been helpful. Oh god, oh god, oh god! What? The strategy was shocked the hell out of them. There we go. Does that mean it's like the other gift? It was on fire. Oh, yeah, it smells. Okay, just go around those. No, thank you. Ah! <laughs> That's terrifying. I don't think I need that many arrows. I mean, I definitely need more. Can I just like run up and smack? I'm afraid. Duh, no, that's not working. <laughs> she just got launched. Wait, get back here. I need your help. L let me get over there and just, like, smack it a few times. <laughs> Our attack should be effective, but I, I can't get close enough. Oh, there we go. Had to lay down the law. 
Okay, so, uh, I think we got off on the wrong wing here. And you're upset. Are oh, you leaving? So we just got, we got a taste of what we're in for. All right, we got to look for a way in. Gee, I wonder how we're going to get in. I would go get arrows, but I honestly think there's just going to be plenty in there. Ooh, it's spooky down here. It was already creepy. We don't need a basement. Can I burn these things? Oh, that's, that's awesome. Okay. Because they deserve to burn. Let me just pull the arrows out of you. Because I need those. You know what? I want to fuse something to this uh, Gerudo Claymore. 40 fuse attack power for a Gibdo bone? Wait a second. 90? Why did I just learn about this? What? Fireballs now. Uh, looks like we're stuck again. Can you blow them out? Let's see. No. That was definitely a creative endeavor. We're stuck, she says. Don't you know who I am? Call me the Time Rewinder. I don't know who they is. Someone definitely called me the Time Rewinder. Oh, it breaks, like, immediately. All right, you know what? We'll fuse the, uh, the Lizalfos horn. That thing won't break. There we go. Now we got a strong weapon. What is going on down here? Oh, it's one of these. Okay, no problem. We, we know how to deal with those. Oh, we know what to do here. Cut the foreplay. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Can, can you... Can you not stand so close, maybe? We're trying to get rid of these things. Hang on, let me... I'll just use my flame emitter. That I was gonna fuse to my shield, and then I didn't realize Harry had something fused to it, so... Alright, I definitely haven't been up this way yet. Room of hopeful light. Yeah, I do hope there is some light. Ouch. I've decided that after this dungeon, I am going to seriously do some grinding. And I am going to find better armor and get my hearts up. Because, um, I'm kind of weak right now. Ooh, a Captain Construct 3 horn. I don't know if we ever got two. I think we skipped that one. They're going to Star Wars this thing. Because they're going to start with Construct horn 4, 5, and 6. Then 1 to 3 won't be loved for uh, quite some time. What is this room? The Room of Ascension. Gee, I wonder what ability I have to use here. First, let's... Oh, not allowed to do anything yet. Like, I'm certain that mural we saw in town was trying to guide us here. I believe we'll also find uh, that voice that we've been hearing. Oh, hang on. I threw that at the wall by accident, but pull these blocks out. I've always wanted one of those secret doors in my house where, like, you pull, like, a book on a bookshelf or, um, where you, like, push a brick in. Maybe one day. All right, so I probably just got to turn a bunch of these on. You know, with, with lightning... I said with lightning. What are you doing over here? Come on. Monster have left to the top of the temple. How do we get there? L let me show you. I guess maybe I don't have to interact with that yet. So this funny glitch of like people picking up NPCs in boxes. That's kind of what I want to do. Like, hey, just come over here for a second. Do we really need a jingle for that? All right, going up to the top. Fifth floor. Wow. Okay. This is a big ass temple. I was not expecting that. I mean, this is the second temple that I'm doing. I heard from people who have done all of them that the Wind Temple is the worst one. So I take solace in knowing it's only going to get increasingly better from here. It looks like I'm just going to have to manipulate light a bunch. Or I got to get some light in here, first of all. Probably line those up somehow. Uh, using is incredibly strong. Yo, dude's got a flame emitter on a stick. Oh, wait, this will get some light in. All right. I probably need to find the light on each floor, and then I need to reflect it. So what I have to do here, probably have to get these to line up somehow. If I do that, I can get the light in here. Here we go. Let's see what this does. Give that a nice charge. It's very respectable of the Lightning Temple to be completely solar. Very good for the environment. I don't even know what floor I should have started on. I kind of just went to the top, and I was like, we'll work our way down, and somehow ended up on the third floor. All right. Yep, that will smush me, but here's what we can do. We fun things like this and say, no, this temple is huge. Okay, that'll stop that, which is good because we probably need these bricks for uh, this. Wait, wait, come here, come here, come here, come here. This will be funny. Oh, no, don't come after me. Don't do that. Do they know? I think they know. They're not coming in here. Come on, you guys know what I was going to do. I make content for a living. I just, I wanted to smush them. It would have been funny. I'm going to win, Milia. Oh, I just two-shot him. This dude folded like construction paper. All right. Light, can, can I reflect that? I put this here. Can I? It's not that much light. I feel like I might have passed another switch. I have to get light to that thing. Oh, wow. I didn't even see this. Okay. Let's drop down here and gotta find some switch. 
Oh, I see. I get it. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the funniest YouTuber of them all? Let's get ahead. Some light going over there. I like this temple a lot. This temple is pretty awesome so far. Dude's using a mirror. Are you kidding me? Man, I've been catching so many strays. Like, I'm just trying to square up one of these constructs. And, like, another one out of nowhere. No, you wait your turn now. Oh, oh, you dropped a shield? Oh, you dropped a shield? All right, what's the puzzle here? Where's the light? Can't open this. Oh, wait, there's light coming in from here now. Uh, all right, let's do this puzzle. Get that out of the way. That'll reflect that over there. And it looks like that's going to bounce it downward if I get it over there. Oh, I didn't even know there was a, a thing up there. Okay. Got a switch. What's this going to do? Open another door that reveals a secret compartment, which reveals an embarrassing photo of SpongeBob at the Christmas party. Oh, here's how we get him from the top. All right, so that one's open. I got to go finish what was going on up there because I can make the light come down to another floor. I guess if I just move this, it'll reflect the light down. Oh, wait, here we go. Here we go. Making it happen. That will give us another switch. Okay, so, so far, two dungeons. This one's my favorite. Room of Offered Light. Oh, God, there's another one of these things. Uh. Well, that's not working. Man, it would really help if I had the person uh, who I showed up here with helping me. What, what is happening? I'm, like, locked in a corner. I'm just going to bomb them all. Hang on, let's just walk around and just sneak strike. Is that that's a fun way to do it. See, the Zonai aren't going to come back. So when you kill the Zonai, you're good. These guys over here, I don't know what's going on. Do they hate light? They're burning up from the light. Are they gamers? Tolan is just destroying these monsters. Just like sniping them, getting a kill streak going. And then here I am just building a hot air balloon to go up, I guess. Oh, wait a second. I think I, think I figured it out because I'm a genius. That will absolutely work. I was going to say, I can't see behind me. I hope it's making it. Be honest with me, comment section. It was definitely an easier way to do that, right? Have I unlocked everything yet? Oh, wait, I didn't get denied this time. Okay. This platform connects to the very top of this temple. Use your power to charge the four batteries, and it will function once more. I mean, I think all the batteries are unlocked now, so I can probably access them. I don't know if I just didn't interact with it again and I needed to. And then she would have followed me around the temple. And then I wouldn't have uh, struggled with that room just now. That's all right. All the work's done. You get to do the fun part now. Let me show you. This is what I needed you for earlier. And you weren't here. And uh, I, I hated that. Man, this place takes four AA batteries. This thing's a battery muncher. Actually, Game Gears. You used to go through batteries like crazy for like an hour of game time. I mean, it's crazy. Like, I remember sitting outside playing Pokemon with my friends. And like, if you were running out of batteries and you had none, you had to like go to the store to get batteries. What an inconvenience. All right, let's go ahead and scan this. We're going to the top. Here we go. Tullin's like, I'll just, I'll meet you up there, guys. Yep, this definitely looks like a boss fight room. Something's shining over there. The very faint light. This is a classic Zelda boss room. The room of glorious light. Oh yeah, real glorious lighting here. There we go. Where is he? We have unfinished business. I remember me. I'm gonna try and take these things down after I do a little bit of damage. Indoor tornadoes? Can you not? All right, I got you. Let's see, what do we want to use? Let's use our Boko Black Blade that's gonna break in like three hits. Oh, did that hurt? This may come as a shock to you, but I'm gonna win this fight. Here we go. I don't like that. I hate everything about this. You sound like a broken record, but it's something more give those only can surround you. You got it. Oh god! Ah! Those are fa those are the fast ones. I'm just gonna open all the light pillars. Make my life easy. Yo, get the f away from me! Oh, I ran out of stamina! Alright, that should take care of uh, all the little enemies so I can focus on Big Mama. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Oh, that sucks. Also, if I'm out of arrows, this has to be possible, right? I think I could probably leave, right? So I can't leave because Riju says, You're really leaving, Link? Come on. Oh, I am leaving. Oh, she's just saying she's disappointed in me. Still arrows and I sell choo choo mm. jelly. How many do you want? I'll take them all. 20 arrows? That's not enough. I just never have enough arrows in this game. Look at this. They got me traveling the world Aww. to find my arrows. That should be enough. 
And if it's not, then I'm very bad at this game. Oh. All right, I'm back and read you. <laughs> Riju is clearly disappointed in me. I've been waiting. Now let's go. I just, I like the thought of Queen uh, Gibdo and Riju just standing here being like, I don't know where he is. You want to just resume this without him? I mean, I'm sure there's another way to beat this if you run out of arrows, but I didn't have anything that could probably do it. Also, I feel like if something relies heavily on a specific commodity, they should probably have a way to refill that. Like, I don't know, put some, put some barrels on the side. The entire time, these things dropped them, and then there were none. Burn, you incels, burn. Down, you overgrown cicada. Down here. Oh my god, I'm missing so many now. Die! One thing I know is, after this fight, I need to immediately stock up. I need to go to the Costco of Hyrule. Die! All right, one more and think we're good. A note for everyone out there. If you haven't done this fight yet, make sure you got plenty of arrows and stuff, because <laughs> it's a pain without them. All right, you bootleg original Cell form looking ass. You guys know when, like in Dragon Ball Z when Cell was the grasshopper before he molted and they found the, the body and the, you know what I'm talking about. All right, go ahead and grab the heart container and then we'll get our next tier of the kingdom. Because I can't just go ahead and grab it. We got to turn it into costume jewelry first. All right, Tullin had a an anklet. Where's this one going? Earring maybe? Necklace? What plug? No, no, you cannot joke about that. Riju, beloved daughter of the Gerudo. I know that voice. Been hearing it for you're weeks. You're the one who's been talking all this time. Yes, your ancestor from a time long past. The Demon King is responsible for sending the monster that caused the Sand Shroud. All these circles and rocks, it's very, but very the spa true aesthetic. Was to prevent you from obtaining that stone. All right, this one's going to be an earring. My secret stone. If you get the other one, then you could make Demon Vegito. King. Secret stone. Stay a while and listen. Are we going to see the same picture of, like, sexy Ganondorf after every single fight? Can we get those masks? Like, can I wear that? Is that armor that's obtainable? My friend is nodding, but I want the comment section to engage with this video. So while I already know the answer, let me know in the comment section. I guess it's time to play my destiny. All right. Take the fried shrimp and let's go. They also kind of look like a Final Fantasy XIV job stone. I am the sage of lightning. Witness this new power I possess. Ha! Okay, I'm excited to have this one by my side because Tullin's great, but he's mostly for either traversing the world or just knocking down enemies. Link, give me your hand. All right, so two dungeons down. I guess we have two to go. I have no idea what else is going to be left after this. So who knows where we're heading next? Link got some more bling. Use that ring to call upon my power whenever you need it. And I will need it. <laughs> it seems I can finally repay you. Okay, should we head back to town? All right, you know what? We're going to do the fire temple next, or I'm assuming is the fire temple because we're going to head towards Death Mountain. There's going to be such a huge change in between doing the third temple and the fourth temple because I'm headed to Europe for things that I'm not allowed to talk about yet. So all I want to say is that I'm going to be pretty OP for the last temple because um, I'm going to have nothing to do for about 10 hours each way just playing the game. Morning, kiddos. It's nice to see you. Everyone's sealing good. Oh, there they go all over the place. My guess is this is my problem now. I'll help. Maybe she'll give me something cool. I have to give you a deposit to pick your shit up? And I'm being timed, okay? That's one, two. How heavy are these things? Come on. Okay, whatever. We'll figure it out. That's four. And they're only $50 an hour, too. When I started working here, I had to pay Mr. Krabs $100 an hour. Okay, so it seems most optimal to hit it from the back. Uh, phrasing? Seven. I do not have this. You failed! All right, let's try this again, only because uh, I want to get something cool. Why do I feel like I can't make any mistakes in pathing? I can't run with these things. And it fell out. I'm going to be one short. This one fell out. Why is this so frustrating? All right, if Ultra Hand doesn't work, then I have no idea. Okay, good. Looks like I can. One, two, three. I'm gonna hand them over. They're just gonna be covered in crazy glue. Well, that was much easier. Ta-da! Oh, damn it. There we go. Wow, that was much easier. Why do I feel like I could probably just farm this if I wanted to? I'll make note of that. Fire and ice. It's a pretty solid restaurant in Boston. 
It's like a giant hibachi grill. And oh, I gotta go. Uh, did we have to melt it first? Make it. Oh, it almost made it too small. It's like a giant all you can eat hibachi grill. And you kind of just like bring stuff up. You'd be like, yeah, I want a burger. I want stir fry. And they'll just throw it on and chop it all up. That's a lot of spikes. I don't know what I gotta do. Oh, can I slide down? Oh, yeah, it slides. Okay. So, just gonna have him bring that back for me. And then, uh, let's. We're gonna ride that down. Wait a second. Okay, never mind. What hell am I missing? There has to be, like, something else that I can. Oh, wait a second. This is just to send this down there. I don't need the ice cube. I need this thing. I got it now. I'll race you. Last one there is a piece of marble. Okay, so now I think I have to probably just, like, cover over here and step on something. Oh, it's just a gi Okay, I see. Just a giant button. Is that heavy enough? Yeah. Okay, now it's on a weird angle, so I need to get there before, like, it decides it wants to melt. Wow, uh, that one required too much brain power. All right, I see Death Mountain over in the distance. I'm gonna go pay my Goron brothers a visit. Oh, hang on. Wait, 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 I gotta help the sign guy. Because apparently up until now, my editor's been cutting these out. I swear to God, if you do it this time... I'll kill you. I've been nothing but a good citizen of Hyrule, and no one has been able to see it. I absolutely love this, though. I love this weird ongoing quest where you just have to help this guy prop a sign up. Okay, that's that's going to be the one. <laughs> this is incredibly excessive. There we go. Who says I'm not handy? Yeah, let it go. Watch this. I show my full support for President Hudson. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. I love, like, how he secures it. Like, that's horrible. Horrible craftsmanship. But he's dedicated. And here, have some sneaky mushroom rice balls? Why are they sneaky? We got some bocos here. We got a nice fire going, too. I have a weird question. Is there a better way to fuse items than to throw something on the floor? Can I just, like, fuse from my pack? Let's cook a little bit. We'll let him cook. All right, almost there. Gonna get nice and charred. The trick is you want to keep it rare on the inside. It's called a black and blue steak. What if somebody wants theirs well done? We ask them politely yet firmly to leave. This over here. Let's go check that out. There's a random tree in the- Whoa! What the f I want- I, I don't have anything. Oh my god. I wasn't ready! I- I'm not prepared! I'm not- No! No! Let me go! I was- I didn't know you were gonna be here! Alright, I gotta be able to do something here. Oh god. No, no, no! Alright. Into the water I go. How do you feel about water? Oh, the water doesn't- doesn't phase you, does it? Oh, it's gone. We'll call that one a draw. I didn't lose. Did the gloom die and I just didn't know it? What is this? Dark clump. An unusual substance. It's... Why is the music changing? Oh, God. It's under me, isn't it? That was so eerie. You know, it's kind of crazy how traumatized I am by the gloom because I was hearing the Lost Woods music and I was like, what is this music? And like not even realizing that I literally just did the Lost Woods in Breath of the Wild like a week and a half ago. This shrine is like dangerously close to the castle. It smells the gloom from here. It smells like pomegranates? That's strange. Speaking of pomegranates, you guys see that Lush collab they did for the Super Mario Brothers movie? So I have the Mario and Luigi body wash, and Luigi smells like green apples. Delicious. Mario is like pepper and pomegranate. Very interesting. But also smells pretty good. All right, this is a combat shrine, no problem. I'm gonna need to light this dude on fire, given all the fire fruit that's next to me. That's right, a lot of you were saying, hey, Chalk, why don't you just throw stuff instead of firing them on arrows? I don't know. Just like fusing things is cool. All right, watch this, I'll throw a grenade. Fire in the hole. <laughs> I really like doing these tutorial shrines that clearly you're supposed to do at the beginning of the game because they're like all in the middle of Hyrule and not after two dungeons. Whoa, whoa. There's like a cherry blossom in the middle of nowhere? This is nuts. Oh, hang on. I got to put like a fruit in there or something. I offer up a sacrifice to the tree. They didn't like that. I'm definitely supposed to do it with the carrot. Oh my God. What are you? We found a map to Candy Mountain. I don't know what quest I just opened up. I'm going to keep heading towards Death Mountain. Wait, I got to like I gotta hit this dude because he'll give me some rupees. Come on, spit him out. They run towards the cave. Hang on before we do that. Let's do a little bit of mining. Discovery! Crenel Hills Cave. What? Hello, Stone Talus. I remember you. I'm gonna try and hit that big glowy tumor you got. 
That's probably what I have to do here. I ain't afraid of you. See, in Age of Calamity, I had to jump on you and kill you. Oh! Looking for me? I'm over here. Of course, I don't have enough arrows. All right, got on top. I'm just, I'm just gonna attack this thing. I'm spitting out the, the pretty rocks. Ow! And, no, tell me, tell me they're doing a blood moon right now. Bro, are you kidding me? I'm just gonna chuck bombs. Or maybe not. Oh, wait, hang on, there's that frog. Maybe I don't need to fight the, uh, big-ass rock monster right now. I can get some bubble gum, and it's gonna be a blood moon anyway, so I should probably just do. I'll come back for you. This looks like a fun shrine. You gotta, like, make the ball jump over the gap. Check this out. Right in the... Oh, damn. But how will this affect LeBron's legacy? You gotta build, like, a Hot Wheels ramp. Those things never worked the way they did on the commercial. Check this out. That's got some lift on it. I tried building a lot of ramps as a kid when I used to skateboard a lot. Sometimes they worked. Sometimes, well, most times they didn't. Most times they fell apart. I knew nothing about carpentry. Right there, I'm gonna head towards that, and then uh, I guess we will do the next dungeon, the fire temple. But hang on, I wanna, I wanna try something. Try something I saw on the internet. You could probably guess where I'm going with this. Okay, let's see if this actually works. All right, launch me. Um, it didn't work. Oh, hello, squishy boys. Give me your jelly. Give me that jelly. Now, if we could only find a peanut butter flavored choo-choo. Giant ass tree. Oh, wait, let's make a sacrifice. Or a, or an offering. What would you like? What do we got? Want some bananas? No. There we go. It had to be an apple. Wow, I have 12 whole Korok seeds out of a thousand... Is it no longer hot in Death Mountain? Or are we just not close enough yet? Elden Canyon Skyview Tower. It's always nice to unlock a new one. Oh no, what did you do? Hello again, and good evening. Sorry, everything around here is a bit of a mess. Big chunk of old ruins fell from the sky and hit Skyview Tower. It knocked off the lid that covers the hole at the top of the tower. I guess I have to go inside. Can I rewind this? Sir, what would you like me to do? Now, keep an eye out for some ruins, just in case they fall. Like that one. Thank you for making my life easy. Right on time, too. I like a punctual piece of debris. All right, go right in through the top. Don't worry, I'll fix the thing. Oh, oh god, oh god! Perfect landing. All right, I got you. Link should get a job in the, uh, the elevator union. Now then, I think I'll take a little break. You didn't do anything. Oh, I wasn't even close to Death Mountain. I see it over there. I don't know if I'm gonna make that. I'm gonna have to go... I gotta start over here. Oh, some free stuff. All right, so we're gonna use this battery. I want to say I, I I know how this works, but I kind of don't. But I assume like more batteries last longer, unless you're a Game Gear. All right. <laughs> Look at this thing. Let's see how fast we can go. Look at us zooming. I'm just trying to get to that shrine. Cause I don't really have that many shrines and fast travel unlocked in the Sky Island, so water makes a way. Ready? Here's how you solve any puzzle in Tears of the Kingdom. You take uh, some kind of flat platform, you lift it up in the air, you rewind it, and then you glide. Because screw your game design. What, do I just have to blast this open? Okay, no problem. I'll just chuck a bomb. <laughs> you want me to use water? No, nah, that's okay. I'll just use this rock. Hey, look, ready? Just you lift it all the way up, you drop it, you rewind it, and you glide. That's how easy it is. All right, let's continue this journey. Death Mountain, you're looking kind of different. See, this is what happens when you vape. Okay, before we go to Death Mountain, it looks like we have to go to Goron Village first. I heard something about the uh, Zora's Domain that makes me a little bit excited to do that one last. I did that one first in Breath of the Wild, so I figure we'll mix it up a little bit. I feel like I was on this exact piece of mountain at some point in Breath of the Wild, just like looking around. Where's all the lava? They took all the lava. Death Mountain is now lukewarm. The hot springs are looking like soup that's been left out all day. Is this dude still here from last time? I don't remember if his name was Grap. Coming to the hot spring this hour. When the sun is beating down, you gotta be some kind of hot spring connoisseur to do that, traveler. Hot spring water here is the best. Though it used to be the Simmerstone Springs had the best water. Or the entrance collapsed and you couldn't get in. Zone Springs is in the caves of Gorko Tunnel, which is southeast of the springs here. Top secret, you see. Gonna be a Goron in the know-know about him. 
but the entrance got blocked off, so I can't ask Yonobo Co. to fix it. Did he start a construction company? That's the face of somebody who is currently peeing in the water. Oh, hang on. Let's go do that shrine. Just because I like fast traveling because I'm lazy. All right, we're here. Goron City. Not too hot anymore. You know, I kind of prefer it this way. Don't tell the Gorons I said that, though. The Marakaguk Shrine. Wield Wonders. Hmm. What do we got to do here? Oh, I see. Grab it from there. Probably attach it. Okay. Um, eh, good enough. That's functional. My guess is I have to, like, attach it to that and roll it across. Can you go in lava? I guess you can. Watch this. That, that seems right. You know what? Fine. It's whatever. <laughs> we will do things my way again. And then we do a nice, easy rewind. Oh, okay. Wait, I jumped too late. What they should have did was they should have named this game uh, The Legend of Zelda. I'll allow it. You can kind of just do whatever the hell you want. And let's see. What, what do I have to cheese next? Oh, you want me to go up? You know what goes up real nice? Platforms. Oh, shit! It's gone! I didn't see the hole over there! Oh, crap. Uh, what do I do now? I don't think I can ascend through this. Oh, I can't. I was like, that's not solid. I don't know if that's gonna work. Let's see. Okay, those are... Those are bombs. Are those balls? They're not bombs. Get down there. There's so many. I need to get them all in there. Come on, get get in there. Did I do it? Yeah, that's enough. What was the point of the cart? Oron City sure is beautiful at night. All right, let's head into the city. Talk to who we gotta talk to. Get some supplies. Okay, let's uh, let's pray. I think I have some orbs, but I'm not sure. I should have at least four, though. Why, right, 14? I kind of want some stamina. You know what? At this point, I just need hearts. So I'm going to load up on some hearts. We could do without stamina for now. Wow, this place hasn't changed a bit. Except for maybe like the smoldering ash and a uh, very thick smoke. Yo, bro, what's up with your eyes? Is everyone here okay? Everyone here is not well. They're eating this like tainted meat. Oh, here's Bluto. Crane, not you too. And after all my warnings about the marbled rock roast. Hey. What are you mumbling about over there? Who said that? Yo, dude's got pinky rings and shit now? You all talking about marble rock roast, are ya? Why is he dressed like a wrestler? The Yonobo Co. president. Sir, you were a buffoon a couple years ago. There's nothing to worry about, in my opinion. Now stop flapping your rock chompers and get over here, Goro! Uh, uh, what could you want? That's how you say hello to me? Yeah. Well, if it ain't Link, you're so tiny I barely even noticed you. Dude, you were a fool in the last game. Hey. You know, Bo, what's the big idea talking like that to our esteemed guest? Bluto, or should I say, boss, you really don't know your place, do you? All right, my man's here needs an ego check. You hear that, Bluto? You're not needed around here anymore. So, Link, what's your business with Goron City, huh? Everything seems fine here. They're just eating weird meat. You know, but I swear if you bring any more of that stuff, I'll... Oh, oh, oh my back. Still hasn't healed. Wow, I am not a fan of Yonobo running things. He's kind of a dick. I guess I have to go to his, like, Yonobo Co. HQ. How corny this shit is. I gotta come here and break everything. We have a human working here. Oh, I don't believe we've met before. You a new worker? Uh, yeah, that's right. I work here. Looks like I'm gonna have to get the Flame Breaker armor. That's expensive. I should sell some shiny rocks. This way I could buy the armor. Look at these two. Hey, it's you again. The one who knows President Yonobo. He's talking about marbled rock roast with the blonde lady right now. No one's allowed to come in. He said he got that weird mask from that lady too. He's always so nice, but as soon as he started wearing it, he got real mean. We gotta get that mask off him. Oh, you can go in by the way. The one rule that he gave us, we're gonna actually, we're gonna break right now. I was talking to the sage. Fire sage? Yo, that was sick. Please take off the weird mask, boys. Huh? Something's up here. What are these sages doing? Okay. Zelda's right. Marbled rock roast is good. It makes everyone happy. All right. Okay, it's a boss fight. Okay, I can't use this weapon. You know why? Because it's on fire. Is my bow on fire? It is. Am I supposed to hurt you? Okay, that doesn't work. Hmm. He definitely has to hit something specific. Oh, wait. He did. Oh, you are weak as hell! This staff is like a five. Yo, homie's fast. All right, one eye's out. Sleep with one eye open, Yonobo. Crack that thing right off your skull. What happened? 
Huh? Slurgo, off rock. I don't understand. Everything's a blur since I put on the mask from Princess Zelda. That wasn't Zelda. That was a sage, and she might have been bad. Huh? Huh? Did we huh? cause some kind of cave in? Because you were slamming into things? Princess huh? Zelda's outside, and I need to ask her about that mask and the marbled rock roast. Enough with the marbled rock roast. Stop eating that junk. This is uh, like that Futurama episode when they all got addicted to slurm. So. What's the secret ingredient? It's whatever your imagination wants it to be. Oh. The only way to break those rocks with my charge attack. Can't really see where I'm going when I charge. Link, <laughs> be my eyes and guide me, Goro. Yay, we got a new ability. I don't need to use bombs anymore to break stuff. Sick. All right, bust on out of here. Come on, boys. Let's go after Princess Zelda. What's that red haze spouting from Death Mountain, Goro? You don't remember President Yonobo? Told us the red haze is dangerous, then we shouldn't go near it. Huh. I remember now. Saw Princess Zelda at Death Mountain's crater. He talked to me and gave me that mask to wear. Does that mean Princess Zelda lives inside Death Mountain? Yeah, she has a vacation home there. Now, you guys stay here. You're toddlers. You can't come to Death Mountain. But Link, you have to. All right, up to Death Mountain we go. Look at these guys. Here, watch this. Hello. <laughs> I should, yeah, I should be using you. Get over there. Okay, that's gonna be very useful. So I feel like I have the bombs back now. Oh my god, the sign guy is here. Hang on, sign guy, I got you. That ain't going anywhere. Okay, mate, wait, wait, wait a second. Let me try that again. It's all weird. Okay, that that'll do it. There you go, twenty rupees, please. Look at that, the work of art. Money talk. All right, we made it. Wait, hang on. Before I do anything, there's a shrine here. I ain't climbing this again. Oh, hang on. Cutscene time. Link over there. Over where? Careful, dude's gonna just roll off the mountain. I think it was near here. When I came up the mountain, I saw her. The princess was standing right here, Goro. And then she gave me this fancy mask to wear around. After that, oh jeez, after no that, use. I remember nothing because I, I was brainwashed. That oh, that can't be good. There she is. Princess. That ain't Princess Zelda. I don't know if we've caught on yet. I know Yunobo has like a singular brain cell, but it's erupting and we're in the middle of it. Oh, gross. What the hell is that? Yo, what the hell? What is this? Aragia. We gotta fight the mountain. Not like the Game of Thrones mountain, but like Death Mountain. That marbled rock, is it alive? Ah, that's what you've been eating. That's nasty. Oh, hang on. We, we probably need this thing. I'm afraid to go off the mountain. I really don't want to have to climb this again. Wait, there's the shrine. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. You know what? I, I'm just, I'm too far in right now. We got to get up there. You know has got to do his thing. On, go up, go up, go up. Yo, we have a lot of battery on this. Hit him. Easy. They did say we would have flying cars in 2023. All right, that's two. This is a pretty handy ability to have. Easy. We, we did it? We did it. What was that thing anyway? I thought Princess Zelda walked off somewhere around here. Huh? Whoa, you're not supposed she fell into that hole, do you? Come on, Link, let's hurry down there. I really want to do that shrine first. I know you're like gung-ho to... Yeah. Oh, he, he just, he went in. Well, I don't think he'll mind. Just a quick shrine break. The Sitsum Shrine. Rolling device. If we should have did this earlier. It would have prepped us. Yeah, monster trucks. All right, here we go. W where are we going exactly? Ah, there we go. See it over there. Well, that was fun. I'm starting to get a gander of, like, what I can actually build in this game. And so hopefully we're not just playing the remainder of the game with, like, a rock on a stick and a fan on a minecart. You know, it was just waiting for us at the bottom of the volcano. You know, he could wait a little longer. I think I can use my amiibo again now. Ocarina of Time. Don't fail me. Ooh! I, I can't wear it right now, though. But ooh! All right, in we go to Satan's butthole. The Death Mountain Chasm. Wow, this is deep. Be careful not to uh, go splat. So we're in the depths, kind of. Okay, so I, I learned something. It's the Mustis Light Route, which is sit some backwards, which means we are directly under the sit some shrine. Kind of scary inside Death Mountain. Who knew it would look like this? Now that I look closer, I see a whole lot of those red rocks. Oh, another memory. Come. Come. To, to him, to him. It was coming from that way that eerily looks like some sort of temple. It's the fire sage. Link, why don't you speak up? You know what it is. Yeah, that's that's a temple. Oh my God, this thing is massive. I thought the lightning temple was big. Look at this thing. 
The Fire Temple, Lost Garandia, Rediscovered. Wow, real, real big Ocarina Time vibes right now. So my guess is, uh, you know, just destroy the rock right in the front. All right, inside we go. Something up ahead. I have a feeling I'm just gonna need to use him for all the puzzles. I have to break a bunch of walls. Dude, this is sick. This has to be the biggest temple in the game, right? It's Zelda Goro. She's on some evil shit. I don't know. Oh, now she's trapped. Come on, open up. Gee, I wonder what I have to do here. Do I have to release the five locks? All right, I might actually have to do something with water this time. No, I don't. No, I don't. Watch this. <laughs> Easy. I see what I got to do here. I like how when you're in a minecart, though, he automatically just, like, goes to the front. Oh, get in, get in, get in. All right. I don't know where I'm going. What is this? Oh, that's cool. A lot of minecart stuff in this one. I don't know if I like this one or the lightning one more so far. It's close. Um, oops. He's like, don't worry, I'm fine. Can I launch him over there? There we go. Oh, cool. That'll create uh, some platforms coming down this way. And then I will immediately jump into the lava. Let's do this the way Nintendo intended. There we go. We can hit these gongs. Do your thing. Dinner's ready. <laughs> That was funny. It was like, oh, that must be the first padlock, Link. I'm probably gonna go that way. Let me see if I can lift this. Spin that over. Why'd you do it? Is that what he's saying? Why'd you do it? I didn't do anything. Why'd you do it? Come here, Goron man. Got a job to do. I do kind of wish there were buttons for activating um, the, do you want to call them champions? Like the champion powers. Can I only launch him downward? Do I need to like build a ramp? Mm, I have an idea. I just, I need someone to confirm if I can only launch him straight. It seems like I kind of need to build like a ramp. That should work. Yay! It's like in physics class when I had to uh, build something to like drop an egg out of a window and the egg had to not break. I don't remember what I built. Couldn't tell you. All right, that's two gongs. If you wanted to know what I'm doing, not even I know. I'm getting lost. This is a good place to get lost, too. Was that a gong over there? I think I just need a, a higher slope. That seems like it'll do it. You know what? It's going to be close. Come on, hit the gong. Yeah! Only one left. I'm going to find a way in there somehow. It's probably going to be another, like, enter from the top situation. Yeah, let's see. I think we're going up here now. I'm onto something. Seems like it's just, like, on the other side of this wall. I kind of want to drop down, but I don't want to have climbed up here for no reason. That's all the locks, Link. Zelda, it's 
Come on, Joy! 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 Beat that eyeball. Whew. That was, uh, that was, that was intense. All right, that was, a that was a good boss fight. I think out of the three boss fights so far, that one was my favorite. I don't know what is waiting for me at Zora's Temple, though, so that could very well change everything. He's just staring at the shrimp. He's like, tempura fried goodness. Where's he gonna wear his? So far, we have an earring. We have an ankle bracelet. Maybe a nose ring. He'll get a septum piercing. I am your ancestor from a time long past. That mask looks like a fish. Many oh, we're gonna get to see hot ago, Ganondorf again. Oh, we're gonna talk about the imprisoning war for the third time. This is a good water break. We've seen this three times. Fight alongside the swordsman. Yeah, yeah, you know how the story goes. Uh, I don't know if I'm nearly as great as my ancestor was. Yo, you know, Bo, put the mask back on. Because you were then, cocky, you had an ego, confidence. Out, I'd be letting everyone else down. There's no way I'll let that happen. I can do this. Oh, it's a belly button ring. All right, another tier of the kingdom secured. We have one left, and then I assume we get the Master Sword the and fire. fight Ganondorf. But I'm not 100% sure. Yo, all right, Sonic the Hedgehog. Link, hold out your fist. <laughs> that was the cutest fist bump ever. Bro fist. All right, I have been shrine grinding. I've also been playing a lot of Street Fighter. Hang on, my Switch is still on airplane mode because I was traveling. So let's scan our amiibo. What's in this chest? I feel like the chest colors probably indicates the rarity. Another Knight's Broadsword. Oh, that's an 18. I really should get some more Zelda amiibo so I can get more of the costumes, but I know you can get the costumes like in the depths, so. You technically don't need amiibo to get anything in this game. You just get it earlier. Let's see, can I get the pants? Ah, maybe tomorrow. By the way, you guys like my cool mask I found? Found it in the depths. All right, up into the air we go. We have one temple left, and that is the water temple, which I heard is the best one, which is not usually the case for water temples. I also have much more stamina than last time. This, you guys have made it very clear that I'm going to need more stamina for the Master Sword, which is the opposite of what we needed to do for Breath of the Wild. You need more hearts. Do I dare go into the depths? Not this time. I want to find some more Gloom Hands. I have a score to settle. I mean, I say that until I come across Gloom Hands. Is there any way to actually find them, or is it just completely random? Oh, you look busy. Hang on, I'll help you out. Ouch. I shot the wrong guy. Watch him turn out to be uh, a Yiga Clan. Oh, good. He's going to give me food instead. Oh, a Korok. Hang on. We should help them get to their friend. Be gentle, okay? Okay, I got you. I'll be gentle. <laughs> anyway, back to more pressing matters. Well, here's Zora's Domain. Ooh, it's all mucky. Someone forgot to turn on the filter, huh? Oh, it actually is, like, muck. What happened? That's nasty. I should probably go do that shrine down there because I need one more to get another stamina upgrade. So we can do that here. Plus, I need the fast travel because I'm lazy. Okay, it's just like raining sludge. This is pretty gross. Got to figure out what's happening here. Also, what kind of cool power am I going to get? Vile sludge. Ugh, I am so sorry. Everyone has been treated now. We've used up all the splash fruit. Huh? Nothing to apologize for. We did what had to be done. Most importantly, I am grateful that everyone is all right. Now, if we could just do something about this statue. My friend and other people told me that this is basically just kind of like Mario Sunshine which I'm about, and one of the reasons why I saved it for last. You there, are you a traveler? I'm so sorry I did not notice you until now. I was focused on a matter of great importance, like cleaning up this feces water. I would argue that Zora's Domain probably got the shit end of the stick here. No! We were just discussing how we need to wash away the sludge. They want me to throw the splash fruit. Let's see, oh, I got like 29 splash fruit. Bah, splash. Like, oh, that looks a lot better. The sludge, I see you managed to wash it away. In truth, that statue, Picks the majestic forms of a pair who saved the cherished domain in the past. Yeah, me and Prince Sidon. That is right, beloved Prince Sidon of the Zora and his very best friend, Sir Link, the heroic Hylian swordsman. I would love to meet him someday. Yeah, I wonder where he is. You have similar eyes. Oh, thank you. Are you Link, the swordsman of legend? Like, hey, stop being weird. Quite surprised to learn that you are the legendary swordsman, Sir Link. 
I'm Yona. <laughs> Truly honored to have the opportunity to, to meet you, Sir Link. Oh, I have a lovely idea. If you don't mind, uh, I ask that you go and meet with Sidon. I'm certain he would be delighted to see you. I mean, after all, he is my very best friend. He's in Mifa Court all the way up there. I gotta take this mask off. It's freaking me out. Putting the hood back on. Which, by the way, I learned that there's like a side quest that you can do to be able to put the hood down. Why does that need a quest? I wonder if at the top there's still a, a Lionel up there. Because I'm pretty sure they're still in this game. I haven't seen one yet. Then again, I probably haven't seen most of this game yet. And I have almost 50 hours. See, unlike Mario Sunshine, this sludge does not harm you. Oh, that's right, we have stairs now. I forgot that we got, like, access to the stairs after we freed the Divine Beast. Link's getting all his steps in today. I just realized I didn't go do the shrine. So, you know what? We'll, we'll do the shrine after this. See, a couple years ago, all I had to do was wear the Zora tunic, and I could swim up. Don't know if that's what I'm supposed to do here, but... We have Ascend, which is kind of just the same thing. You do it through rocks. All right, getting to the top. There better be a shrine up here. I ain't doing this again. Thank God. I hen a shrine. Whoever I have to talk to here, you have to wait. I'm sorry. Mid-air perch. We're going to do this my way. I was going to lift it and rewind it, but then I realized that these, uh, they don't come back down. Is that really just going to stand up like that? Can Link do like an ultra hand bottle flip? That would be cool. Really appeal to the Gen Zers. I know what they like. Oh! That doesn't even reach. All right, drastic times call for drastic measures. Take me over there, makeshift elevator. I gotta bring a ball over. Okay, I can do that. Make a, oh wait, what's this? Oh, yeah, I get it now. I build a ramp, like Build-A-Bear, but for skaters. All right, go. Damn. Oh, I get it. I, I get it. You didn't think I understood. You were like, there's no way Chalk understands this. But I do. <laughs> Ta-da! <sighs> Sometimes I forget how much of a genius I am. Okay, so yeah, I know I just like climbed this whole mountain and everything. But I want to go do that other shrine. It would suck to get hit with some of that falling sludge. I don't know if that's actually possible. But I would just like plummet from the sky. And I would smell horrible the entire way down. The Mogawak Shrine. Name one of those gremlins. No, that's Mogwai. The power of water. What the hell is this? I don't know what this is, so... Does it activate this? Do I have to, what is this? Do I have to, like, flush a toilet? Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Here's something I didn't see. Probably gotta turn this. Okay, well, that needs more things, because it has to spin. Is two enough? Oh, actually, I think it is. All right, we got one thing going. Is this like a battery? I charge it? My guess is I charge it, then I have to bring it to these other things to activate them. Okay, give it, give it a quick charge. Oh, nice! All right, that was the whole shrine. Okay. All right, let's finally go talk to Sidon, AKA Fish Daddy. I didn't call him that. You guys coined that term. Hey, uh, what are you doing? Is it really you? Side on goaded character. It's good to see you, my friend. Give me a hug. Where am I hug at? Link, it has been far so long. I received word that you had gone missing. Did nobody come looking for me? Everyone's like, Link, I heard you went missing. That sucks. What could have possibly transpired? Look at the just sludge in the background. Just cascading. When you decide to eat McDonald's twice in one day. See, old friend, this place is the source of water that flows into Zora's domain. That is why I must use my power of water manipulation to separate the sludge from our water in order to clean it. Sidon is the water Hashira? Say, Link, have you been to Skyview Tower over yonder? We're going to head over there to Skyview Tower first because Sidon was like, please, for the love of God, can you just go to Skyview Tower? Oh, wait, I can't get through the sludge. Oh, wait, no, I have splash fruit. What am I talking about? I mean, it'd be nice to not have to use fruits and I'd just be able to use, like, Sidon's ability, who has, I don't know, water manipulation. Why do I got to waste food? All right, another tower, another free skydiving session. Oh, wow, look at this. Some new stuff over here. Oh, damn, there's a lot of sky islands over here in this archipelago. See, I can say, uh, I want to check out this, like, round planet. What is this, Mario Galaxy? Oh, there's a shrine in here. The Jirutu... Jirutagumak. Galima. Flying device. All right, Oh, I'm float. Do some flying. Do I just have to get over there? All right, let's fly. I should probably stand on the tail, right? So I go up. 
Oh, shit. What happened there? You saw that? Ouch! I was like in the air and I jumped. I, I did a double jump. Probably gonna need this fan. Why would it be here? There's like cars falling. Okay, I think I understand. Just gotta catch one of these cars. Come on. This seems challenging. What? This is why we don't have flying cars in 2023. Because we're waiting for Link to build them. Oh, wait a second. Wait, I got an idea. Let's see, can we catch it? If I just mash the A button, it's eventually gotta attach itself to something, right? No! Get back here! God, I am so good at video games. All right. Now we are in business. Link's out here designing the next Tesla. This is gonna work, right? This is some, like, Wiley e. Coyote Looney Tunes ass shit. All right, here we go. It's working. It's working! Steer, steer, go right. Go a little, go a little bit right. Okay, stand on the tail so we go up. This is about the time when the Acme Studios, uh, flying car would All right, don't need that anymore. All right, just me the orb and I'll be on my way. Oh, I see. That's the reason why it's... Hang on. Give me that. Make it stop spinning. Where do I go from here? Do I have to, like, bomb Battlefield cannon my way out? Do I skate this thing like a pool? I'll just move this thing over here so we can get out. Actually, I gotta go back and see Sidon, so let's do that. All right, Sidon, I, uh, I fixed the tower. Link, my dearest friend, is there anything you would like to inquire about? Ask me whatever your heart desires, and I shall do what I can to help. You got games on your phone? Right, so I gotta go to Toto Lake, which is, like, over here. It has something to do with this giant waterfall that is just cascading. I've used that word a lot this video. It's a good term, cascading. I did it. I made it to Toto Lake. Do we gotta do the Blood Moon thing now? It freaks me out. Not gonna lie. It's just, it's the music. Ooh, that's, that's actually kind of gross. It's like a chocolate fondue just falling from the sky. Although I would like that a lot, if a chocolate fondue could fall from the sky. You know, if all the raindrops or lemon drops and gum drops, you know how it goes. We all watched Barney. Yo, you coming, G? Oh wait, something over there. Probably something to do with this. Oh, here's the dude. I'm the dude. Ancient Stone Slate was written by our Zora ancestors from the distant past and left for us to discover. Yeah, it looks great. All right, the broken slate. We gotta find some pieces, which are... Oh, here's one. Hey, that back. I don't know if I'm really qualified for this. Oh, is it just one piece? Oh, that's it. Dude, it was right there. You didn't see that? Link, I must thank you. Just translate it for me. Wow, that's a lot of words. Too bad I'm not reading them. So, I guess I'll just go back to Zora's Domain. I'll go see the king, who should be there. I'd be like, hey, can you mark this arrow? Or give me like one of your signature arrows. Kingdorfin Super Punch and Super Kick. Yeah, I'm so big. I, I don't know if Kingdorfin can do any of those things. The sludge is so yucky. Hey, uh, you kids seen uh the king? Damn, I'm not allowed to play the Kingdorfin game. That's messed up. I think I know what I have to do here. And if I do, it's very clever. Okay, it is. My brain was just like, what if you just teleport behind them? You know, nothing personal, kid. And I just like hang out in the floor. Like if I go like this, I can eavesdrop. I guess it's a spot with clear water where you can get your tummy clean. Somewhere between Ployma's Mountain and the Domain. Entrance behind the waterfall. Cool. Ooh. Gotta be like over here, right? Wait, look at this like part right here. It looks like Zoidberg. And here's my unwarranted best Zoidberg impression. Thank you, and please remember to subscribe. That water looks clean enough, right? Aha! Discovery! Pristine Sanctum. Yo, this- he's just chilling in, like, his bachelor pad. Oh, it's Muzu. This mofo holds my ever-loyal Muzu. You speak in such a way without explanation. Link here. Only be confused as to what's going on. So they're just in hiding in the pristine sanctum because they met the sage. The sage unleashed some kind of beast, and uh, they got their ass beat. They won, but they're just, like, hiding in the bat cave right now. All leads back to the sky, though. This disaster, sludge, the monster, even Princess Zelda. It may well be that the answer to these riddles can only be found skyward. He's like, oh, I wonder if uh, Giotto's making any progress with the riddle. Yeah, he did, because I solved the whole thing. And, oh, yeah, the Mark of the King. Uh, could you autograph my arrow? Oh, it's a king's scale. L please rip a scale off your body. He's like, oh, here you go. I had some extras. All right, I found the king. Uh, I need to get the Zora armor because I'm pretty sure I have to swim up, like, one of those waterfalls. Eileen, footsteps. 
Who are you, who are you making over there? Yeah. You've spoken with Lady Yona? She is, oh, she is attempting to repair your Zora armor. Lady Yona, uh, Sir Link is here to pick up his armor. Need an ancient arowana. And finish the armor if I can somehow acquire a scale from that fish. <laughs> your armor is as good as new, finally. Of course, it's not gonna help you climbing waters that have been tainted with sludge, but <laughs> that waterfall over there, now that's a waterfall. I feel like I'm playing Breath of the Wild again. I mean, it is a direct sequel, but just getting flashbacks of uh, going to the castle, swimming my way up to Ganon. They wanted me to just go up to Mipha Court. I could have fast traveled. Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, this waterfall seems fine enough. Oh, maybe I'll grow a third arm or something. Big deal. Or look like that radioactive fish from The Simpsons. All right, three-eyed fish. Okay, a lot of sludge here. I don't have a ton of splash fruits. So I'm gonna try to preserve some. Although I feel like I'm gonna need to clear something here, like maybe right up here. Let's see, is a, is a piranha plant gonna pop out and bite me? Oh wait, the whole reason that I'm here. I'm like, why do I have to come up here? I gotta shoot an arrow through the teardrop one, which I think is that one. Imagine I had no arrows right now. Ta-da! Now you can blow bubbles. Damn, we just created a fresh waterfall. Or or maybe not. I'm gonna say, I haven't gotten to the water temple yet, but so far I've liked every temple. Let's rank them right now. Fire, worst, then wind, then lightning. My guess is the water temple is going to be the best one. All right, I'm in the water, now what? What's the clue? You know what, I should probably talk to Sidon and Yona who's like up here. Lady Yona, it is far too dangerous for you to be here. Yes. Darling, I came here because there's something I need to speak with you about. I've been thinking for quite some time. Uh-oh, uh, maybe I shouldn't be here for this. Oh wait, a link's here. What's happened, my friend? You figure something out? Cheeky bricky, palchik wiki. You solved the ancient stone slate riddle and a pillar of light appeared? Link shows up and he solves two ancient riddles in like 15 minutes. The words upon the stone slate are correct. A path to the sky may open up if we investigate that location. I just went there. You know, I should have talked to them before I jumped over. Uh oh, something's bubbling up. Sludge monsters? It's a sludge like? The monster's covered in sludge. Could it be the foul beast that harmed father? We're gonna kick his ass. Sidon, new best sage, hands down. All right, let's rank the new sages. Sidon, number one. Riju, number two. Tullin, number three. And then, I'm sorry, you know Bo's annoying. Right, help me out. Yeah, we're gonna do that. He can't hit me. Idiot. Ouch. Okay, ready? Just, oh, he hit it. Damn it. There we go. Can you recharge faster, please? Come on. There we go. Ew. Ew, it's gross. Put the sludge back on. There we go. It hit it right in its little tonsil. Get him, Sidon. Jump his ass. Come on. Show me what that mouth do. Yo, Sidon wasted no time. It's like, get his ass. You hurt my dad. And he's dead. Oh, he ate a treasure chest. No wonder he had a tummy ache. Let's go, Link, to the Pillar of Light. So I was just over by the pillar of light and I touched it and it went away. It, it, no one wants this treasure chest? Okay, I'll take this completely random treasure chest. Random. All right, I'm here. Where's Sidon? Uh, are you kidding me? So I, I guess let's go to the pillar of light doesn't mean literally let's go to the pillar of light. It means let's stand next to it on this rock. So that is the clue for reaching the sky. The Northern Lights. I've already told the story, but uh, I went to Iceland and I went on a Northern Lights tour and mm -hmm. they take you on this bus and they're like, oh, we're gonna go see the I Northern Lights. You know, it's like 60 bucks a person. They drive you out there and if you don't see the Northern Lights, it says in the fine print, like if the weather's not right, you get a refund. So we were out there and we're like, uh, clearly like the weather wasn't right. But we didn't see it at all. We're like, no, 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 look, it's over there. Look, you see it? And we're like, mm, I don't think so. Wow, he's fast. When you're in the pool with your friends in the summertime, you make a whirlpool. All right, water temple, here we come. We'll do a big dive. Did I make it? Am I dead? All right, water temple's gotta be the best one. It's usually the worst. I feel like it's gotta be the best. Well, that looks clogged. How are we opening this? Bombs? I didn't think I was that close. All right, nobody has to know that happened. No one's here, right? Well, Sidon's not even here. No one knows that happened. Please don't be dirty sewer water. We made it, the water temple. Discovery, ancient Zora waterworks. Okay, this is not the water temple yet. Gonna have to definitely uh, unplug some more of these. Don't have many bombs. You know, actually, I don't have many arrows, so I might as well just throw the bomb. I could just use Yonobo, but 
he's lazy. We gotta get this water level up. I probably don't need to. There's probably a way to cheese this, but let's play it by the books. Unless this temple is really annoying. Chest? Hang on, let's take that. What's in here? Oh, it smells like mildew. Ooh! I'm using the Zora shield. All the Zora stuff's just got like a cool aesthetic in this world. Because I didn't really care for Zora's domain in previous games, really. And when I say previous games, I really just mean Ocarina of Time. Is that a big one that's plugged up? No, that just... That just seems like where I have to go. I don't know what's going on over there. Oh, wait. I'm going here. Now, where are those Ninja Turtles at? I just want to talk. I'll congratulate them on... Oh, just a keys. I want to congratulate them on uh, Mutant Mayhem looking awesome. Can't go up there yet. I'm, wait. Wait. Maybe I can. I can. All right. Right through the, the gross sewer grate. I have this fear that I'm going to one day drop my phone into a sewer grate and it's just going to be gone forever. Just, if I re even if I recovered that thing, no thank you. Yeah. All right, that's that's definitely more full. We can get up there now. That's got to be the water temple, right? It looks water temple-y. Question is, how are we getting in there? Easy. Playing the game the way it was meant to be played. All right, here we go. Last temple. Ooh. What's going on here? But oh, just kidding. We're not at the last temple. I have to go up there. I don't know why I forgot about this. Can we just clear the sludge so I can go up the waterfall? Oh, we get a separate clean waterfall. Uh, partially clean. When you're at Universal, you stand under the ride that has the giant bucket of water. Honestly, the water temple being in the sky would be pretty awesome. Link, what happened? Is this your doing? Yeah, you see, while you were standing around, um, I was actually doing things. Ah, oh. I did the teeth thing! He's back! Here. Here. Up here! Come here. Uh, okay. All right, here we go. This is a long waterfall. Can't see anything. Wellspring Island. Whoa! There's, like, there's low gravity up here. I can jump in these, right? Just like in the trailer. I wonder what happens if one pops. What is this place? My body feels light as a feather. This is a strange place indeed. Right now, we must focus on locating the source of the sludge. Let's split up, gang. I'm gonna just probably ride in one of these bubbles. That seems like what I gotta do. Oh, is this some zone I hear? Die! 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 Don't fall, don't fall! Ah! Oh. oh no. Should I be clearing this off? Probably no, right? Seems like a waste of my splash fruits. Maybe this one? Oh god. Aha! That's cool. That right there, that little piece of game design teaches you that you can jump into these and just ascend up. You know we're doing a shrine right now. You already know. Because if I fall off the damn moon island, I'm gonna be pissed. Orbs of water. We got low gravity here, too. Oh, okay, I see. I rewind you. Do you still explode, or do you unexplode? Oh, shit! <laughs> I'm over jumping! I gotta be careful, because I keep, like, overdoing it. What are we doing here? Something. Oh, I gotta build a ramp. I don't know if bubbles work that way. I think they immediately pop. Unless you have, like, those... I don't know if anybody but me knows what this is. There was, like, an infomercial on when I was a kid, and they sold these bubbles that were, like, made of plastic that you could blow. Just roll it, stick it, and blow, blow, blow. And watch your balloon grow, grow, grow. And it came with, like, a straw. And, um, I may have inhaled too much of that as a kid. Okay, that, that seems to work. There, I did it before you. How many orbs do I have now? Seven? Oh, I can almost get two more upgrades. There's a sludge chest in here. I can't pull it out. Splash it out. This is just Mario Sunshine in 2023. In fact, it's a better Mario Sunshine game than Mario Sunshine is. Oh, I'm gonna get some hate for that joke. I just wanna say that I do like Sunshine, but it is definitely not held up in the past 20 years. That may be disappointing, but sorry, it is true. I feel like whenever I replay Sunshine, I'm like, man, I like this game for like the first few worlds. And then you get to Pianta Village and it's like, ugh. All right, that should be enough to get me to the waterfall. Tanan's just like, I've been waiting here for three hours. Done and done. Link, let us keep pushing forward. That, that's gotta be the water temple. All right, here we go, big waterfall. The final ascent. From what I can tell, all the sludge waterfalls are flowing from the ruins above here. The Water Temple. The Great Wellspring of Hyrule. Oh, it's like an outdoor water temple. This is cool! Alright, so that thing over there is spraying all the mud. I made 
name is Mud. Please just be like a giant piranha plant. How magnificent to think that such a structure was floating in the sky above our own Zora's domain. But no one ever thought to look up, because we're always looking down at our phones. If only we could make use of that water. Get real close to the sludge to scan our hand. Oh, I see. We gotta, we gotta clean it out. All right, that's that works. Is there gonna be a, a mon? Oh, okay, it didn't work yet. Not. We need a stronger stream. The sound again. The voice is like, "But what if you added more water?" This is the source of the pure waters of Zora's domain. There's a Poland spring head. They should use this. Use your power to turn on the four faucets, and you can collect water. Okay, four faucets. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. All right, watch out. We gotta turn the water on. What, what can we do here? Sidon, can you... Can I walk through? Ah, I can. Oh, no, I don't weigh enough. You know, but go stand on that. Okay, there is a ball over there. Oh, wow. Okay. What's the point of the spikes? Is there a point? <laughs> Get it? <laughs> spikes. Points. Comedy. Oh, I think I know. You gotta, like, you gotta plug it in. Like, it's like one of those Lego pieces, you know, like the ball and joint. Sometimes I just, I feel way too smart. Almost like these puzzles aren't challenging enough for me. And now watch, I gotta use water with the, the thing to move it. Zidon's got the water power. There we go. All right, unclog that. Do you think Nintendo only had two plumbers on their roster? Wow, look at this. Look at this sunset. Can we just, everyone just take a minute to appreciate the beautiful sunset? Okay, appreciation time's over. This definitely isn't the way to get up here, but who's to tell me that I'm playing the game wrong? Oh, I see, I see what I have to do. I'm gonna create a longer one, like this. One, and two, and I'll get you started. Maybe you gotta use the bubble to conduct the electricity? All right, don't get too close to that. That's incredibly dangerous. All right, another, hey, fast, fast. All right, two down. What the hell is going on up there? There's something on that. Is it just sludge? Can I go inside? Yeah, I probably gotta stop that. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. Maybe I could just like throw some water in there. I'll be honest, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Something in there. What if I did this? Yeah, that works. But like, I have to slow time somehow. All right, side on, let's do our thing. Get out of the way. All right, just one more thing. Okay, so I think I know what I have to do here. Oh wait, I have to drain this. I was gonna say, I thought I might have to get in from under it. What is this? That doesn't stay. I think I probably have to attach it to one of these. I'm gonna still say that I wish the dungeons were a little bit longer, but I'm just, I'm happy that they're back. Okay, that'll drain that. You know, ball, is there a ball somewhere? Or this runs out of battery. Oh, do I need that giant ball that's on a completely different Part of the map yeah, it's down here i just probably need to put it in one of the bubbles here i come watch out there it goes oh a perfect spot too now all i have to do is just lift this up drain the water ball goes in i go over here i turn on the last faucet then i assume it's boss time done you did it, Link. no we did it i'm a team player all right, let's turn this thing on. All right, let's pour one out for the homies. Let the rain fall down and wake my dreams. Let it wash away my sanity. Look, the sludge dissolved. The domain is surely safe now. All right, we did it. Of course it washed a monster out. You think there were gonna be no parasites in this thing? Ew, what is that? Muckdurok! Please tell me this is this little guy is the boss. Whoa! Frickin' sharks with frickin' muckterocks on their frickin' heads. Sidon, probably gonna need you here. Oh, I missed. Whoa! Okay, jump over that. Come here, right. Gah! <laughs> Get back here! Get back here! Dude, he's like perfect chaos. Woo! Can I just use a splash fruit? Probably, right? <laughs> Wait, I want to try something. Yeah! That didn't do as much damage as I thought it was going to, but it's fine. Oh my god, we can just... Why am I using Sidon when I can just throw gourds at the man? Alright, let's see what that next phase looks like. 
He's so weird. Are you going to make it rain? All right, no problem. I'll clear that easy. I, I'm not even going to do that. Come on, come on out. This is just Splatoon now. You guys see that Foam Stars game that Sony's putting out, which is just like horny Splatoon? Ready for the Foam Star party? Helicopter, helicopter. Get back here. I got to clear the sludge mostly because he's dropping the frame rate. Right, let's skewer this man. Do I have any arrows left? I'm out. We do it the old fashioned way. Ow. I'm at a splash. You're really the last hit I have to use side on. Oh, side on. If you can come over here, please. Get him. Come on. Poke your stupid ass. <laughs> Is he's like when Squidward spits the fork out after he chokes and they give him a CPR. Yeah, that was fun. It's tough. It, it was either this or the Lightning Temple were my favorites. This one was a little short. I think the Lightning was like the, the meatiest temple. This fire was like long, but it was kind of annoying. All right, we got another heart here, and then um, I should be able to buy almost two more stamina pieces, which will give me two full wheels. Because we got to pull the Master Sword. All right, let's go uh, get the Shrimp Tempura. Is this triggering for Sidon? He's like, my people, they have suffered. All right, we're going to hear about the Imprisoning War for the fourth time. Still looks hot, even the fourth time seeing him. We got them all. Side on best I sage, hands down. So that I could save Sora's domain. You know what? Rank the sages in the comment section. Like I'm curious to see who you guys help. like. I will accept this secret stone. Accept the secret stone. And let's kick his secret ass. He's got it in the gauntlet, too. Behold, this is my new power. Yo, tell him. Alright, all the temples are done. I, I don't think we're done. Because I still have to go do all the hieroglyphs and pull the master sword and I got to fight Ganondorf and we're going to be busy for a little while. This journey is not ending just yet. And then Zora's domain got some shock and a couple of chlorine tabs and it was back to normal. Okay, I've been hearing a lot of good things about the memories in this game and how cool it is to pull the master sword. So we're going to do all of that right now. First, I should probably unlock this tower. Good evening. Seems we meet again, eh? Sorry, the Skyview Tower is out of order. And maintenance is proving tricky. What's wrong? Checked all the terminal parts. Nothing's broken. I wonder if something to do with the tower itself is broken. Structure looks pretty good to me. Yep, that's a nice erect tower. Well, I can tell you this. We probably need to use these floating platforms to get up. Oh, God. Oh, hello. Sorry. Didn't mean to intro. Oh, God. <laughs> the rocket just went flying. Let's give it a little poke. Oh, hang on. I see the problem. Wait, no, no, stop, stop, stop going so high. Do this this way, I guess. Get out of the way. All right, now the top can open. Hello, I fixed it. Yeah, press the button now. Let me know if that works. I feel like Verizon tech support. Just not waiting on the phone. Be like, all right, if you could just reboot the router now. Okay, is the is the light flashing blue? Well, there's the forest. I could have told you that. Okay, so, uh, whoops, I went, <laughs> I went to the wrong tower. But I did need that tower anyway, so kind of glad I got that out of the way. Like, there's one of the hieroglyphs. But I don't, I don't really know the story yet or what the significance is, but we're going to do all of them. We're going to do all of them in order. I'm going to make sure I do them in order. Speaking of doing things in order, there's a nice shrine we're going to pop into. And I'm pretty sure that's the stable we have to go to to talk to Impa. So it's a win-win. Sinakawak Shrine. Sinakawak Paddywhack. Give the dog a bone. An uplifting device. Well, they're all uplifting because I'm going to cheese this. Oh, look at that. If you stand the candle up, you can make the hot air balloon fly. I don't know if a candle from like Bed Bath & Beyond is going to make a uh, a hot air balloon fly. I think I just need to uh, make that hit the button. That was easy. I probably got to use one of these. Float that up. There we go. God, oh, I'm burning it. There. All right, slowly but surely. I now realize I could have rode on the one with the little ball. I now have to manually climb this ladder. <laughs> I beat this one up here. No way. One. You know, I probably didn't need both of these. One of them is probably for a treasure chest. Eh, maybe there'll be something good in there. It's a rock. Now remember, it's not the size of the ball that matters. It's the difficulty of the puzzle. Oh my god, a mop? Well, hang on. New favorite weapon. Link's gonna throw hands like he works at the Waffle House. All right, where's Impa? Because I gotta start this quest officially. Lady Impa, where are you? You tell me. I heard that y'all- Everyone heard we went missing! Nobody cared! Like, oh, she's still gone? That's unfortunate. Well, let me know when she gets back. 
But I encourage you to go speak to Lady Impa, who is Ooh. over there doing who knows what. All right, the Geoglyph quest is about to begin. There you are. What a surprise it is to see you here after all this time, Link. Let me guess, you heard we went missing. Oh my God, everybody. During the upheaval, huge pictures appeared out of nowhere. Images that sprawled across fields and hills. How were they able to tell, though, if nobody was using these towers because they were deactivated? How'd they get the overhead view? Oh, there's the explanation. She took a hot air balloon. Wind struck and completely sheared the balloon off the base. I've racked my brain for ways to reattach. Okay, watch this. I'm about to blow your mind. Oh, you fixed my balloon. Thank you. I'm racking my brain and all she's like is, oh, huh, guess you fixed it. Would you mind doing one final thing for me? Light a fire. Lady, there's a torch right here. How lazy are you? All right, away we go. So here's the first geoglyph, which I'm pretty sure is just uh, an unknown. <coughs> Too high up. I feel faint. Push her. Push her. I mean, uh, yeah, that's that's weird. I see that too. I believe this geoglyph is one such image, but even from this vantage, its meaning is no clearer to me. It looks like a Pokemon in a wheelchair. Oh, hidden somewhere in the geoglyph is a tear. Okay. This looks like a tear over here. Maybe it's under this rock. Or it's a Korok. <laughs> Korok. Maybe up there? At like the, the head? Because if it's a dragon, the tear would be by the eye that's crying. Wait a second. Oh, found it. Whoa, whoa, that's cool. Why is it pulsating? Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna watch some memories now. Oh yeah, must be nice to fall into a nice sunny field. Got a shrimp. What? Oh, dear. Hey, wake up. You gonna eat that shrimp? Oh, oh there he is. The king. Goat daddy. Where am I? You're in the past. We You've didn't time mean travel. to startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. He should introduce himself as goat daddy. And could we ask what your name is? I... Uh, I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule. Zelda. What an unexpected answer. We are the king and queen who founded Hyrule after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? Yeah, so... And you're the So king? I'm a little bit after that. Just like mm. a little bit. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. I think it was a big speculation that time travel was going to be a part of this. And I guess we kind of just proved it now. That's cool. <gasps> gone. I was going to say, drink it up. All right, we got one. I don't know how many there are, but I know there's not that many. So hopefully we can knock out all of this. Oh, Link, you look distracted. What's wrong? You didn't just see that? I solved the mystery. This whole time it was red herring. Did it ever turn out to be red herring in a pup named Scooby-Doo? Because I feel like, you know, they always accused him and that's what a red herring is. The Geoglyphs, the literature, the Dragon's Tears, and now a vision of a lost princess? What if all these are connected? Or what if you're smoking that Hyrule herb? All right, let us continue to find the Geoglyphs. They may contain further clues that lead to Princess Zelda. You know, according to the literature, there is something to do with Geoglyphs in the Forgotten Temple. So we have another temple that's coming up, which I think is the last temple. All right, let's find the Dragon's Tears. Let's make this dragon cry. This next one's like all the way up in the mountains or something. I can't see shit over here. This is like right below me though. Do I have to go in here? Oh wait, this is the Forgotten Temple. Okay, so whatever I have to do leads to here. Good to know. I feel like this is gonna be the only one that's a pain in the ass because it's in the snow. Right, now where is that puddle? I mean, probably on a peak, right? Would it be on the peak of peak since I'm playing peak right now? I consider that the utmost peak. Oh, here it is. I, I wasn't seeing that until I got up close. All right, show me potato salad. Nice. As I thought, this is not the world I know. Yeah, no, definitely looks better now. A time so far back in the past, it's become legend. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding? Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone and are able to manipulate time, and your story makes sense. I want to know how this is going to affect the timeline. Oh, I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Raru? I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. In any case, Zelda, you had said 
that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there. But how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> you see, you fell into a hole that turns out was a rip in the universe. It's like, you guys ever see that movie Palm Springs with Andy Samberg? Which is actually a pretty great movie. It's one of those infinite time loop situations you might have heard about. That I might have heard about. I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. But stay a while. I wonder. Minoru. She may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Minoru? Minoru who? Yes. She knows far more than any of our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. All right, so that's two tiers. I think there's 12. I'm going to return to the Forgotten Temple because I don't know if I was supposed to watch like a cut scene or something because on the map, it's still a thing. I'm just trying to check it out one more time. Maybe I have to examine something. Maybe I just blow up the rocks. Didn't work. Oh wait, hold up. That wasn't even the entrance. This is the entrance. Oh, here's uh, here's Kato, Kato, whatever his name is. Oh, Link, I'm so pleased that you've come here as well. Imagine I skipped all this. We're gonna head deeper into the temple. I don't really know how far in we have to go. We gotta find Impa though. Oh, there's a shrine here. It's gonna make it so easy to come back. Oh, and Impa's right there too. Perfect. Building blocks. Oh, do we get auto build here? I know that's like the only thing that I'm missing. Maybe. Oh, I get it. Yeah, I can make it work. I can fix her. I like puzzles like this. These are fun. Easy. All right. It feels a lot like that Splatoon 3 puzzle I had to do. Only I had to destroy the blocks to make it fit. And this one's just gonna slide right in there. Oh, that's satisfying. That is a satisfying fit. Something's telling me that still ain't right. All right. My brain just didn't want to solve this one. Even though I feel like I tried every single combination. Apparently I did not. So, uh, that was fun. Oh, Link, thanks again for your help with the balloon. Oh. I believe there is something related to the geoglyphs somewhere in this temple. Don't worry, I'll find it. Whatever the hell it is. How far in do we have to go? Do we have to do the entire temple now? Whoa. Down here. Ah, this must be where we have to go. Okay, it's showing us all the geoglyphs now. And the last one looks like the Master Sword. Is, ah. is this where we pull the Master Sword? Whoa. Lady Impa, let's head down. We must investigate up close. Piggybacking on oh. my work. There, upon the walls. Are those not geoglyphs? Yeah, that's the one we saw. That's the Reshiram in the wheelchair. Oh, this is a map. All right, number three has got to be close to this tower. Sorry, Sky Islands. Not today. Oh, there's one. It's a Nintendo Switch. This one is like right here, right here. Let's go investigate. All right, this one will be easy. It's right here. Oh, it turns out this tier is people that are still crying about themes. Although we should have gotten more than just dark and light. They really fumbled the bag there. It is quite an interesting device. It is. But this can it run Crisis? Definitely not from this era. Actually, it can run Crisis. That said, I believe there may be a way to get the travel functionality working here. I'd like to tinker with it a bit. Would it be okay if I borrow it? Yes. Whatever you need. I really appreciate your help. Then I'll hold on to it. Just give it back. Make sure you charge it. So you really believe my story? That I came from the future? I never doubted you for a moment. Do you know of a way we could help to return Zelda back to her time? I suspect it was the power of your secret stone that allowed you to travel through time. Here's are the key to time to put travel. It simply, secret stones amplify the power their owners possess. I am able to separate my spirit from my body. Raru can repel or destroy evil with his power of light. And Sonia, she can control time. As for you, I can sense both light and time powers. Mm. A little light and time power but cocktail. Your secret stone seems to amplify your time power. Ultimately, the secret stone only amplifies your power. It doesn't suddenly grant you mastery and control. That's still up to you. That means, if you don't already know how to get yourself home, there are stories about the secret stones and a forbidden act called draconification. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon. But you gotta eat the stones? One blessed with eternal life. Interesting. Another way to reach the future, though not a very quick one. So you think these stories could hint at a solution to our dilemma? It's like a, you pour the milk first yes. or you, do you pour the tears first? But there is still more to those tales. To become an immortal dragon is 
to lose oneself. That is why it is forbidden. Legend of Zelda, like a dragon. I thought maybe this could lead to a solution. Some way to transcend time. Minoru's voice actress sounds familiar. But if you have to sacrifice your heart and mind, sacrifice what makes you, you. I'm sorry. I wish I could help more. I mean, that's, uh... At least we know, like, why. Back where we started. There's still hope. I think the answer, the answer to this problem lies in study and learning more about the nature of your power. Nerd. I'm sure Sonya would be happy to help you. He's like, we figure this out, but we have to study first. Let's hit the books. Okay. All right, so that's three down, nine to go. Oh, fortunately for me, the next one was just right here under the sky island that I already had a shrine at. This one uh, kind of looks like the Needler gun from Halo. Ooh, this one has Ganondorf in it. Ganondorf is jacked. Put this Ganondorf in Street Fighter. Hyrule will bow down before me. Speaking. I do love that they also cast Matt Mercer as <laughs> Ganondorf. What are, what are you calling? What is that? What are those? They're ugly. Hoduga are approaching our position. It's more than we thought. It's a swarm. Here's the stones. Bell is here too. There are so many of them. But why would they? <clears throat> Yo, he's gonna do a tri beam. This is how Tien fought off Cell. He could do that. You could stop a bunch of worms. It's like I don't know what I'm doing. I've never done this before. My first time. He is Tien. Oh my, yo, what the? F That's so cool. That blast wiped out all the Molduga. How is that possible? He was all, try beam ha! Gonna <sighs> brought more worms. So brute force will not be enough. The secret stone of the Sona. How can you see that? How interesting. All right, the next one is somewhere out in the Gerudo Desert, like, I don't know, out here or something. I'll find it. Probably gonna get real sweaty. Is there a shrine at the Karakara Bazaar and I just didn't do it? I was here. I must have, like, marked it off and I was like, yeah, I'll do that at some point, and I just never did. A sliding device. Oh, we're gonna go sandboarding. Cool. What if I just, like, you know, rewound it? I think that's the move here. You think, like, this is just all I have to do? You know what? It probably was. Okay, that is, um, it's quicksand. What do they want me to do with this? Oh, I see. Gotta make a Star Wars sand speeder. All right, now if I can just control the damn thing. Oh, and we can get out of here. Oh, there he is. Uh, that's, that's another Pokemon. That one's a Groudon. All right, let's see uh, how the story continues. I actually like getting, oh, they're in church. Offer you my deepest apologies. Sorry, I tried to invade On you. On behalf of the Gerudo, for taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom. To serve it faithfully. A welcome appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. He's eyeing all the stones. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Eh, he's probably just gonna flip Receiving him on eBay. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth, well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. <clears throat> your majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. Hmm. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. What are you trying to say? All except you and your sister, that is. He's like, and I'm about to eradicate the zone I completely. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings 
These will endure for generations to come. He just took a weird turn. He's like, thanks for the invitation. Uh, by the way... Your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. By the way, it's kind of weird how you were the only Zonai left. I mean, if something were to happen to you, that would suck, right? I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Yeah, what gave that away? Just his name. Even that. It gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. There is nothing to worry about. Okay. Nope, nothing to worry about. Definitely won't become the Demon King. All right, there's a Korok here. Free him from his rock prison. Oh, he's got a cool autumn face. And Impa's here? Checking up on me? Well, if it isn't Link. So you're investigating the geoglyphs too, then. How diligent of you. Oh, that's it? Okay. Here, watch. Look, look over here. Look, are you watching this? I don't think she's watching. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, right, now we're just flexing our time powers. Are you well? You seem a bit distracted. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts, thinking about how I can return home. There's nothing even in the cup. With your power over time, if I were able to learn that kind of control... I might be one step closer to my era. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was, how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax it back to that original moment in time. Drawing out the object's memory. I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. But Zelda... There is more on your mind than just that. Huh? You, of course, do want to get back to your time. I don't know. It's kind of nice here. It's but peaceful. You also I mean, except for, like, Ganondorf to out trying to spot. kill you guys, but... Right close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonya. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen... You can focus your attention on returning home. No, no, you're just trying to get rid of me. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Both of these powers will help you protect your own era. And I have a feeling we're going to need her back to take Ganondorf Queen down. Sonya. And of course, you must make it home safe to put Link's mind at ease. Link? Uh that is not a name I have heard. Finally, somebody doesn't know who I am. Knight. He had been originally appointed for my protection. Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Yeah, I would also like to meet him. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture Zelda paints of him. Speaking of which, <laughs> did you guys hear that apparently they're green lighting a Legend of Zelda movie with illumination? Like it's actually happening? So, so long after IGN made that corny-ass trailer for April Fool's Day. And ever since, I was like, oh, God, I wish a Legend of Zelda movie was real. All right, I know where this one is, because I've seen it before. Because it's just a sword. Oh, here you are. Getting little tinglies in my hand. Looks like I'm so tired of watching movies. So, once back in, like, I don't know, it had to be, like, 2013, they were doing some kind of Pixar marathon in a movie theater, and it was like, watch four Pixar movies in a row. And by the fourth movie, I was just like, I, I gotta get out of here. And like the last one, I think was Wally? No, the last one was Ratatouille. All right, Zelda. We are alone as you requested. What was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? Uh oh, there's tension. <laughs> you are far too trusting. Oh, what? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my, I'm surprised to hear you say such a thing. Like, well, that's a shame. I could stop that time. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you are a puppet of Ganondorf. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? Ah, there was a clone. Please be a Yiga clan member.
take your makeup off at the end of a long day. Oh! Oh shit. Did he just... Like, right in front of us? Okay, so Ganondorf is here. Your Majesty! Queen Sonya! Oh no! Queen Sonya! Oh god, he's doing the creepy laugh! God, that's- I'm gonna see that in my nightmares. It just- it like happened out of nowhere and I couldn't stop it. And now I can't unsee it. That's a Metroid with a crown. Next time on Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Queen Sonya! Queen Sonya! Queen Sonya is dead. Nah, it didn't look like he stabbed her. It looks like he just gave her a good back shot. Finally, it is mine! Uh-oh. The batteries ran out. Oh, that's evil power now. Oh, it's growing! Kind of gross. Got like a heartbeat. Oh! I can feel my strength surging. Matt Mercer really did a good job. Oh damn, what's he doing? This is sick. I don't ever use a pedicure, though. Yo, oh, he's got the Akuma hair! Is this, like, his Super Saiyan 3? Probably not, he's still got eyebrows. I don't know, if you ask me, this is probably the most menacing we've ever seen Ganondorf. Dude just summoned monsters with a flick of a wrist. So this is where they all came from. Get him, Rauru, get him! You took for granted the godlike power you had in your hands. Do you now see the potential you squandered? I really, I want to see these two go at it right now. She is merely the first victim of your arrogance. You tried to control me, Rauru, and you will die knowing that you failed. Can it go? Princenia needs you. No, throw hands! Get him! Or hooves! Throw hooves! Yo, let's go! Delta's like, hang on, I got a street pass. <laughs> Damn, that was a good cutscene. The story is just getting more and more intense, so I can't wait to see what's going to happen next. All right, where is this thing? I am definitely high enough up. Is that it? That is it. That is that is the Millennium Falcon. King Raru, we just received word that the last free village in the Gerudo Desert has fallen. Uh oh. <sighs> At this He's rate, winning. The Demon King's army will overwhelm us. This is going to be the uh, the imprisoning war I that we heard so much about. Our only hope is for me to defeat the Demon King. The Demon King. He is not someone you can stop by yourself. Oh yeah, watch this. Mm. I heard four times that he did it by himself. Well, not by himself. But He's like, all right, but I'll make the ultimate not sacrifice. Alone. You have the Gerudo, <laughs> Goron, Zora, and Rito <laughs> leaders, as well as Zelda, <laughs> and of course. You can count on me. There's something I'd like to show you all. Show us his Pokemon card collection. 
Like, but I'm not trading. Oh, these are the stones that he gives the, uh, the sages. So I Sacred stones. Stand with me. I need all your aid. All right, everyone gets one. And don't lose it, because I don't have any extras. We all oh, this is the Forgotten Temple. Here. Swear on our lives to serve brother, the king of light. So I wonder if I have to collect the sages and I have to get Zelda and do something else and I have to go to the Forgotten Temple and stand on those stones. Seems like what this is alluding to. We're getting close. I only have three more left. All right, next one. I gotta somehow make it over there. All right, time to start working smarter and not harder. Ooh, this is a steep one. I mean, it only makes sense for it to be at the top, right? Did the geoglyphs, they like change. It's kind of creepy. It's got like the the wet part in the middle and like the drier edges, like a freshly scraped knee. Here we go. All right, show us something cool. We're coming up to this imprisoning war. Sonia. Rauru saying goodbye to his wife one last time because he knows what he must do. King Rauru, before you face the demon king tomorrow, there is something I must tell you. I came, I came to this era after finding a man underground. When I witnessed what the secret stone did to Ganondorf, at that moment, I knew for sure what we found underground, that was him. Now Zelda's talking about the skeleton still that we found underground, which powerful. is Ganondorf, which we all knew. He continues to live on all the way until my time. He was real crusty down there. In tomorrow's battle, we won't be able to defeat him. No matter how strong we think we are, he'll survive. But yeah, Zelda, you see, this is a canon event. So don't stop him from doing what he must do. And you... And you will... We've all seen Across the Spider-Verse, right? Maybe so. But it is my duty to try. It was my hubris that set us on this path. I must atone for my error in judgment. And above all else, I remain the King of Hyrule. As with any leader, it is my duty to safeguard and protect my I like Rauru a lot as a character. Even if I must risk my life. He's pretty badass and noble. Rauru. And if it proves impossible for us to defeat Ganondorf, we rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. Our last line of defense will be Link. Honestly, Link is your only line of defense. But remember, that was a future where you never appeared in this world. And you are here now. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. The reason I am here. Say it. Say it. Ah, damn it. Cliffhangers. All right, here we go. Two more, and then, uh... We'll go pull that master sword. Oh wait, I gotta visit uh, a statue first and pray, so I have to finish getting the rest of my uh, my stamina wheels. So the next one, it's a it's a sword. It's, it's actually it's the master sword. Here's the Korok, so that means the thing's probably all the way at the top. I do like that. There's a Korok in each one. Haha, -ha, you found me. Yep. Bye now. Me and the boys, the side quest boys, just finished recording a very very hectic episode of. Four Swords. So if you haven't checked us out over uh, on SideQuest yet, that's my group channel that I talk about all the time, and I'm very proud of it, and we have a lot of fun. And if you like content kind of like this, but multiple people yelling at each other, you should check us out, especially if you like Zelda stuff, because we're playing Four Swords, and uh, Four Swords is definitely more chaotic than I remember. Okay, here's the next one. And I think we have one more. Then uh, apparently we're going to pull the Master Sword in... What is the coolest way to pull the Master Sword? Oh wait, there's a dragon here. I'm debating if I do like just a filler episode of me just doing stuff before I go do all the final stuff. Maybe, maybe we'll do some more searching through the depths and we'll fight some Gleox. We'll do a nice filler episode. He managed to restrain him somehow. Do we not get to see the fight? Link, I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. Oh, thanks for the vote of confidence. Watch this. It's like that meme where it's just like a picture of Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and it's like, 
Fuck your nuanced writing and logic. Watch this. All right. Is that a... What is that? Just a little glowing orb? Gonna power up your time stone? Touch it. Ooh. Learning how to reverse time, are we? There it is. That's how it got there. Or, well, it was taken away from me. But Zelda has it. How is the Master Sword? You're telling me that Link is safe? You traveled through time to find me and recover your strength. <gasps> Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. I what does it mean? I am here. This is building up to something hype, and I have avoided spoilers. Something only I can do. We will finally stop him. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. Become an immortal dragon? Is Zelda gonna become a dragon? I'll be forever changed. What is about to happen? They are dragon's tears. Link, you must find me. We're almost there. I'm coming. I'm coming for you. One to go. What's that? Is that Zelda? Or is she riding it like, oh my God, it's stuck in his head. I'm about to pull the Master Sword out of a goddamn dragon. Okay, so that must be the 12th Geoglyph that I have to go to. All right, before we go there, I want to make sure I have enough stamina. Because I ain't trying to fall off no dragon. Give me that stamina vessel. Uh, please, Mrs. Statue. Thank you. I think I need one more. Yeah, we need one more. Good thing I've been grinding shrines. And shrined in. No. All right, I'm getting hyped. We got to go over there. See that, see that little pixel right there on the, the head? That's it. How did the sword get in the dragon's head anyway? Man, I hope I don't have to fight anything when I get up there because I have no hearts, no food. Was that shrine always there? I don't think I need to do the shrine. Oh, I don't. All right, here we go. This puddle is not like any other puddle. This puddle will set us free. Oh, wait. Is that the temple that... That's the temple of time that floated up into the sky. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. Did the I not see the Deku power, tree? The more powerful the sword becomes. After all, you possess more than power over time. I think I missed that you one. Have a sacred power that can dispel evil. I didn't get every the single memory, but I got all the stone the geoglyphs. To become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. Minoru, I'm counting on you. Here, would you like to try out the Legend of Zelda: Tears of the Kingdom? I'm in the game. All right, what's what's happened to the sword? Restore the master sword for you. I will pour my sacred power into it. It will be the weapon that defeats the Demon King. It's got chills. You can use the stone on it. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. This is your calling. You must become Dragon Zelda. She ate it. That's not gonna digest. Zelda's like, these edibles ain't shit. <laughs> okay, this is sick. Has 
has she been up there this entire time? I feel like if you jumped on this dragon, you might have just stumbled upon the Master Sword at some point. Because this dragon didn't just spawn now. I've passed by this thing like a couple times. That's gotta be a nutty way to find it. You're just like running around the map and you just end up on like the dragon's head. And you're like, oh, that's the Master Sword. And she's just been flying around since the beginning of Hyrule. All right, now the question is, how the hell am I getting up there? I'm gonna just jump off like this sky island and hope I make it. All right, Link, time to begin your final descent. Oh, I see you. I, we, we could probably reach that. Come on. No, 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 no! Link, now it's time for your final descent. Where the hell did the dragon go? I marked it, but I don't think it's there. Oh my God, does this thing leave? It loops around Hyrule, doesn't it? So it's funny that I saw the memory of the Deku tree because I was like, huh, I didn't do that. And it turns out that one's probably the most important because doing that quest gives you like a tracker to know where this goddamn light dragon is. They don't tell you that. Now I gotta run around in the dark because I don't think I have any light up fruits. Like, like, what am I doing? I gotta go over there. I gotta ascend and I gotta get the hell out of here. That says Korok Grove. My God, I thought that said Korok Grave for a second. I was gonna say no one tortures and kills these Koroks but me. All right, we made it, surprisingly. Now I should be right in the middle of Hyrule Forest. So I can actually probably ascend out of here. Right, we can, we can ascend out of here, right? Okay, this isn't what I need to ascend from. Where's the, where's the pillar? Oh, wait, 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 this is where I have to go. Found it. Walking around blindly in the dark paid off. All right, we out of here. Not spending another second in this godforsaken hellhole. All right, now we should be in the middle of the forest. We made it. And there's our old boy. How you doing, Mr. Tree? Long time no see. Oh, my tummy hurts. Please get me a Tums. I'm gonna go inside you and fix it. Don't worry. This, this isn't your tummy, is it? All right, ooh, gross. All right, here we go. Whoa! Don't, don't, don't hit the wall. Ow! <laughs> then my body just falls. I'm gonna go back into the depths. This is different, though. It's to help an old friend. Oh, me. Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, I'm getting my revenge. Die! Die! Oh my god. Did, did I kill it? I killed it. Phantom Ganon! What? Uh, okay. Ow! Okay, I don't really have much of anything at all, but what I can tell you is this. I am going to beat Ganon's ass with a mop. Okay, my mop is broken. He, he moves kind of slow. But you know what I probably can do? I can throw stuff at him. I throw, let's throw a shock fruit. That didn't really do much of anything. God damn. I keep forgetting to take out my shield. God, he's like, he's glooming all over the place. All right, he really does two things. He charges at you and swings, and then he uh, does like a spinny attack. Come on, just die. Die! Ow! Okay, you're gonna die though, for real. Cut you down. All right, your tummy's all better now. Wow, the power of Tums sure is strong. And fast acting too. Mm. Oh, my tummy feels all better. I must apologize, I'm still quite groggy. Thank you for getting rid of that. Better out than in, I always say. Have you been, by the way? It's been a while. Last time we spoke, that was when you were here with the princess to retrieve the Master Sword. Yeah, so about that, I kind of need to do that again. The sword. It would seem that you no longer wield it. Where is it gone? I just gave it to you. You lost it again? Hang on, I'll track it for you. Here it is. Oh, it seems it's moving. All right, the light dragon's right here. We're going to cut it off. I know exactly where you are because I back-traced it. You done goofed. All right, we made it. Mount this dragon. And, uh, where's, where's the sword? Oh, it's like right in the middle of your skull. All right, here we go. Come on, Link. Come on, yank it out. No, oh, sorry, yeah, this is gonna hurt a little bit. I guess, yeah, this is why you need the stamina, because you gotta hang in there. 
I'm sorry, Zelda. This is gonna hurt me a lot more than it hurts you. Come on. Pull it out. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Like, oh, that feels better. That might have been the coolest way in the history of the franchise to pull the Master Sword. Uh, did I not take it out? Still, oh, it's tangled up in the hair. We might have to cut it out. Dude, this is so cool. One final yank. Ooh, just got chills. It's back. Pretty clean, too. Not an ounce of blood. Link. Uh, yeah? The Master Sword. Your sword. She is the key to destroying the Demon King. She? The Master Sword is Sandy? I'm well. Defeated her yeah, before, I guess if we count Fi. A long slumber will heal these grievous wounds. And when you two next face the Demon King, you will have my strength to help you through her. Link, you are our final hope. I pray. This sword reaches you in the future. He just shouts, like, down from the head of the dragon. He's like, I got it! So my question is, what happens to Zelda now? I mean, we're probably going to get an answer to that, but does she just continue to fly around? They did say, you know, once you become a dragon, there's no turning back. You lose yourself. Thanks for the ride. Zelda's like, I'm going to go do dragon stuff. And now we have the Master Sword. Okay, so now that we're getting towards the end of the story... I should probably upgrade my stuff. So we're gonna do the Fierce Didi armor quest line. <sighs> really thought we found it too. Who knows how long it would take to open all those one by one. My arms are tired just thinking about it. Every single chest we open, we just find the same thing, a green rupee. It's like they're messing with us. Oh, uh, I was gonna say don't mind me, but I, I wanna know more about the uh, the chests. Huh, shh, Prison, hush up, don't, don't tell him. Hey buddy, don't you have anything better to do than eavesdrop on us? Eavesdrop, I'm standing right in front of you. Wait, don't tell me. You came to this cave to find Misko's treasure. What did he say? Well, now you gotta tell me. Rules are rules. <laughs> ah, there's no way he'll be able to find Misko's treasure in that sea of chests. Not unless you got a nose like a dog's that can sniff out the treasure. Oh. That's it, Deck. Let's give a dog some food or something. Oh, you mean this dog right here? Uh, I don't think I have any meat, but do you like mushrooms? What the f*** is this piece of shit? Oh, wait a second. I feel like I should be able to pet the dogs in Tears of the Kingdom. L let me pet him. Look, you're in meat heaven now. Here, boy. Here, boy. Eat the 90-day dry-aged tomahawk. He's like, here, you stupid idiot. Here's the cave that you could have just walked into at any point. And that must be the chest that they opened and they're very tired from. Yeah, I, I definitely could have just strolled in here, but he looked like he was hungry. Nope, oh, green rupee. I see what you're talking about. Let me guess, another green rupee? Correct! I feel like that meme where you have the one guy digging in a mine and he turns back right before he hits the treasure. And on the bottom, you have the guy who struck diamonds. I'm about to strike diamonds. Look, just pull him up. Free ouch! No, 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 not now, easy. Calm down, it's just a chest. Nope. Should the dog tell me like which one is good? Like, I fed the dog. What, what the dog doing? See, it would take them a while to dig all these up, but they also could have just gotten the Ultra Hand ability. What I really want to know is, Misko, what was he doing that he got treasure chests stuck in the walls? Get, get out here. Ooh, Ember Trousers. Whoa, hey, what'd you do? No way. There's like a million chests in here. How'd you do that? Well, yeah, we tailed you. I admit, but we never thought you'd actually find it. We've been hunting treasure long enough to know the rules. Finders keepers. But was that a respect? We're not going to try to take it from uh, you. Yeah, try to take things from the guy who can move things with his mind. And also, there's this regular old bottle, but oh. I guess we'll just leave it here. Let's see. You who have found my treasure. These ember trousers are but one piece of my grand collection. Why does this feel like the opening to One Piece? Now you just have to find it. Don the form of the fierce deity and return to this place. There are three keys you will need. One beneath the bedchamber of Akala's red crown citadel, one in the skull's left eye, one in an old stump in Hyrule Field. Good luck. All right, time to get searching. 
Oh, this place is occupied. So I need to find some, like, cave down the Akala City ruins. Oh my god! Uh, can you help me out, sir? What am I paying you for? It's funny, because I'm not paying him. Also, accidentally using a piece of crap weapon. That's what I need to do next. I need to get some better weapons. Because you know what? I'm gonna take down a Gliok today. Low-key, I kind of wish I had this part of the map, but I did not get the, uh... I did not get this tower yet, so... Or what we got. We're out here wasting bombs for level 7 swords. Just gonna nab the tower real fast. Quick tower pit stop. Oh, let me guess, it's broken. It's my first day. Well, if I can't enter from the front, and we enter from the bottom, <laughs> we'll get in one way or another. Oh wait, look at this. Door is being held closed by the most advanced form of door security known to man. Two sticks. Ah! Alright, let's get some more map. It's kind of crazy that this game has only been out for about a month and a half, and I don't feel pressured to finish it, but my time is being split between so many different games right now. I feel like video games are in a really good place, because I'm juggling Tears of the Kingdom, Street Fighter VI, Diablo IV. Hell, I gotta finish this game so I can open Final Fantasy XVI. We also have Pikmin 4 coming out in a little bit. There's a lot of games to play. Not to mention everything is coming out this fall. Okay, so I really thought the Akala Highlands were uh, on a different part of the map, but I guess I have to go over here. I need another tower. There's more towers that I need. Oh, hey, it's Zelda. Hi, Zelda. Hope you're having a good day uh, circling Hyrule today. I hope we can fix you. You know when dudes see a girl and they're like, I can fix her? Uh, this one might be a bit of a problem. Let's see. Oh, it just doesn't... Oh, I remember now. This is the one with the thing that's just carrying it. Okay, I have I have arrows now, so give it back. Thank you. Oh, the terminal! You got it back! Look at me finishing up the map like a good boy. I really think I want to try and 100% this game. Not for content, but I want this to be the game that I just keep going back to to get everything. Because I feel like I missed out on that with Breath of the Wild, and I'm not going to go back and do it now. Not when we have this masterpiece. So I think that's why I want to finish the story. So we're going to do a couple more things before that happens. And one of them is fighting a Gliok, because why not? And then I need to explore the depths in the sky some more. And then we'll go kill Ganondorf. All right, that is a big chunk of the map. Oh, hang on, there's a shrine there too. So we're going to get that because I'm lacking in shrines in this area. Yeah, just, just a quickie. Oh my god, there's one. A prone pathway. Okay, probably just have to send through this. I think it's cold when you ascend. You think the sensation is warm. All right, I need to probably rotate this. I don't know what I got to do. Oh, I get it. Okay, I see what I got to do. Get some treasure real quick. It's always time for treasure. Ooh, good shield. Oh, there's another treasure chest. Oh, thank God. You know what? I probably need to rotate this again. Oh, I had, okay, I get it. I had to be inside. Right, hang on, hang on. If I'm inside, that should be helpful. Okay, so now I think I can probably just ascend here, and it'll take me to the roof. Nice big ascend, full submersion. Yeah, here we go. All right, let's uh, go to the Akala ruins. Gotta go somewhere in here. Oh, damn it. Is it blood moon time? Oh, god damn it. Wait, what? Why did they disappear? They just straight up despawned. Did they get hit by lightning? No, I didn't see Phantom Ganon, so they didn't die. Okay, we gotta sneak in here. Looks like there's a uh, looks like there's some kind of cavern or opening or cave down here. All right, so I think this is the first piece. The fierce deity armor. Legend has it that this armor once belonged to the hero of a world in which the moon threatened to fall. Yes, and it was terrifying. All right, and the next one is in Skull Lake because you have to go like I think they said the right eye because the left eye is obviously a chasm, but we're not gonna go in there. I don't have anything that close, so. Again, you're just gonna have to fire out of a tower and, uh, glide on over. Man, if only I could catch a ride from my dragon girlfriend. Just a good thing that I have more stamina right now. And I also have some stamina skewers that I can munch on. Hey, what's the deal with airline food? Can I- can I do it? Let's see. Can I skill this? Oh my god, I'm going so fast. Oh god, oh, I can't see- Oh, we landed in water! Oh, I couldn't see for a second. <laughs> I thought I was gonna die! A lot of undead in here, but it makes sense, considering... old Skull Lake. Nope, nope, don't regenerate. Don't do it! 
He's like, Bobby, don't lose your head over it. Oh, brother. All right. Oh, the big boys are out. Ah, you're all weak. Oh, I see it up there. Oh, Stalnox. All right. Might as well. Also weak. Uh, let's use our new Master Sword toy with the... Oh, my God. We are shredding this thing. Oh, I gotta... Okay, I gotta pick the eye up. Or just... Yep. Okay, you're dead. Which piece is this? Oh, the mask! It's party time! Beautiful. Oh, right by the shrine, too. Oh, it's a ball shrine. Actually, it's more than that. What the hell do I have to do here? Probably have to, like, attach something. Like a hammer. Right? Probably something like this. Okay, that wasn't enough. Oh, I can lift it higher. Maybe that'll help. Oh, there we go. Hole in one? Ah, damn. Come on, go! Oh my god! Do a little less. There. Get in there. Let's go! First try. Okay, so for the last piece, we're gonna travel over here. And I'm pretty sure if we go back to the area where we got the quest, we just get the sword. And then it's just a matter of upgrading everything. Like, right in the middle of this lake. Right over here. In this giant, ancient tree stump. Just, you know, you thought it was gonna be in any old stump. Just like a regular stump. Oh no. Can something just not attack me in the water, please? Here's a fun little fact about me. When I was younger, the movie Anaconda used to really scare the hell out of me. I don't know why. What the f Where the hell is this last piece of near Steady armor? I'm genuinely unsure if I'm leaving or if uh, this is where I have to go. Oh wait, hang on a second. That, that, yep, there it is. All right, last piece. Man, I'm gonna be so strong. Look at it, in all its glory. All right, I'm back, fellas, and I got that anger drip. Like, aha, he has the armor. He is worthy. That's it, no test of strength, no written test. Go to Scantron. Go ahead and take that. All right, here we go. The Fierce Deity Sword. And bam, he's back. Now to bank that and not use it. All right, for my next party trick, I'm gonna attempt to upgrade this armor, which you have to do by farming dragons? There's one. Gotta track this big boy down. I'm gonna land right on the dragon. The dragon's gonna be like, what can I get you? 55 burgers, 55 fries. What can I get here? Oh, hello, I will take that. Oh, ferocious horn. Okay, cool. There's like, there's more things I can get to. I think I can get like a scale. No, do we have to land on it? Shard of ferocious spike. Get as many of those as I can. When's the next time you're gonna be on the back of a dragon? I say that as I have rode two dragons in a couple hours. Oh wait, hang on. Oh, don't get don't get struck by lightning. Now's not the time. Where do I get a scale? Where where do I get one of them scales? Are these the scales? No, they can't be, right? Oh, you know what I think it is? I think I can only get one piece at a time, and the dragon has to quote recharge. So I got the horn, and I can't get another piece until the dragon is done charging. So I'm just gonna wait for a little bit. A few moments later. All right, let's see, you're extra glowy now. Oh, there we go. All right, we got a scale. Okay, now you are not glowing at all. So it's one piece every 10 minutes. Oh my God, are you going into the depths? No, 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 uh, uh This is where I get off. All right, now to upgrade my armor, which I haven't done at all yet, I need to unlock the great fairies which is a side quest that has to be done, I think, at the woodland stable over here. A little cozy woodland stable, holding the secrets to magic. Princess Zelda sighted, what? Oh man, he's reading the tabloids. Listen, I know where she is. I mean, I, I know what she is. All right, so I still need to unlock one of the fairy fountains, which I haven't done yet, in order to upgrade my armor. Just, just hang on, I have to be really good at building. Oh wait, hang on a second. There's already like a half completed cart here. You know, one with actual axles. What are you doing? Please don't do anything strange like that to our dear Breezer. Our beloved Breezer. Some of the wheels broke. Yeah, if only there was someone around here to fix it. Hey you, I don't suppose you know anyone, do you? All right, so uh, as I was. <laughs> it's rolling away, no! That, that'll hold. All right, everyone, get in. We should check with the, uh, that, we're trying to go to the Great Fairy. Look, I I'll take you, literally. Just get in the thing. Oh God, oh God. Uh. All right, it's gonna be a bumpy ride, everybody. Can this thing break? And everyone just falls out. You know what, we're going fast. Oh God, sorry about that spot. Nice and easy, easy does it. The musician's like, hey, pass me that aux. All right, we made it. All right, maestro, lead us into the performance. There's only two people.
Yeah, this is my jam. Open the perfume cactus. She ends up coming out like Snoop Dogg. I forgot how massive the great fairies are in this game. Behold, Violin, the great fairy graces us with her presence. Truly divine. All right, if you guys can get out of here now, I have to upgrade some armor. All right, now to get to business. I was about to return to my spring and it's sweet serenity when I heard those two mention my sisters. There are four of us across the land. Yeah, I only need one. Oh. Only it's fine, just one. Uh, oh wow, that that's so interesting. Okay, yeah, we'll I'll definitely get to that. All right, so let's see. I fear sturdy stuff. I can do the boots, and for some reason you need toenails. <laughs> She's gonna be like, "How do you like it? Uh, it's a bit itchy. What are these things made out of anyway? Oh. Toenails." Oh, I'm out of toenails. All right, so I was able to upgrade one thing. So I'm slightly stronger, only slightly. Ah, how hard could a Gleok be? Let's go fight one. Okay, I paid a visit to the statue. I prayed for more stamina, and I made some stamina elixirs. I did some cooking. So now I'm actually ready. Just circling the place like, don't think anyone's stupid enough to come visit this island. Well, guess again. Okay, can I land first, please? Can I can I land first? Oh my god, no way, no way, no way! Uh, yeah, that's right, come down here and fight me, you coward! Oh, so they have, like, three different kind of heads. Oh my god! You guys didn't even let me change into my cool new gear. And it's cold up here. Oh my god, what the- How am I supposed to do this? Of course I don't have any bows. Oh my god. I'm getting hit with all the elements here. Oh! Oh, wait. I gotta beat him so I get whatever's in this chest. Don't know what it is. Could be something really stupid. I got one shot. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, so I do spawn here. I really have to leave and go get some bows. This is bullshit. The last two times, I wasn't actually ready. But this time, I am ready. I've been saving my, um, my keys eyeballs, which are homing, so maybe I could just, like, shoot the dude in the eye. Oh, that worked. Can I just stay behind here and do this? Oh, that, yeah, I can. Hold up, hold up. Did I, I knocked him down. So I'm gonna use my flux core smasher and I'm gonna smash. Oh God, that's not doing that much damage. Okay, it's all right, we can do this. Just gotta not get too close. Oh God, oh God, oh God. That's right, get back up in the air. We're actually doing kind of nice damage to uh, the heads. Although I'm afraid that this is not enough. So, fun fact, I was down in the depths and I found uh, the big Goron sword. Okay, all right. I might actually do this. I'm just like firing like into the wild and it's, it's working. All right, Flux Core Smasher, you know what to do. Big spin attack. If I mess up once, I'm dead. Start using some Aracuda eyeballs. Ooh, oh, not down yet. This is too easy. I was made for this. I'm not even using cold weather attack. You know what? Let's change that. Let's get a little boost here. Gleok, more like weak. Ock. They're dropping. It's that meme with like the, the Hydra heads, and it has the one head that's like kind of silly, except they're all silly. Where'd you, where'd you go? You're, you're giant Hydra. Where are you? Oh, God. What? What? What, what is happening? Oh, my God. Whoa, what? I didn't know there was a phase two. All right. I'm going to totally sleep him this time. He caught me off guard with the phase two last time. All right. Here we go. Let's ride it up. Ah! What the hell am I supposed to do? Every time I try to fly up, I get killed. I really think I'm kind of just supposed to go up there and dodge. I don't know if there's anything to it. Yeah, that's not working. Come on, give, give me some more air. Just gotta get a little closer. Ah, crap! Ah! <laughs> God, yep. Oh, okay, okay. All right, all right. Am I, am I close enough? I think I'm waiting too long before I start taking shots at him, so I'm gonna start firing away a little earlier. All right, let's go. There we go, come on. Take him down. Bullet time. 
Okay, come on. One more. Oh, God. Oh, he's down. Die. Die. I did it. Oh, we going. Where you going, bitch? Oh my god, I, I can't believe it. I just, okay, I was underprepared for the fight. Look how many hearts I have. That thing was one-shotting me. There was really no room for error. Oh my god, all that for a sage's will? All that for a sage's will? Ah! You know what? It's not about the items. It was about the thrill of the hunt. Right, guys? Okay, so I have not given the depths any proper attention. So I think it's about time we do a little exploration. All right, um, that is, I should probably go try to light that up. Oh wait, hang on one second, hang on. I have the miner's mask, which will give me some light and I'm pretty well prepared. I've done some cooking. I have some gloom meals, which is just another word for Burger King. Whopper, 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 whopper. I want the depths to give me its worst. Like these enemies right here? Pfft, nothing. In fact, I'm gonna take out my big Goron sword, which I found. I'm just gonna like spin around. And anyone who gets hit, it's their fault. You guys are actually weak. Boom, headshot. Remember that from back in the day? In fact, I'm kind of happy I'm doing a depths crawl right now because I need some stuff. And speaking of depths, like look at this map. I have really done nothing. So you know what? Let's do a little exploration. I have a lot of X's down here. That is a gloom stone talus. Ow. It's all right. I have food that can heal the broken hearts. Not dealing that much damage though. Feeling pretty good. Oh, there we go. You know what? I need to eat the gloom resistant food. You know, just a little something so I can uh, so I can play in the mud. I gotta see your backside. This was way easier in Age of Calamity. Guys, can you help me out? Yo, how do I get to see the backside? Oh my God. I got some bombs. There we go. My guy, he's fast on his feet. He can pivot. All right, let's try something here. Can I send him back? I, I can do that. Wait, actually, that kind of worked. Come on, you want to play catch with daddy? I got you. Okay, I, I figured it out. I got to figure it out now. I'm going to put his hands back on, and then we take our swing. No problem. Oh, no, you don't. Right back at you. Return to sender. All right, one more. One more should do it. Good night. A lot of shiny rocks. What was this? Oh, is that like his heart? Is that his heart or is that his nuts? No los dos? All right, I'm gonna fuse your... Oh, thank God, it's the heart. Thank God for the clarification. I got a heart on a stick. I have some bright bloom seeds. I was worried that I didn't. No, not you. Sorry, I, I no longer need your services. Again, would love it if these were, I don't know, mapped to a button so I didn't have to walk up and talk to them every single time. Oh, another camp. Hello, don't mind if I drop in, do you? Oh, there's a big man here. It's all right, you'll all go down together. You first. Pull, a, pull an old Garen on him. Oh my God. Black Boss Bacoblin Horn. I will absolutely make a weapon with that. You know, I've been collecting a bunch of pose and I haven't really done anything with it yet. This is, this is the scary part, just gliding through the darkness. I have this stupid helmet on, but it's not doing anything for me. Link, let your miner's mask be your guiding light. All right, we are so close. The Dalite Grove. Look at the little talus. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even hurt them. You can though. Almost there. I don't know if, oh, a giant gloom tree. Gotta cut that down. Can I fuse this to one of my new weapons? An ever mean log. Okay. Sounds kind of like constipation. Okay, we're pulling up on it now. Could be right over here with the other ever mean logs. Okay, wait. I need something that's going to slice to kill you. Ouch. He wound up for that one, too. Okay, where is this? Guys, I'm busy. Where's this treasure chest? Okay. This is what's guarding it? This decrepit old plant? All right. Let's see what's waiting for us in here. Oh my God. Sword of the Hero. That's the OG sword. Okay, that's kind of cool. I mean, I know you could find a lot of that stuff down here in the depths. It's like, technically, you don't have to buy any amiibo. You can just come down here and get everything. I don't like running through this forest and just having random trees come to life. It kind of kind of creeping me out. And have actual nightmares about the depths, I promise you. All right, let's go ahead and examine this light route. Yeah, turn the light on. 
it's actually crazy, like, how much stuff is down here. And I am not even close to scratching the surface. Pun 1,000% intended. I'm just kind of running around now seeing what I find, which is probably a horrible way to do this. It's like, hey, you know, go out and find your own nightmares. So, like, here's another stone talus. I'm going to beat the hell out of this thing now that I figured it out. Like, I'll let that come really close to me, and then I'll send it back. Just plop down here for a second. Thank you. Let's farm that. I could stay up here all day if I want. Head. Just climb up here. And nighty night. Nighty night, Mr. Rock. Not to be confused with Mr. The Rock. And do I absolutely ruin the hero sword by fusing something to it? Yeah, I do. What is that over there? I'm actually not sure. One way to find out. The Bloopy Burrow. Ah! Wasn't expecting to land in the water there. Oh, they're large pose. Grand pose. I actually... I heard there's another Gliok fight down here. I don't know if it's a King Gliok or a regular Gliok, but Gliok fights are too easy for me. Let's light this place up a little bit. So I gotta go up. Why is every piece of treasure in the depths on top of a mountain? Can I just be like strolling around and find a nice treasure chest? Oh, hang on. There's another light route. Let's turn on the, the night light. That's first. And then I'm going to build something. Just, it gets scarier and scarier down here. The vibe is very, like, haunted mansion. Only Disney hasn't tried to monetize it yet. That is the best ride in Disney World, though. My vote goes to haunted mansion always. All right, let's build a, a contraption. And actually, so let's, we can do this. Can I steer? And probably, oh yeah. Look at us go. The only thing that sucks is, like, it's going to take us a while to get elevated. That and I can't see anything. Just flying blind. Okay, crashing into that. Come on, charge the battery up. Charge it up. Charge it up. Going through those double A's like it's an OG Game Boy. Okay, I'm, I'm stuck on something. Okay, uh, my thing is going to break, so got to go. Hang on, I see. No, no. This, this is a nightmare. I actually hate this. What the hell is this? The Forest Coliseum? What? What is this? A bunch of bananas. Oh, f Oh, it's just a bunch of Yiga. No big deal. You must be Link. You're as foolish as you are greedy. Who would have left precious bananas just lying around? You walked right into our trap. That's something that, like, Donkey Kong would have fell for. Just a trail of bananas? Let me introduce you to our debt collector. Born of the depths, lurking in the darkness of the Forest Coliseum. <laughs> Behold the Black Hinox. Okay, no big deal. Not like I haven't fought one of these before. Come on. Oh, I just snapped my bow. All right, I got another one. Oh, right in the eye. This was your ace in the hole? Go with the Aracuda eyeball. Boom. The no children for you. Wow, that was tough. You're like, oh, crap. That's all we had. All right, let's see. What was our prize? Whoa. Hang on. I'm putting that on right now. Oh my god, I love it. Who knew there was a whole ass coliseum down here? That's awesome. Thank god, there's so many pose down here. Yeah, I gotta go find the bargainer statue. That's what we're gonna do last. We're gonna go shopping. He just, he looks deranged. The Korok mask is definitely something you see in a horror movie. All right, I was forced to relocate because where I was going, that wasn't your regular everyday darkness. No, that was advanced darkness. I like how when I first started this game, I came down to the depths and I was just getting destroyed by things. And now I'm just ignoring mobs and just farming their zonite. Another talus, don't mind if I do. I already know what I have to do. You don't gotta tell me. I mean, I can't see, but hack them to pieces. Oh, wow. You, you are not even a boss. Actually, I feel kind of sorry for you. You didn't ask for this. You were just hanging out in your gloom puddle. Probably having an okay day. Then here comes me. And I shatter you to pieces. All right, truthfully, I've expended all of my uh, possible materials and exploration gear. So we're gonna leave the depths. I'm gonna go to Lookout Landing um, because I want to find a bargainer statue and I wanna spend some of my pose. But I feel like I did so much and I did nothing at the same time. All right, I found some pretty cool stuff though. But now I just need to remember where the bargainer statue is. It's in like one of these houses. I think it's over here actually. I think it's Possibly right here? You who stand before me, offer up pose so that I may return them to the afterlife. I like the idea that if Link never gives them up, he's purgatory. 
I will offer pose. Let's see, what can we get? Ooh, a dark tunic. I want that. I'll take the dark tunic. That uh, is, is that all you got? I'm gonna hang on to the rest for other things, but let's switch out to the dark tunic. Oh, that looks cool. Wow. What a beautiful sunset. Anyway, I gotta go get that last tower way up there because that's the last one I need to finish the map. And then I wanna do something that a lot of you have been telling me to do. And I feel like you've been telling me because you wanna see me get my ass kicked. And that's what's probably gonna happen here. Tell me this thing's gonna be broken. Half these towers don't even work. Okay, good, the door opens. The terminal works, all right. It just was really high up. Wow, feels nice to finally knock off all the towers. Look at him with the Korok mask. It's hard to take Link seriously with it on, which is why that's how I have to defeat Ganon. The surface map is complete. And the sky. Make a quick pit stop before I go do that thing that you guys have been telling me to do. Hello, are you a challenger? Are you a dive ceremony? Dive ceremony? Oh my, I did not realize you're unfamiliar with the dive ceremony. Please indulge me as I explain. Is Link about to join the dive and swim team? I didn't even know this was here, but this is not the thing uh, you guys were telling me to do either. All right, here we go. Let's do something fun. Oh, this is easy. Link was on the dive team in college. Okay, maybe I don't know where they all are. Okay, I got two rings, so that likely wasn't right. Let's do it again. I went too fast. I got to keep an eye on where the rings go, so... Being able to see... Oh, here's one. Oh, I see. Okay. I follow the, uh, the little star. I wonder what outfit I get for this. I'm wondering if it's like the Skyward Sword here. Oh, and here we go. The big one. Big finish. What, what did I get? Oh, it's growing big. Oh, I got to do the shrine now. All right. Here's the uh, Sihajog shrine. Oh, we get a blessing here. We get a freebie. My guess is the Skyward Sword outfit. The diamonds? That's cool. Diamonds are forever, they say. Diamonds are forever. All right, where's that damn robot? He owes me a prize. Thank you for doing a trial run of the course. I am pleased to see that you completed it safely. Oh, that wasn't it. I must ask one thing before you begin. I need about tree fitting. That was the trial run, he says. Actual first try. Did you think you weren't dealing with a professional here? Your dive skills are incredible. This is proof of your maturity. You have earned it. Oh, the glide mask. Allows steadier gliding while the wearer plummets from the sky. Oh, wait, I could break the world record of 25 seconds. Let's do it. I'll probably get the other piece then. Come on, four seconds. Yeah, we got this in the bag. No! Oh, so close. Come on, fall faster! Whoa! Ah, so close. This might be it. Yeah! Oh, by the skin of our teeth. I do not recall ever seeing a faster time than that. Congratulations. You showed them that you have the courage to surpass them all. Uh, that's it. I mean, I got the glide mask now. I just look like steampunk decidui. I'm heading over to the Great Plateau because uh, you guys told me there's something waiting for me here don't really know what it is, so I'm gonna have to look around a little bit. There's a chest up there, though. I feel like I can't walk in this mud. I'm gonna have to... Yep, no, I can't. Fine, we'll just use the power of really long bridge and really low frame rate. That'll do it. Nice and easy. In here, anyway. What don't they want me to get? Some bomb flowers? I don't know why my brain didn't think, like, earlier in the game, hey... I should go check out the Great Plateau. You know, that place where all of this started out? Here's where the old man was. I'm gonna try lighting this and see what happens. Maybe a Korok will show up or a ghost of an old man. Huh, nothing? Okay. Look at this. Look, real nostalgic. Check it out, fellas. This is where I grew up. This is my old stomping grounds. All right, let's check out the Cave of Awakening and that, oh, the Shrine of Resurrection, whatever the hell it was called. There's nothing here? Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, are we stumbling into a Yiga house? Danger? What danger? If we touch the bananas. <laughs> the noble swordsman scrounging for scraps? You fell for the oldest trick in the book. You stumbled into our secret storehouse for treasures from the depths. And now that you've seen it, I can't let you live. Your life ends... Is it... Ma Please be Master Koga. No, I'm just a regular Yiga clan member? Oh, wait, what's this? Hello. Oh, there's gonna be a shrine here maybe i have something for you but i don't think you're ready to receive it 
Please visit the great abandoned central mine in the depths. Return here after. Well, I'm not going to do that right now. But at some point in the future, now I have to. All right, let's uh, go light this Yiga crap on fire. It's clearly something behind it. Oh, there we go. Oh, a chest. I thought it was going to be like something else back there. The Eightfold long blade. All right, aside from that uh, that quest line that starts in the depths, the only other place I can think to check is probably the Temple of Time ruins. I mean, there's gotta be something in here, right? Because, oh look, they're all here. Hello. Remember me? I don't have any of those uh, orbs anymore. I am trapped under the water behind the stone gate of the Great Plateau. Behind the stone gate of the Great Plateau? Under the water. I have to reach my friend. Yeah, not now. I have to save an inanimate object. The hell am I supposed to do this? Is that a shrine? No, it's not a shrine. Oh, that's the statue. Wait, no, it's not. Where is this thing? Oh, wait, I see, I see, I see. I'm just gonna use my buddy Yonobo to unclog the dam. Is this a goddamn? Oh my, oh, wait, I didn't even see this. I dedicate this monument to the memory of the souls lost to the calamity. Zelda. So sad. Oh, look at all the fishies. Okay, here is you who hear my voice. Get me out of here! Come to me in the Temple of Time ruins up the road to the... Oh, you were there already. I gotta go back now. You who hear my voice. Whoo! I can breathe again. I speak to you now from the depths below the guise of this deck. Okay. I have to go down to the depths now. I have to do four things in the depths. Each has one of my eyes nearby. Drop them into the chasms. Then deliver the stones to me who dwells in the depths below this temple. Do all of this and a reward will be yours. No. All right, we're gonna hit up that quest line later. Right now, I gotta talk to Pora. Yeah. Linky, I heard what happened. Hmm. The major cold front that descended upon the Rito and the marbled rock roast that the Gorons couldn't get enough of, then the sludge contaminating the Zora's water, and finally the Gerudo menaced by Gibdos in a sand shroud. You face some serious challenges. You overcame all of them. Well done. So, the person resembling Princess Zelda was behind the scenes for all of the phenomena, as you discovered. This has to be related to the upheaval somehow. And I want to share something important. Uh, okay, it's a blood moon. Can we wait a little bit? What is, what is, this? is this like a, are we, are we going to shoot like a giant hook to the uh, floating castle and just pull it down? Uh, isn't that? Hang on. Oh, it's a giant telescope. Link, look at this. Take a look. Quickly. Oh, she's up there. She's been up there the whole time. Well, little do you know, that's not actually her, because she's a dragon. So I don't know if I did the quest out of order. Oh, that was the fastest blood moon ever. Oh, and she's gone. Did you see that? That was the princess, wasn't it? Bora, sit down. There's something I got to tell you. The soldiers and I can't reach Hyrule Castle as it is now. Oh, I'll just, I'll just glide out of the sky. No big deal. It's just like that movie. Hal's floating castle, moving castle, whatever. I haven't seen it. I mean, I could go down there or I could just like glide up to the front door and be like, hey, I'm here. Zelda or whoever. I am waiting, waiting for you. I mean, there's no way we're fighting Ganondorf right now. Right? Oh, you're not even, you're not even in the castle. You're in the guest house, right? I'm here and you're ghosting me. Oh God. Monster forces. Oh, I'm getting jumped. Get out of there. Hang on. You didn't let me put on any of my cool stuff. All right now that I know that's happening, I'm just going to spin to win. I got hit so hard. Oh, wait. I dropped my weapon. Pick that up. That thing. That th oh, okay. Now it's broken. It's funny because this was really easy, but I just got clobbered in one hit. Ooh, boss macoblin guts. Extra gross. Okay, so I did that. That wasn't you. Oh, you're here now, huh? Man, you guys are gonna need to really power wash this place when you get it back. You know what? That ought to be the next uh, DLC they do for power washing simulator. They did a SpongeBob one. Let's wash Hyrule Castle next. This this is where we fought him. This is where it all went down. You got a quick trip down memory lane. Don't mind me. We got a big man here. Oh, you guys ain't so tough. They're just out here cooking fish and. Okay, maybe you're a little bit tough. Oh, there's a shrine here. Probably unlock that, right? Imagine Zelda says, hey, come save me. And I'm like, yeah, hang on. Let me finish my Sudoku first. The way up. Today's video is brought to you by the letter L. Or, or maybe it's supposed to go the other way, but either way, it works. What a fancy crap do they want me to do here? Is that not enough? 
I won't be able to reach. Okay. Watch this magic. Again? No clue if this is what I have to do. Oh. I go. Okay. Wait. Do over. Can I really not lift that high enough? All right, fine. You know what? Tried to do it your way. Now we're going to do it my way. And that's that. This is actually a really cool dungeon. I mean, it's not really riddled with enemies. I feel like there would be more. It's probably just mostly puzzles. All right, in the, uh, yep. I just, as I said, not riddled with enemies. Here we go. We got the choo-choo of every flavor here. <laughs> uh, buddy, that probably hurts. Don't do that. But we just auto-saved as we have to fight. Oh, yucky. I have to electrocute them. Where, where are you when I actually need you? Get back here. There's got to be a hive or something somewhere. Or I guess I just have to fight some of them. The, the one time. There we go. I actually need her. There we go. Take a bath. The, hor the Horriblins pack a punch. Just look like deranged Rillabooms. I have made two Pokemon references in the last 15 minutes. I like this axe because, like, this specific axe in particular just looks like the two-handed axe that I used to use in Ultima Online. Ah! Oh, oh, damn. Oh, my God. Sorry about that. You guys are going to die pretty easy. Can you stop torching me? Turns out the real dungeon were the monsters that we slayed along the way. Castle, it's more like a maze. It's a good dungeon, though. Like, I feel like there's probably some kind... Here it is. Here's the entrance. That's it. That's what we've been waiting for. These are the... Oh, my God. I saw only the ice keys. I was like, that's it? Oh, oh, can you not fit in here? Well, that's sad. I'll just hit you with everything I got safely from in here. All right, now I'm going to enter from down here. How far do I have to chase you? The enemies, they're getting increasingly tougher. Is there anything behind me? Okay, no. We just deal with the like-likes then. <laughs> More like the dislike-likes. Is that because I don't like them? Stop it. Get some help. Hey, last one. Can I just, like, ascend back up to the top now? That would be convenient, right? All right, who's waiting for us in the sanctum? Oh, Ganondorf, are you here? At huh? last. Oh, it wasn't a trick. I have been waiting for you to arrive. But... But you're a dragon. No. You're not Zelda. There's no way. There is something here I want to show you. Hyrule Castle. Perfect and glorious. Yeah, no, it, lo it used to look real nice before the, uh, the renovations. Look at Link the with the Korok mask. Of our time here. Well, really take in every detail. After all, this place... This place is... Will be the last thing where you see. die. Ooh. It's Ganondorf, but he's not hot yet. Did my puppet entertain you? She made it so easy to mislead you. To keep you occupied. Just had a Zelda marionette. That's not weird. Ooh, what are you? Phantom Ganon. There's no way this is the last boss fight, right? Because we have a whole ass another sage to go after. Oh my god, you hurt though. Oh boy. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Am I not strong enough for this fight? Ow! Yo, everyone's like fighting their own. Can I get some help here? Let's maybe... No, that didn't do much. You know what? I'll just... I'll just have to resort to traditional battle. Okay, that's one. Who's next? Come on. Okay, they travel so slow, I need to be a little more patient. Okay, that's two. Ooh, what are you dropping? A gloom sword. Give me that. Demon King bow. This is not as hard as I thought it was going to be. I guess if you just, like, take one out at a time. These weapons are too good to not take. Hey, another one down. That wasn't his full health bar, so... Yeah, that's right. Come on. Come on back. It's like, if you strike me down, I multiply. 
what's next? Oh, come on, you ain't so tough. You spilled a lot of gloom on the floor, though. Not crazy about that. Ow. Okay, come on, hang in there. Let's not die now. Eat your veggies, Link. Come on, last one. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! It seems there is more to you than the power Rauru has gifted. But not much more. That's what you think. Oh, my homie's got me! Just when you thought! Link, we are here! So, this is the power of friendship. As a big ass mummy. Those who carry the secret stones. The secret stones! Just what is this thing? You do not recognize me. Perhaps there are limits to the knowledge. You don't recognize me. You know, because there's been more than one evil Gerudo who has uh, tried to take over Hyrule. You know, because this happens all the time. Damn. I've asked the question before, but I'm going to ask it again. Is this the most terrifying that Ganondorf has ever been? In terms of, like, raw power. Like, look at him! He's like, all right, I gotta go now, but I'll see you later. All the new sages and the guy wearing the leaf on his face. He must not be at his full strength. Yeah, he does look like Otherwise, an old ass man. Why flee instead of finishing us off? We should return to Lookout Landing and decide what to do next. He had to leave because he was late for his uh, AARP you meeting. Should come too. Oh, we're gonna get a, a heart container for that? You know, it was a treat. All right, so we didn't quite defeat Ganondorf just yet, but we definitely defeated Old Manondorf. <laughs> Wait, look look at his goofy little head. That means there's a Korok nearby. Where? I, I don't know. Or maybe they want us to... Okay, we'll come back and help you. No, I should do it now. Do the things that you don't want to do when you don't want to do them. That's how you become not lazy. Don't worry, Mr. President. I will help you. Try letting go. In the name of President Hudson, it will not fall over. See? Oh, some veggie rice balls. Nice. All right, let's get up there fast. I'm back. Welcome back. Looks like it was pretty tough. How'd it go? But with Princess Zelda in the past, we can't ask her what the plan is supposed to be. I mean, she's not really in the past. What do we do now? We have no leads. Oh, wait. You said there were six sages with... King Rauru when he fought against the Demon King. Wind, fire, water, lightning, and heart. Hmm. And together we form... Captain Potter! That's it! There was one more sage back then. Oh, it was Minoru. Maybe the remaining sage is in a similar location. That makes sense. We should search major ruins from the Age of Legends. Everyone's relying on you. Don't let us down. Well, that doesn't make me feel any pressure at all. All right, find the fifth sage. All right, so who do I have to talk to here? Link? It's been some time. Just gonna keep doing this every time uh, I talk to someone oh. new. Uh, I suppose you haven't heard. The former chief, Lady Impa, retired. Now Lady Paya is the chief of Kakariko Village. Lady Paya is ignoring her responsibilities. She won't listen to anything I say. All these ring ruins have her full attention. Uh, Even now, she's under one of the ring ruins with the Zonai survey team. That ruin over there. Oh yeah, I will definitely go remind her of her responsibilities and have nothing to do with this at all. These ring ruins are the most intriguing ruins I've researched, especially this one. The way part of it floats up there. All right, I'm here. I'll figure out the puzzle for you. Don't worry. Is that you, Master Link? I'm so happy that I get to see you again. Yeah, listen, you see, I'm trying to find the fifth sage and I think it has something to do with this. But no one's allowed to go near the ring ruin, no matter what. Thoral looks like a One Piece character. It's clear that the interior of this ring ruin is hollow. Sadly, it doesn't seem to be an entrance. 
Look, just made to be ascended. All right, there's the slab. I get it, I get it. Pixar, it never happened, am I right? Did you go inside the floating ring ruin? Yes, I did. Look at this picture. Look at this photograph. Promise, Zelda, solemnly signed, Minoru, Sage of, hide the key, Southeast, and trust. I'm just paraphrasing. Southeast and Minoru. So no. That's where I gotta go, and that's who I'm looking for. There's a site in Farron that has long been known as the Zonai Ruins. Well, if the shoe fits, that's where we're headed. The Zonai Ruins in Farron. Oh, here he is. Hmm, interesting. Uh, you came after all. Figured you would after you made that breakthrough with the Ring Ruins. Listen to this. I've already got a whopper of a discovery on my hook here. Look at this. The Zonai Mural, complete with intact text. The style is unmistakable. Aww. Maybe it's a poem? Or a code of some kind? Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. But seriously, it says, wear the electric garb hidden at long neck dragons along the wide mouth forest serpent. What, what does this even mean? Offer a Zonai charge to the altar at the tail. One other thing that I'm curious about. I mentioned this, but I found one more Zonai relic at the back of these ruins. Oh, it's just a chest. I'll open it. I'll, I'll take care of it. You don't need to worry about that. That's garbage. Charged shirt. That's exactly what I have to wear. Yep, that's it. You see, I'm cosplaying as the mural guy. Maybe there are other treasure chests containing the rest of the garments. Problem is, searching Aww. for the treasure chests without a plan is a long shot. All right, so I guess I got to find the rest of the pieces, which got to be around here. All right, I'm just going to follow the... Uh... Oh, dude, he's hit by lightning. If I wear this and I get hit by lightning, like, do I become He-Man? Ow. Oh, has to be another piece. Oh, the pants. The charged pants are just like capris. This just looks like something Guy Fieri would wear. Another entrance, like right next to each other. Whoever hid these, they didn't hide them very well. And the charged headdress. I look insane. Here's another entrance. Okay, here's the altar. I'm gonna take one Zonai charge, please. Place it right here. Oh, it's working. Something's happening. All right, we have to do, I think the other one. Or maybe there's one more. They're all lighting up. Okay, oh damn. That was cool. Oh, Yo, did you see that? Lightning struck the dragon pillar too. A mechanism in the ancient ruins got rid of the thunder clouds and revealed some new sky islands? Mm. Great catch, another amazing discovery on the books. In fact, I'd say, it's the hall of the century. Elf's like, stop trying to make hall of the century a thing. It's never gonna be a thing. Listen, I did it. I got my unicorn horn and I turned on the lightning rod. He's like, but now I need you to go up to the Sky Islands because I can't do it myself. All right, let's head over to the Thunderhead Isles because I can actually land on them now. Although there's still a, a cloud over them. Are they going to be slippery? Yeah, I don't know. It's still raining. I don't know what you want me to do here. Do I, like, I guess I salute the sun, maybe? Praise, praise, praise the sun. I honestly think my favorite part of this game or my favorite new part of this game is dying. All right, we're just gonna sneak around this construct. Mighty Zonite Spear. Gotta do something over here. What is this? Watch it be like, hit this with lightning. I can do that. That's it. Oh, I see. You can do that again. Read you, thank you. What do you have? You're gonna kill me, aren't you? Oh God, why is everyone here so strong? Oh, I'm gonna have to make a mine cart here. Oh God, yeah, that, that will conduct electricity and kill everybody. What if I put a piece of wood on top of it? Will that protect it? That's probably good, right? The lightning can't see the metal now. All right, work. But more importantly, don't get me hit by lightning. Oh, there's another uh, another thing over there. But I don't know if I dare. Oh, there's a shrine here, cool. Gonna need that. Come on, give me the shoulder, die. Okay, let's make sure I have a send ready. I have to send into here. Here we go. Joku Usen Shrine. Oh, of course it's one of these proving ground shrines. I gotta do everything naked. This one looks difficult. And you guys look like you can really hurt me. Give me that stuff. Oh, what's the matter, you got nothing? Actually, you guys are kinda weak. If I have shock fruit, fire in the hole. That did nothing. Oh, I want that. Give me that item. Shock emitter club now. <laughs> it's like, oh no, I dropped my stuff. Got a bow. Look at this, I'm like a Nintendo John Wick. I actually, uh, I have quite a horrible confession to make, and that is, I have never seen any of the John Wick movies. I know. One day, I'm just gonna binge every John Wick movie in a row. Today is not that day. I have to do something here. Jump. 
Well, if you insist. Rag in the head island. Oh, yeah, we gotta go in uh, the rings here, right? Oh, that's not a ring. That's a. Oh! I was like, wait a second. That's a shrine. This, uh. Oh, it's a freebie. Love me some Rauru's blessings. All right, now that there's no more lightning, I can have all my weapons out. That's right, this is not a blade. Because there's something attached to it. Oh, we got another one of these doors. Should we be able to do this, right? I have enough hearts and stamina. What if I don't? No, really, what if I don't? Please, it hurts. Oh, no, I got plenty. I'm good. Okay, wait. Just go, 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 go. Uh, what is this? It's scanning my information and sending it to the Hylian government. Cause could you please not? Whoa. What is... What happened? Link, Zelda's chosen protector. Yeah, that's me. Take this. Follow the light. Guidance from ages past. I don't, I don't even know what this thing is. Oh, oh, damn it. How do I... Oh, I was gonna say, there's gotta be something I can ride because... Oh, good. I could just affix it to the front. Like a cool hood ornament. I don't know where I'm going. I guess some temple down there. It, it might take us back to the Zonai ruins. Um... You know what? It's fine, I'll find it. Oh, here we go. This is this a door? What do I gotta do here? Maybe I gotta make him kiss. Mwah! Mwah! Oh, okay. <laughs> Whatever. Dude, what? This game is getting crazier and crazier. Where am I going now? Some secret fourth layer? Well, we picked this back up, so I guess we have to take this with us. Tobio's Hollow Chasm. Not over here. It'd be funny if I lost this thing. It might just respawn up, uh... On the Sky Island, though. It's a giant elevator. All right, I guess into the depths we go. At least we have a nice ride going down, though. We don't just have to free fall. Link. Link, yeah. Who is it? Zelda's chosen protector. It's Minoru, right? You must hurry. We must meet as soon as possible. Don't worry, Minoru. I'm on my way. Where the hell are we? I mean, we're in the depths, but what is this? <laughs> This must be where we get the fifth stage. The Construct Factory. This is where they make all of them. Okay, I have to, oh wait. Oh, that, that's definitely not what to do. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Okay, there's, there's missing pieces. So I assume I'm gonna have to get the other four pieces somewhere. Link, Zelda's chosen protector. You, you don't have to keep calling me that. I, I know what my job is. I know what my role is on this earth. My name is Minoru. I am the Sage of Spirit. I am happy you have arrived. At last, we can speak with each other. Talking to like a toddler's puzzle. My daughter has like I six no puzzles like this. Body. None of them are the Sage of Spirit, Without though. Physical they were sold out. We cannot yet speak face to face. Assemble a body for me. I'm on it. I will assemble the best body in the history of bodies. Time to gather the limbs so we can summon Exodia. We just ascend through this. Man, I can't believe we're coming to the end of this game. I mean, it's not the end because there's so much to do, but like content purposes, it's probably the end. At least until DLC comes out. And then, you know, we return after a year. The Left Leg Depot. <laughs> the Left Leg Depot kind of sounds like an outlet. Come on down to the Left Leg Depot. We have the best prices around on all your left legs. That's gotta go up. Gotta, gotta bring... Oh, no, don't take pictures of the left leg. The FBI will be looking for you. Uh, yes, yeah, second floor, please. Whoa! What will this turn on? Oh, I have to... Go. I don't know what they really want me to do. I have everything at my disposal, but I am confused. I probably need to transport the box up. Up there, maybe if I... I, I know what I have to do, kind of. Look, there's rockets nearby. I got some wheels. I gotta, like, weekends at Bernie's this shit. Honestly? Not bad. So let's get a little more height. That's gotta be it. All right, will it make it? I feel like a kid again, and I'm trying to get my Hot Wheels to make it, like, through the loop. They always looks better on TV. Blasting cars that glow in the dark. Okay, don't blow out. All right, we got that over here. Oh, if I put it on a wheel, maybe? It would kind of just roll over there. Okay, hang on. It's kind of fun. Strapping your friend's body parts to rocket cars. I'm Link, and this is Jackass. Bye. All right, we got one of the pieces here. What do I do now? There we go. This is a leg. If I've ever seen one. Boom, straight from the left leg depot. That's one. 
Bring the other three here as well, Link. Sorry, I don't have a gift receipt. You can't return it. All right, here we go to the right wing. Wasn't that a TV show? Left wing? It was one of the wings. All right, we're in the right arm depot now. Got to figure out the limb puzzles. Bro, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm just hoping this is going to work. I mean, in theory, it's gotta, right? Look at that. I'm building a warship here. Ah, who needs steering? Hey, it worked! They said I was crazy. They said it couldn't be done. Well, who's laughing now? All right, this thing was not meant to fly, but we're gonna make it. Actually, actually, a little tough to control, but we're making it work. Here's the kingdom where you can have it your way. That's one arm. Gotta get one more arm and a leg. Though this should be uh, the right leg depot. My calculations are correct. Oh, just kidding. This is the left arm depot. I think this here does something. Ah, it's the open door. Cool. Okay. They're teaching us something right now. Oh, they got lava here. I probably won't be able to cheese my way through this. Or, hear me out, maybe I can. If that falls... Oh, no, don't burn, don't burn, don't burn. Oh, the smell of burning flesh stinks. All right, so now that I did that just as the game intended, how am I going to do this? What if I put this over here? Oh, wait, that does work. Come back. Oh, no. Now that we know it works, I have a huge brain. Okay, um, where are we going next? Oh, use it to open the door. Wait, wait a second. Maybe this has to pull away? Uh, I mean, that works too? Honestly, better than FedEx. You ever see how they deliver packages? Oh shit, no, get on it! <laughs> no! <laughs> Okay. Okay, that seemed a little excessive. I probably could have just walked this thing over here. But it's just fun to build contraptions in low FPS. All right, only one piece to go. Unless we just want to make her like a pirate. We'll get her a peg leg or something. You know what? I'm going to try something reckless. This game is built on being reckless. All right, this is either going to get me killed or it's going to be awesome. Here we go. <laughs> like when a kid says, watch this. And then they just get hurt. Ah, uh, yes, the forbidden vending machine. I feel like having to move this body part around should be to the tune of Yakety Sax. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Oh, look, finally, we're actually supposed to use the wing here. Oh, don't leave without me. Done. All right, what kind of body are we working with here? Oh, I get it now. Is the last sage like a mech? Oh, no way. Boom. Knack, baby. It's no, like the robots that you can pilot nice. in Mega Man X. You know which ones I'm talking about. We must recover my secret stone. Up on my back. We're going to Iron Giant this shit. Oh my god, this is so sick. All right, let's see. Guard, left hand. Oh, we're just playing arms now. Back part? What does that mean, back part? An attach. I assume I can throw, like, a sword on this. Let's see, what are we working with here? An iron spiked ball? Yeah, uh, what's this? I got a laser. Hang on, I want to attach. Oh, I want the flame emitter. I cannot be messed with. They put a freaking bionicle in the game. All right, now to test my abilities on these poor defenseless macoblins. Get out of here! Burn! Fear my giant robot! Bite my shiny metal ass! I am now realizing that I have. Oh, ow! Yo, maybe, uh, attack? I'm realizing I have no gloom meals. Let me go turn on the nightlight over here, which I've kind of been neglecting for a little while. It might help a little bit. Ah, uh, yeah, give me that vitamin D. We're a little slow. Can I maybe, like, can I fuse the fan to my back? Oh my god. It makes her do the Ed, Ed, and Eddie run. Oh, I guess I could probably just walk around this because I'm a robot and I can do as I please. I think I have a new favorite sage now, and it's clearly the robot, or as Dr. Zoidberg says, the robot. Speaking of robots and attaching things to their hands, there was a game where you kind of make your own robots and you can select two weapons to put on their hands. And every time, it's kind of like Mega Man, but more of an arena fighter. And every time you defeat a new robot, you get their power, you know, like Mega Man. It was called a Robo Pit. They made a second one, but I don't think I ever played the second one. It was for the PlayStation 1, and I still have my copy. 
God, do I love that game. There is the final stone. I feel like I'm about to be greeted with a boss fight that I'm gonna have to fight in my mech, and that's awesome. I'm waiting for a gate to close, or a cutscene to trigger, or both. Oh, it's barbed wire. We, we're probably gonna have to fight mankind. Dude loves barbed wire. That construct, I made it long ago. Uh, oh, why? Was this supposed to be the one that you were gonna? It must be under the control of something monstrous. Okay, uh, we'll beat its ass. Seized construct. I didn't know there were gonna be giant robot fights. He's much bigger than us. Oh, okay, you. So you're gonna guard that? Nope. Come on, give him the hands. Rock 'em, sock 'em, robots. Oh, okay, all right. Come on, you piece of junk. Oh, what? Give him the old three piece. Good thing we have good defense. Wait, I'm running out of stuff. I'm gonna need to. Oh no! Ow! Uh, I'm gonna. What are you doing? Keep that away from me. The trick here is to just be patient, which I am not. Which is what gets me killed in most fights. Um, is he gonna like freeze a transform? Oh, you get more arms. That's that's fair. I gotta fight General Grievous now. You built this construct. Why didn't we use this one? Ooh, that was close. All right, we got this. I should absolutely take that fan so I can move. What are you doing now? You got a big laser, don't you? Shit. There we go. There's only room for one giant robot. Actually, there's more than enough room for one. In fact, having two giant robots would be cool, but you're evil, so you gotta die. I don't make the rules. Now we can get the final shrimp to complete our order. Man, nobody told me the last sage was going to be the coolest one. I mean, people in the comment section spoiled it and said it was going to be Minoru. Huh? Where are we? Zelda asked me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit and one of the Zonai, Minoru. Nice. So do we get her in this form now, or do we just have a giant robot following us around the whole time? I am glad to meet you, Link. I must thank you. She looks like Beerus. because of you that we have recovered my secret We stone. basically got God of Destruction Beerus on our side now. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Poripad, then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept. And I am grateful for all your efforts. In the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. Getting chills right now. The music's real good. We're coming up on the final boss fight. Final stone. Now we have a uh -huh. ghost robot. Hey, this is starting to feel pretty good. I apologize our meeting has been so long delayed. Demon King's interference is to blame. Our fight appeared all but lost. Are we finally going to see the fight? And then, Rauru. Rauru sealed him, but I want to see. <laughs> is he going to do the Mafuba? He committed himself to one final act. Like Master Roshi? <laughs> Ooh, okay. Everyone's going all out. They know this is it. Zelda's going to bring him back. He's like, where'd he go? That pride will be your downfall, Ganondorf. Oh, shit. Yo, let's go! <gasps> no way! That was so sick! And you know Ganondorf's like, I'm not going down unless they take you with me, right? so smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. Uh, Rauru! Rauru quickly <laughs> rising the ranks of my favorite Zelda characters. 
you're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Remember this name. Shit. Link. Like, I've heard that name before. I mean, depending on where this is in the timeline. Then they turned to stone, and he became a shrine. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes, but more importantly, in my original time... The Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of this sword. Then, what exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? Over time, the Master Sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself, and even grow stronger. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. It could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields... Oh, we got time. Link's not going to be born for a while. I do not see how this can be done. It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so long. I'll just become a dragon. Here, watch this. I can think of one way. Then I'll stick it in my head. You mean... Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you. That act I've is told you. Do not eat the stones. Reason. It would mean throwing yourself away. <laughs> <laughs> they don't even taste very good. You guys are weird. You won't be able to change back. Nonsense. Plot armor will allow us to do that at the end. The moment Probably. I had the sword, I knew what to do. I knew this was why I came to this era. I want to restore the Master Sword and deliver it to Link. Very well, then. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I, too will devote myself to this goal and to this hero of yours. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. You already have in hand the hope that Zelda left to you. The sword that seals the darkness. The Master Sword. Go now, Link. With the sword of hope that Zelda left to you, will surely smite Demon King Ganondorf. Probably gonna take me a few tries, though. I got my ass beat by a bunch of connects. Alright, where to? Back to Lookout Landing. Good, let's get out of the depths. I've been here for too long. Need some sunlight on my skin. Well, did you find anything out about the fifth sage? You want to meet her? What? New objective, destroy Ganondorf. All right, let's talk to Josha because she would know where Ganondorf is, right? Each figure is pointed toward the next one in the series. Oh, this is going to be confusing. Till it ends with the last statue facing a destination, a final destination, building that looks like a temple. Also, see those large ears on the figure at the door of the building? That's got to be one of the Zonai. Want you to find the... Okay, I got to go down and look for this. So I gathered a bunch of bright blooms and supplies. Oh, please give them to me. I have none. But then they pulled the kid card on me and said I couldn't go into the depth. So, 10 whole bright blooms. 10 whole arrows. Yeah, I'm going to have to do some preparing on my own. All right, where is this scum? I mean, he was up in the castle last time, so he's probably under the castle. In the depths, under the castle. He's around the castle. He's got to be. Can I not open the door? I, I got to go around. I feel like opening the door would have been a nice gesture. I mean, he said he couldn't wait to meet me. That seems very chaz me. I mean, this is like the middle. Oh, yeah, this has to be it. Uh, okay, <laughs> where can I land? I have some gloom meals, but I, like, I don't want to eat them now. I can't see anything. Oh, good. It's lighting up, and there is a light root over here. Oh, we're going to need a lot more than that. Gloom's approach. Now, this seems like something. Oh, I can just go further down. This cockroach is going to be at the very bottom. I feel like I'm pretty well prepared. Oh, wait. D oh, Jesus Christ. Are you kidding? I don't know if I could fight a Gloom Lionel. Oh, definitely not. I do feel like I should probably try to take him down, though. Yo! Yo! I should... You know what? I need something that's going to hit hard. Oh, that's... That's hurting me. And that really hurt me. You know what? I can't back down from a fight. I'm not even touching him. Oh, God. 
Oh god. Oh god. All right. Never mind. He's shooting arrows up at me. Hank, wait a second. I got a giant mech. Oh, you want to throw hands? Okay, giant mech doesn't matter. You know what? Let's um try going this way first. You know what the sad part is? Like, that's probably only the beginning of it. They're gonna throw like four Lionel at me at the same time. I just think I would do better against Ganondorf. Fought a lot of Ganondorfs before. Keep touching the gloom. Okay, really though, where am I? <laughs> am I going the right way? Oh, wait a second. Hold the phone. Hold on. I didn't think to possibly, okay. This seems right now. I was like, I'm stuck. Where the hell am I supposed to go? I had to rewind some of the debris. This is the depths of the depths. This is not your ordinary everyday depths. This is advanced depths. Something's happening. Power of a sage cannot reach you. Do I just not get sage help down here? Cause that would suck. Never saw that before. Link really jumped so far into the depths that he doesn't get any service down here. Oh my God. Oh God, I, I really wish I had some help down here. All right, lure him away. I, I'm like, I'm all gloomed out. I can't even heal. Right, that's one. What if I, uh, if I bomb you and I huff shroom you? Then I'll be able to at least get a sneak attack in. Might have been the move, honestly. Oh God. Okay, nope. Don't want that to happen. I don't know what's down there. What What's waiting for me down there? Yeah. Nope. So we're gonna build, and we're gonna build fast. I think the most embarrassing thing I could do right now is like accidentally step on the gloom and die. I'm just hoping that there's like a light route somewhere. Okay, we are out of battery. Ah, shit. I'm fighting for my life right now. Oh God, yeah, I'm dead. They spawned me down here. Oh, that's fucked up. A lot of stones and stuff here. I might have taken a shortcut. This feels like it was a shortcut. Yeah, I feel like I skipped a whole bunch of stuff. Can there be a light route somewhere down here? Otherwise, what I have to do is I have to recall out to the light route and then I have to just make my way back in. This is a long ass fight. Okay, you guys die easy. Damn, Gibdo. Ooh, disgusting. So I took all these gloom weapons and uh, I'm now realizing that they have gloom tolls. That was probably, in hindsight, not a great thing to do. I need also, like, some kind of hammer to destroy these dudes. That's, I'm out. I'm out. I'm like about to pull up on Ganondorf and I'm on death's doorstep. The gang's all here. There's gotta be a, somewhere to heal, right? I, I gotta eat the other gloom meal because I'm just gonna get destroyed. The imprisoning, okay, this is where it happened. This is where it's gonna go down. No way in hell. I'm gonna be able to get this done like this. Gloom's lair. Like the Pokemon? Is it torch? Maybe we need that. Maybe we don't. I don't know. Consider this the dry run. Let me tell you, before I went to high school, I knew I had to take a city bus to go there. So I did a dry run. And like a week before I started school, I took the bus to school to make sure I knew how to do it. And yep, this this is very final boss. This is sick. Is this just like straight up a gloom platform? All right, I'm here with one whole heart. You know, just to see if I can do it. Oh, God. Maybe it's a cutscene. Well, who's that? Who did that? Hell yeah! They're here! And not just the, uh, the ghosts. The actual sages. My goats. Finally. Now, can someone heal me? You know, Mifa, she healed me. I miss her. And now I will die immediately. Yeah, that's how I expected that to go. All the swords I have have gloom tolls, so I should probably not use them. But what I really should do is back out and actually prepare. The next day. All right, I went hunting, I went shopping, I went to Whole Foods. I'm prepared now. I got gloom meals. They call them unhappy meals down here. All right, I'm prepared for the gloom army this time. 
gonna just chop right through all of them. Ow, okay, maybe that's not a good idea. Ooh, got me. This big man's just chasing me around, but I kinda wanna take out the little guys first. Okay, that's a broken boat, it's fine. Take out another one. We don't miss a beat. Should I, I should use an attachment, right? Maybe a shock fruit, maybe just... Oh, I, <laughs> I whiffed it! Just like, come on. Back off, pal. Yo, he's... Yo, bro sidestepping. I wish the big dude would leave me alone. Get him, he's down. Kick him while he's down. Is this a cliff here? Can I push him off? Oh, shit! Yeah, he charged at me like Snorlax in new Pokemon Snap. One of the, the most terrifying moments of my life. Oh, there's more. All right, next round. Zalfos. This is the Demon King's army. This is the best he could do. The cool thing is I'm going to get a lot of supplies here in case I need anything. You know, they're dropping tails and, and balls. All right, here comes the aerial squadron. This track is lit, though. All right, I might need something a little more powerful. I would like... Let me try and fuse real fast if I can. Got this Lizalfos horn. Oh! Where'd it go? Where'd it go? There. Oh, there. Give Gibdo, I, I need something. I need a hammer. Or a club. Yeah, try it. Just kidding. That doesn't work. Okay. So what I need to do is... I need to use Dazzle Fruit. Dazzle Fruit will do it. Look, I'm just dropping it. Like World of Warcraft players to the sun. God, there's so many. This absolutely is a badass battle, though. Having to fight just like hundreds of monsters. I'm just gonna spin around. Ooh, that hurt. Okay, I'm gonna stay away from these guys. Right, where is. Bro, Yonobo, help me! Nope, one left. Alright, I think that's everybody. Unless there's like one ultra strong baddie that's about to come out. I mean, if we're being realistic here, Ganondorf is the ultra-strong baddie, am I right? I made him hot in this game. That gloom, it means but one thing, the Demon King. Huh? Yep, he's there. Sidon, look out! Oh, do we have to do a... a boss rush? Okay, no, we are gonna have to fight them. Unless it's just like a badass cutscene. How noble of you guys. I really thought we were going to have to do the entire boss rush. I was going to say, that'd be a little bit overkill, but... Oh, guys. You don't have to do this. Because all my friends just sacrificed themselves for me, I will eat my feelings. Come out, come out, wherever you are. How disappointing. He just has, like, this badass this gloom throne. Because he's old. He's like, you could find me in my chair. You're watching my stories. Loving cowards running rampant. It would have been more satisfying to overcome a worthy foe. Yeah, that's me. I am the worthy foe. All right, I'm preparing myself for what is probably going to be a very lengthy boss fight. Oh, he transformed. Bro is like All Might. Bro is just conserving energy in his skeleton form. He's like, hang on, let me transform. I will That is what a king must do. Real king energy. The menace to unleashed. Demon King Ganondorf. Again, kudos for casting Matt Mercer. Do not look away. <laughs> I want you to watch this. You witness a king's revival. And the birth of his new world. Yes, Daddy. All right, here we go. Oh, God. Okay, w what are your patterns, sir? Ow! I'm gonna die like round one. Okay! Let's see, if he goes overhead, I sidestep. He's gonna sw- I'm learning. He can flurry? He can flurry rush me to what?
The cool thing is I'll be back here every time. Oh, he's, he's got, like, glass bones and paper skin. Then again, so do I. Is that all? How about this? What the hell is that? Damn. Transforming weapons? Oh, no. Yeah, if he's gonna flurry rush me, I'll flurry rush him. I invented the flurry rush. Fall. See, all I needed was, like, just a couple turns just to figure out, like, what he's gonna do. That's why I died a few times. That's why. Oh, okay, all right. Yeah, you, you try it. I really thought I was gonna rush there, but... My timing's off. Ow! I mean, I guess instead of rushing, I can just wait for him to, to... Oh, okay. Thank you. I appreciate that. Boom. Right in the forehead. Isn't it kind of sad how I died? I'm probably one of the easier boss fights in the game. This bro is, like, slow as hell. He's got that smash ultimate speed. Why can you do that? All right, I'm going to round two with nothing. <laughs> What a feeling. Pain a and feeling. depression. I know it well. I'd almost forgotten the thrill of battle. That feeling as blood surges in my veins. Uh, he's getting off on I this, right? Safe to say that? The limits of my power. Is he about... Oh, for... Okay, this is the form that we know. I thought he was gonna just raging demon me. His health bar almost goes off the screen! Master of the Secret Stone. Sorry, I'm out of food! Wait, the homies are back! Just in time to watch me die. You know how I know I'm dumb? I went this entire fight without realizing that I didn't have a shield and I can just parry him! All right, can we keep these, uh, these clones away? That's the job of the others. Oh, shit. Okay, shield's broken. Okay, up we go. It's fine, I got plenty of arrows. Get a couple headshots in there. By a couple, I mean as many as I can muster. I, I think I was overthinking this. Just gotta get some good flurry rushes in there. And just avoid everyone else. Oh, there we go. That's another one. Alright, had to find my zone. My zone has been found. Patience, patience, Link. Patience. Not you. There we go. Ooh! So we only have to give him to half health. I guess this is the, this is the final arc here. What are you gonna do? One more transformation? To get rid of your expendables. Damn. My guy's powerful. Oh, bigger sword. Oh, we're going back to this? All right. 1v1, no problem. I can do that. Oh, you're gonna flurry rush me back. Well, I'll just... I'll also flurry rush. Oh, no. Okay! Can I block these? Oh, those... Okay, heart's gone. Oh, my God. Okay, I really need to get through this fast. I think I just need to parry, because he's flurry rushing my flurry rushes. Yeah, that, that's way better. This one's easier to dodge. You just kind of weave through these. All right, go on. Almost done. Take down that big-ass health bar. Okay, that knocked me down. So I had some iframes there. That would have hurt. And now I have no shield. I might need to cheese this if I can. Can, can you not? Can you not? Can you not? You know what sucks is I'm so close and I'm going to die. Or, or hear me out. Oh. I, I just don't think this is it, though. I don't think he's going down in this form. It's got to be more. Come on, like one more parry. Okay, is this it? No, one more, one more. Dodge. Okay, let's go! Ah! Stagger, bitch. No shot, he's done. How many forms do you have? Oh, he got his back blown out. I heard his last form is badass. So, time to find out. Is he... 
pull it, he pulled the stone, he's gonna eat it. Incoming Dragon Ganondorf. He endgame visioned himself. He's like, one bite. Gulp. How do I fight a giant dragon? Yeah, this is cool as hell. What the fuck, man? How am I supposed to fight this? Unless Dragon Zelda's gonna come in, and there's gonna be a dragon fight. Oh, we're taking this fight to the skies. Dude, that is the coolest form ever. Ganon has had some pretty cool forms over the years, but this is the one. I was going back to Swirl in the Castle, like the good old days. Demon Dragon. Draconified Demon King. He is terrifying. I'm stuck in his tooth. Listen, they say you're supposed to floss after every meal. Here she comes! I knew it was gonna happen! Is she going to... I thought she was gonna fly into his mouth for some reason. Like, intentionally. Alright, she caught me. If I don't got me, I know my dragon girls got me. Goosebumps right now. What an ending to this game. All right, this is crazy. So let's see. Oh, jump off. Okay. I don't know where I'm going. I mean, I would imagine on top of Ganondorf. I mean, on top of the demon dragon. I mean, is that what I have to hit? I don't even know if I can reach that. Right, let's just ride the dragon. Oh, it's got gloom eyeballs. That thing looks incredibly infected. All right, you know what? Let's reset. Ow! <laughs> I got whipped. Uh, Zelda, can you can you catch me, please? Can you can you? Thank you. It would be hilarious if I just like dove as hard as I could and I just died by crashing into the dragon. Link's like that doctor on the internet who pops all the pimples. Turns out Ganon just had a really bad case of acne. Don't worry, we'll get that out. I gotta say, after this, just like the entire game in general, I think Tears of the Kingdom has solidified itself in my top three. Number one will always be linked to the past for me. I think Tears might be number two, which would probably bump Ocarina of Time or Link's Awakening. All right, here we go. One more, I'm thinking. He's starting to glow. He's hurting. All right, where's the last one? On the... I see it. I see it. Music's getting intense. It, it's calling to me. I'm coming for you. I'm gonna put it right between the eyeballs, Link. Get! Ugh! What, what happens now? One final stab. Like, ahead, you do it. Final attack. Press the button. I got you. Love me a QTE. It's funny. You pull the sword from one dragon's head only to drive it into another. This whole thing is insane. Zelda's being petty about it. She's just, like, doing circles around him. I'm almost a little bit sad because now I know the game is over. At least the story's over. Now I can actually play the game and just explore. Because I'm pretty sure uh, I might have completed about 10%. God damn. Destroy Ganondorf complete. This whole shot is incredible. This whole cutscene. How do you top this? Like, what do you do next? I would imagine the next Zelda game is probably going to be a 2D Zelda. So they're going to want to make something. But how do you top this? Where'd my clothes go? 
Can we somehow transform Zelda back? She don't have to be a dragon forever. The internet's gonna get too weird with it. Oh yeah, my arm. Wait, what's happening here? The goats have returned. They're like, don't worry, Link, we're gonna help you. We're gonna change your back. Getting real full metal alchemisty here. Now, Link, you're gonna have to give up your alchemy if you want to save Zelda. I knew we weren't just gonna leave her as a dragon, just eternally circling Hyrule. the last we ever saw of them. Oh yeah, by the way, you're, you're falling out of the sky. You might wanna... Oh, this is your chance! You could catch her this time! This is your redemption arc! What if I don't catch her? What happens? I mean, I'm not gonna do that. Come on, Link, get her. Get her! All right, I'm here for you, babe. I got you. Come on, a little closer. Get it. I don't know if you can hear it, but that is me audibly clapping. At what a fantastic game. And my game of the year, at least until I finish Final Fantasy 16 and then I am torn apart. Uh, kind of hungry, actually. You, you want to order something? Burns like 19,000 calories fighting Demon King Ganondorf. I was... I reached you. After all. Oh, this whole thing? Yeah, I got it. Just pulled it out of your skull. He's gone. The Demon King. I'm not in a dream, right? Just pinch her. You did it. Oh, Link, you really did it. I had been sleeping all this time. But when I felt something, like a warm, loving embrace, I woke up. So does her castle just fly now? Because that's pretty cool. And that, everyone, is The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We will see you next time. That's right, we can't end this without wrapping the sage's stories. I never thought I would actually stand here again. This is only a theory, but... Raru's power of light, and Sonya's time power. For Zelda to transform back, they both must have channeled their abilities through you, Link. Oh, I see. Now it seems, it is my time. Those of us, gather here. Swear on our lives to support Princess Zelda and I. To support Princess Zelda and save her on the land of Hyrule. Minoru says, I must go. My time being a Megazord is now over. Oh no, that's so sad. Also, it took me a long time to build that. And now that is actually The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We'll see you next time.